Okay, there we go. I think we should be good. Okay, cool. Hey, Colonel Yikes, by the way, thank you for the five subs, man. Appreciate it, dude. It you get the first build of the night if you want it. Let me know, man. Let me know if you want anything. I will do it. I'll do it right away. I'll do it. Wait, which one's the right one? Not that one. There you go. That one. Colonel Yikes, let me know what you want. You get first build of the night. Thank you for the five subs. Gary B, thank you for the 20 months. Welcome back in. Appreciate you. Average Ash, thank you for the nine months. I said, hey, yo, mayo. Hey, you don't know me. You don't know me or my mayo. Thank you for the, thank you for the nine months. Welcome back. Cuisine, 73 months. That said, click no. Um, no, I don't think I will. I think I'll click yes, actually. Mm, no. Mm, no, I don't think I will. Mm, no. Um, my Christmas was good, though. I had a good Christmas. I didn't really do much of anything other than, like, hang out with people. That's really all I want to do, so it's fine. I didn't get anything, no. I didn't get anything, or I didn't get anybody else anything, which is exactly how I'd want it. I, I feel like I'm not all about the whole gift-giving thing on Christmas. Um... Uh, unless somebody told me they're getting me something and then I, you know, then I have to get them something. Otherwise, I'm a dick and then, it, then it's... Ending. But it's just like a necessary stress, right? Like, why not just get nobody nothing, you know? And that's what I did. So it's a lot better that way. Ah, I'd love a Christmas clown. Be your choice of perks and add-ons. Be as naughty or as nice as, you, as you'd like. Okay. 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 Sure. Is it bad that I kind of want to roll this 45k twins daily? I have a clown daily. I'm gonna, well, I'm gonna leave them all. It's fine. It's fine. Okay, we'll do Santa Clown too because it's festive. Even though Christmas is technically 364 days away, like, like, like technically speaking, we're like as far away from Christmas as you could ever possibly be right now. Like, it's literally 364 days away. So actually, maybe I shouldn't be festive. Maybe I should be something else. But this build's fine. I'm cool with this build. Have you seen the whale yet? The whale on these nuts. Do I have any challenges on killer? Probably not, right? I think I did every challenge. Yeah. Yeah. I, it'll do it. Yeah. We done that and there did every challenge. Yeah. yeah. Actually, it's a movie. No, I haven't seen it. Ashley Angel, 16 months. Welcome back. Hope we're doing well. Good to see you. Uh, Carrie B, thank you for the 20. Did I already thank you? Probably. Thank you again. Curly Axe, thank you for 100 bits. Um, I said 100 bits for you to shush. It's always Christmas. Yeah, maybe if you're Ralph. Motherfucker keeping his tree up fucking 24-7. All fucking, all, all goddamn months of the year, the psychopath. Hi, Bell. What up? Direct what up, man. Motherfucking crank. What up, dude? Good to see you, dude. The Whale was an interesting movie. I, I didn't even know it was a real movie. Is it literally about a whale? Yeet Yeeter, what up? Scrooge Music, thank you for the 18 months. Welcome back, buddy. Yo, happy holidays, man. What's up, Mac? No, no, not true, Mac. Not true. Hey, but nice Christmas day off yesterday? Yeah, man, it was nice and chill. All oh, the alerts are still off. I was like, why am I not hearing any of these subs? That's why, because there's no alerts. I turned them off for subs. Or sorry, for scrims. These are some pretty high prestigious, by the way. Yo, Shul Squids, welcome back. 10 months. Appreciate you, buddy. Thank you, man. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. Hope we're doing well. The whale is Brendan Fraser in a frat in, in, in a fat suit. Oh. Cool. Sounds great. I fucking scammed him. I fucking scammed him. And I'd do it again, too. I'd fucking do it again. Get your too. coffee yet? Yeah. Oh yeah. I'm sipping it. Cody Maker, thank you for the five subs. Thank you, buddy. Appreciate it, dude. Good to have you in, man. We're going to have all the new people in my end. Hey, you got a build. You got the next build. Let me know what you want. Cody Baker, thank you for the... Tw or the or I the fucking scammed Sorry, I already thanked you, but thank you for the five them. subs. Cody Baker, thank you for the five too. subs. I fucking do you it get, too. You get uh, a build as well. Let me know what you want, man. Let me know what you want. Also, hi, so Sarah. What up? It's cool, Mac. You're good. You're good, Mac. You can hang. What are you worried about, dude? Did you read 130 page guide on clown yet? Bro. That motherfucker made a 130 page guide. That's crazy. For a clown? Why? How? Like, how do you even get 130 pages out of clown? That's crazy to me. Like, that's actually wild. I, like, briefly looked at it. I literally looked at that before I went live today because I saw Scott, like, tweet about it or something. And I, like, took a brief look at it before going live today. I, like, the actual guide. And it's just nuts. He dedicates like multiple pages to like some perks. It's fucking wild, dude. Like that. I, I don't know. I don't know who that who that clown man is that made that guide. 
But I bet that guy's a lot like me. Because I'm definitely the type of motherfucker that can take like a, a two minute conversation and turn it into like a 30 minute conversation. You know what I mean? And he feels like probably the same. Because that was a long, it, feel, it felt like a very, un, that feels like a very unnecessarily long guide to me, you know? The medium bolt gate. No! She kind of looked like she was just freaking out. But it was calculated. He was being calculated. Hiya! You mean you have ADHD? Yeah, I guess. I was actually just farming her for another stack of flavor food, is what that was. Barry Bones, what up? Yeah, she'll squeeze. I said that I, I thought it was a D's nuts joke, but it turns out it's a real movie. I don't know what it is. Never seen it. Motherfucking gamers. Motherfucking gamers. Motherfucking gamers that went too far. You're fucking dead. You're going to dead. Hard me. Oh, you said I got you a Blu-ray of men for Christmas. Merry Christmas. Oh, that message. Oh, I wish I hadn't read that. I wish I had. I honestly was better off before I read that. I regret. No, my eyeballs. Bare bones, 100 bits. Thank you, man. Anyone that motherfucking snowman? My new year's resolution is to actually decide on a killer to sign up for for scrims. Hey, man, just sign up for whoever, dude. Whoever you feel like playing, you know? Fuck it. Who's who, though? This guy obsession? No. That's Steven. This is Quentin. Who can it be now? Boop, boo, doo, doo. No dead arm? Three subby wubby ooh. Hoggers. Kayla Coop, thank you for 11 months. Welcome back. Appreciate it, buddy. Thank you, thank you, thank you. How much how much glass does this man litter? It's disgusting. Yeah, it's what? Yeah, why do you think he's why do you think he's gonna uh, uh, been taken over by the entity? He's an evil, evil man. Litters like crazy. There's no saving him. He belongs here. Evil killer, you know? Evil killer of the environment. Who's here? Oh, 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 oh. Baba, oh, baba. Mega. That's not where I wanted it to go. Pain. What can it be now? Boop, 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 boop. You can't vault that pallet. Now you might throw this. Do, 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 do. No, she's smart and holds W. I hate it. I should have zoned her the other way, actually. That would have been smart. That would have been a smart thing to do. I should have zoned her towards the pallet that was up instead of giving her like the big wide open side. That would have been the intelligent play. Uh oh. Uh oh. Are you gonna dead hard? Doot, 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 doot. Bam. Um, what gen are they probably doing? I mean, they did that one. I guess this one. I guess the answer is this one right here. I think they're in a locker? Nope, nope, they went this way. Nope, it's Megan. Oh, I thought she would double vault. The patience of this lass. Oh, she gets that too. Or she doesn't. Okay. That was really weird. You probably should have just thrown it. You're dead. You're dead. You're fucking dead. You're super dead. You're really dead. Hi, Sangria. What up? I was just telling my husband I was sad. You weren't streaming. Hey, you know, I'm here. I'm here. That's just a little bit late. I was like an hour late today. I had some some stuff I had to do before stream. Oh, oh, oh! What's all this? I'm gonna get a blast mind again, dude. Ready? Ready? Oh, it didn't happen. Nice. 
I thought for sure that was. I thought for sure I, I was so sure it was happening. I don't believe you. Okay, well, I guess I should have believed you. Um, this gen maybe? No. Oh. Slow down there, ho diddly, relax. Can't vault this pallet now. Can't vault that pallet now. Well, she she vaulted that pallet now. She definitely vaulted that pallet now. Andrew, thank you for 145 bits. I said I miss old corn map when it was dark. Anyway, hi, bestie. Hi, Andrew, how are you? Yeah, I don't like the whole like super brightness of the corn map now. I'll be real with you. I mean, I'm never a fan of the, of the maps being like super bright. Oh, dude, this Steve, by the way, is like the stealthiest motherfucker in the world. And like, I'm not even mad about it. Like, he's, I'm getting so many stacks because I can't find this guy. It's kind of crazy. I'm literally swimming in stacks. But I do need to find him eventually because like, I think he's near this gen. I feel like he was there both. The Meg was there both times that Blast Mine went off, but I feel like he might have been too. Maybe not, though. Maybe I'm wrong. Dude, dude, dude. I thought the killer couldn't see Blast Mine. I know the survivors can see Blast Mine, but I didn't think killers could. Are you sure killers can see it? I'm pretty sure it's only survivors that can. I've heard, I, I've, I, well, that's what I've heard. I, I've not actually like tested it. I've just been told that only survivors can see it. How true that is, I mean, I don't know. I've not tested. Fuck, I think the Steve was there, dude. I'm telling you. Slow down there, brother. You can see the flashbang? Nah, killers can't see it. So you guys are giving me two different two, You guys are giving me different answers. I've tested it unless they patched it. Okay, I think I think this is gonna require some testing because now 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 I'm getting like it's like a literal 50-50 of answers. Like half the people are telling me one thing and half the people are telling me another thing. Which do I believe? Like I know as a survivor, I know for a fact you can see it as a survivor. Because I know like when you place it, you can see it get placed on top. And especially since you're just sitting there doing the gen, you kinda have all the time in the world to see it. There he is. There's the Steven. There's my little goober. Ah! Who's my little goober, Steven? Who is it, Steven? Is it you or are you my little goober? Who's my little goob? Where are you going? Okay, we got him. Hi, Morig. What up? Things are going good. How about you? Yo, motherfucker, Burzard. 21 months, man. Welcome back, dude. Like, I don't see a flashbang. Oh, wait. Oh, the gift blocks it. Oh, that's what you're saying about the gift. Oh, wait. Can you not see it? But, like, the gift is kind of where the where the flashbang goes. Wait, I might need to I might need to wait for it to not be the event. I feel like I feel like as long as it's the event, it might not be possible. These guys are some fucking stealthing Andersons, dude. No, my stacks. Not like this. Oh my god, I almost missed. I almost whiffed that. That would have been embarrassing. She didn't even throw it. She's insane. Oh, she went to Shaq. That's kind of psycho shit. She's fucking crazy, dude. She's the medium vault kid, brother. Oh, she's actually insane. She's actually insane. Her route running is good. What up, Kotal? What's up, man? Things are good. More lately, what up? Hope you had a fantabulous weekend. Thank you. My weekend was pretty fantabulous. Thank you. I want to go check on this generator. Just kidding. It sounds like it has like no progress. Okay, I actually want to go back and check on this generator then. 
Where's the other Meg? Oh, God. Or not the other Meg, the Quentin. Is it this gen? Is this one about to pop? Where's he been? What's he been doing? Uh oh. Yep. Yep. Fuck. I was gonna say, someone, someone has been missing for like a minute. Do you have hope? This bitch is fast. She's got hope, dude. She's running adrenaline and hope. All right, you win. You've won the end game. You are the end game winner. I can't. Nope. 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 You've won this end game. Congratulations. You are better than me. You are significantly faster than I anticipated. I will not catch you to this, this day. Come to King. What up? How you doing? Did I get some gas over here? No. Hey, Eva, what up? Goody through real, what up? What up, what up, what up? What it what it on hook stage? True, we got nine hook stages. Easy peasy. Do, 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 do. Laura Lately, what up? Hello, hello. How are you? Hi. I did have a fantastic. I did have a fantastic weekend. Hope you did as well. Uh, Corner Yikes gave 100. Or sorry, gave 200 bits. Yo, Tovers, this is kind of cheesy, but I just want to say thank you for making uh, the content you do and being such a chill person to watch and hang out. And, and or, or sorry, and hang out around. I remember when I first found you on YouTube a few years ago, and your videos got me through countless opening shifts, and always made me laugh. I feel like you and your content have come so far. You're seriously a great dude, and I hope you know how much we uh, how much we all appreciate you. Merry late Christmas. Yo, thank you, dude. Merry late Christmas to you, too. And, dude, thank you, man. That actually makes me really happy to hear. Like, again, like, seriously, like, the whole, like, Re helping you get through wubby tough shit woo. is, like, a big thing for me. Because, again, I've used streamers for the same thing in the past myself. So that makes me really happy to hear, man. I hope you're, like, doing better, though. Like, I hope life is, like, better for you, you know? But regardless, I appreciate you, man. Thank you for 200 bits. Thank you, thank you, thank you, dude. Did you see the odds clown video? No, I don't watch DVD content. I, 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 the answer to the answer to I, the answer to like, did I see any DVD video? The answer is always going to be no. Yeah, I feel you there, Cody Ice. I feel you there. I have constant shit going on all the time. I'm way too busy. I'm overwhelmed. So I feel you, dude. Lunar, what up? So, Sarah, my recovery is going good. My shoulder is, like, basically good now. It just, like, it still hurts in, like, certain certain movements, but it's mostly good. Things are pretty good. Side beating segment 34, by the way, man. Appreciate it, body. Billy, low pro chains, doom and greenings. Pentamento, throw the hunt, undying, crowd yeah. control. Okay. Pentamento. Throw the hunt. A dying crowd control. Okay. This is an interesting build. You're like really full committing to crowd control, huh? Like really, really, really full sending crowd control. And then if they break it, you just fall back with Tenemeno. Have you ever built it a moment? They either deal with windows being blocked and low pro through pallets or cleanse through thrill. Then then deal with Tenemeno. Huh. That's interesting. You're really putting them in a tough spot, huh? No, but you like flavored hot chocolate or plain? Uh ever had flavored hot what i thought hot chocolate was I already flavored scammed him is it not, is it not already him. flavored chocolate hey, do it again dude i'd fucking do it how again, do you get have flavored hot chocolate when it's already chocolate flavored right am i crazy two jet what up what happened to your shoulder i had surgery kind of i had like half surgery but then also they like stopped halfway through so i it was weird i don't know merry christmas tofu it's my boyfriend's birthday can you give him a shout out are you, but I don't I don't have a name though. Cloud Fox's boyfriend. Hi, happy birthday. That's all I can that's all I can do. I don't know his name. <laughs> I don't know his name. <laughs> Thank you for the bits. Yo, hope you guys a great birthday though. Hope you guys hope you guys have a good birthday together. I appreciate the bits. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Yo, Merry Christmas. Wait, your birthday is a day after Christmas? That's gotta be weird. Like what yo, what's that like as a kid? Do you just like do you get double presents? Or do your parents just give you one holiday worth of presents and they're like, there you go, that's enough for both. That might suck. 
If it was my parents, that would suck, because that's definitely what they would do. If it was my parents, they would totally, absolutely... You've definitely helped me through some rough shit. Appreciate it always to fool Be on. doing that. Ivy, thank you for the reset. Four months. Welcome back. And dude, thank you, man. It makes me happy to hear. And again, I'm sorry that you've been going through tough shit, but it makes me happy to hear. Thank you for the four months. Welcome back. He is nameless. He shall not. He who shall not be named. Okay. So, so very mysterious. So dark and mysterious. He who shall not be named. We shall not know thy name. Yo, Hux the Lux. Thank you for the five subs, by the way, dude. You get a build after. Well, actually, not after this one. After this one is um, Honey Ferret. Then after Honey Ferret, then it's you. So you get the build after the one after this. Yeah. 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 Have you tried Phasmophobia? I tried Phasma when it first came out. And it was fun, but I got bored of it quickly. They stopped your surgery halfway through? Yeah. There was more damage than they thought, so they had to stop it. And they got a... They had to stop it and then let me heal and then go back in later. Going to bed, and for Christmas, I got some earphones I can sleep with. Can't wait to try them out to fool up. Pog, dude. Julia, think of the nine months. Welcome back. Yo, hopefully they're comfy. Because, like, actually having, like, good comfy earphones to fall asleep to are fucking heavenly, dude. Thank you for the nine months. Good to be back. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Kids, what up, man? Oh, that's interesting, Courtney. That's an interesting way to look at it. Huh. You're like, huh, that Ferrari looks nice. And you know, it is it is my birthday and Christmas. So like, <laughs> you know, you've had, yeah, yeah, I, yeah. I basically had a partial surgery only. Yeah, like they basically like cut me up and they were like getting all up in there. And then once they got all up in there, and they saw that there was more damage than they initially thought. They were like, I oh, no, we need to do I a different surgery. Him. And I do it again, too. So they I fucking do it again, too. Frosty the Freak, thank you for the five subs. Thank you, buddy. Phasmo is, is significantly better now. How? What could they have possibly done to make that to, to make it to make it significantly better? What can it be now? Do, 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 do. <laughs> I just wanted to spook her. No, you can pick it up. You're good. I just wanted to spook you. I just wanted to freak you out a little bit. Wait, where did the Dwight go? The Dwight left, that fucker. Or is this him up here? There he is. Watch Freak, thank you for the five subs, dude. Way more ghosts, things like tarot cards that trigger other things, haunted <laughs> items, etc. Huh. I still feel like. I still feel like I just got oh, bored of the. Time, uh, I feel like I got bored of the entire premise of the game. I don't know. Like, I don't know. Like, to me, I just don't know if it was, like, savable with like more content. Like I don't think like more content saves that game for me. I was really assuming she would like juke, but she like didn't juke. Man, I'm playing so bad. I'm actually playing so bad. Phasma is painfully repetitive. Yeah, that's how I felt about it, too. Wow, they actually avoided that, huh? Yeah, like, Phasma was like... Okay, I thought Phasma was probably, unironically, the scariest game I've ever played. The first time... Like, my first ever playthrough. Like, I loved it. I thought my first playthrough of Phasma was like amazing, dude. Like it was like it did it did, it did it did such a good job of like giving a good atmosphere and like just feeling like just eerie to play. You know what I mean? Like I liked it a lot, a lot. But I do feel like it was like so painfully repetitive that I feel like once I like once I played it for like basically once it stopped being scary, like the second the game stopped being scary anymore, that's when the game just immediately lost everything for me. Like. 
I feel like, and, and like that's, and also that's gonna happen to any game, right? It's not even the game's fault. Like every, any game is gonna stop being scary after a certain amount of hours. Like I feel like after a certain amount of hours of Phasmo, you start being like, instead of being like scared, you start walking into the house and being like, fuck you, Pamela Harris. What are you gonna do to me, bitch? I'm coming right in your house. What are you gonna do? Like, right, you, 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 like, you start doing shit like that. And then it's like, like once you get to that point, it, get, it gets to be way less fun, you know? Dude, 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 dude. This Dwight's really good. I'm not gonna be able to do anything against him. I knew he was gonna juke outwards there to avoid the curve. So I guess I can't do something against him. Never mind. You should try Nun Massacre. Nun Massacre? You, you wanna na you wanna massacre nuns? The ghosters get anything for Christmas? Uh, head pats and some food. So basically, what he got every day other than Christmas, anyway. No, my peppermint too. Not like these. Do you reach full ghost adventure status with Vaz? Yeah, maybe. What's ghost adventures? Maybe. No, 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 Okay, never mind. I can do it. I lied. I lied. I can't do it. I thought I couldn't do it, but then it turns out I just had to try, and then it happened. Oh, God, about my face, please. What do I, 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 why I, why do I have five I stacks of... Uh, and I'd do it again, too. I'd fucking do it again, What do I have five too. stacks of throw whenever I whenever they broke my pentameno? Shouldn't I be at four? Four, thank you for the five subs. Thank you, thank you, thank you. You get to build if you would like one. Let me know what you want. Appreciate you. Huh. Oh, this has a good bit of pro Oh, that is a good bit of progress. Well, fuck me running. Son of a motherfucking bitch. Hey, man, yeah, I got motherfucking low pro chains, baby. I got the low pro chains, baby. Girl just the villain today. Yeah, true. Oh. Oh. Did they boon it? Then snuffed it? No, I I literally made a pentamento totem and then they broke it. Like I, it, it wasn't like a totem. Like it was literally a pentamento totem, and you can't boon a pentamento. So yeah, no, I just I don't know what's going on. It just I I just it's just bugged or something. Like I wonder if I still have the effects of five or if I have the effects of four. I don't know. Hmm. Interesting that he would just send that. Uh. You can't boon a pentamento? Nope. Not a real totem. You cannot boon it. Hi, Missy Goose. What up? What's this pilot here, though? Why do I, like, dude, I, I swear, I just don't even know what I'm doing today. Like, I can't play Billy right now. I don't know what's wrong with me. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This guy's smart. He knows how to just basically not get chainsawed, basically, uh, essentially. Well, this shit is the most progress, so it'd be kind of silly to do, go anywhere other than here. Great pass, you're like two eleven months. Welcome back, dude. Well, three Pain. subby wubby uwu. Mm -hmm. Nearing the end of 2016 with the release of a certain DLC, combining an already existing perk with a new teachable perk gave the killer a massive reduction in both missing and hitting a survivor. What was the name of the DLC and the two perks used in this combination? What the fuck are you asking me? Yeah. Near the end of 2016 with the release of a certain DLC, is this like DVD trivia? 
Combining an already existing perk with a new one, with a new Jubal perk gave the killer a massive reduction in both missing and hitting a survivor. What was the name of the DLC? Oh god, what was the name of the Myers DLC? I don't know. Halloween. Was it Halloween? But the name of the, was the name of the DLC literally just Halloween? It was unrelenting and say the best for last. I don't know. It was Halloween. Maybe it was called Halloween, maybe it was called fucking the the Myers who shagged you? I don't know. I, I don't know who I don't know what the fuck it was called. Answer in the form of a question. We play in Jeopardy? What is the the Myers who shagged you? Kitty second three sub 17 months. Welcome back, buddy. Three subby wubby ooh woo. Well, Paddy, I have enjoyed the content and the scrims. It's food jam, it's food jam, it's food jam. Iron Bell, make them seven months. Welcome back. Thank you. Glad you liked it, man. I'm glad people have been taken to the scrims well. Because I I like scrims a lot. Like, I've, I've found them very enjoyable, and I'm glad that other people are finding them fun, too. Because, like, yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. I was honestly very unsure. Like, again, my thing with, like, Comp DVD is, like, at first thought and first, like, I, like the idea of it. I was not a fan, right? Like I initially wasn't I initially wasn't a fan of the idea, but then once I like gave it a realistic try, uh, once I gave it a realistic try, I uh, actually found it to be very very enjoyable, and I was hoping that that's how everyone else would be. Where are you taking me? <laughs> what, what where are we going? Where are we going? You want to be hooked? You want to be hooked? Are you sure? You gave it the old college try. Yeah, I gave it the old college try. I gave watching Com DVD the old college try. And then it turns out I liked it a lot. And I and and like when I and when I and when I came up with the idea of doing like, I don't know, like I've been wanting to do more like casting slash like, um, you know, like content based around comp or whatever. But I was always like worried. I was like, I don't know, dude, is this just like a me thing? Maybe other people don't like it as much as I do. I don't know. But it makes me happy to see that other people do, you know, like people are, people are coming around and enjoying it quite a bit. I'm donating this one to you. You could have flashlighted her. <laughs> I was trying to give her a flashlight save. And she was just like, no, I don't want to. You want to die? No, there's a flashlight. Flashlight, man. You can't just leave that. Get, get out with it. Take the, take the flashlight and get. Yeah, 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 yeah. No, get out. Now get out. You're going to, you're going to get out. You're gonna get out. You're gonna. I'm gonna make you. Nope, I'm doing it. Nope, 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 nope. What's up, Jake? Get that, get that flashlight out of here. Get that fucking, get that goddamn flashlight out of here. Get it out. Get it out of here, man. There we go, good. <laughs> Canadians fighting, I know. Silence GG's, man. GG's, duder. We can't waste a good flashlight. Not like this. Uh, I feel like the scrims need a cap of experience because the last bit of ones you showcase, I killed it who literally couldn't even grab. The one guy was like so off, it was bad. Yeah, it's tough to say because like part of me feels like, you know, like we should just let anybody play that signs up. But I do kind of agree that sometimes you get killers that sign up that are like very not on the same level. And it makes the games end up feeling very, uh, like it, like I feel like it, it makes like the spectator experience not as enjoyable. I fucking you know? scammed him. I fucking scammed him. And I'd do it again too. I'd fucking do it again too. Yo, Toodle Dope, thank you for the five subs. Appreciate it, buddy. Thank you, man. Welcome in all the new subs. Welcome on the Fellers. Oh, yeah, yeah, for sure. Uh, sure, Hux. I'm going to have to call on you once I get to you, though, I think, because we have quite a few people online. Uh, next up is Honey Ferret. Honey Ferret, if you're here, can you repost your build, please? Test to see how stable my PC is? Yeah. I mean, we we still have a bunch of spare parts laying around, right, Jake? You could probably 
figure it out by just switching stuff in and out. Hopefully, I don't know. Not to be mean, but here's some mean shit. I mean, it wasn't really mean. Well, I don't think it was really. I don't think it was really mean. Maybe was it? I don't know. I just feel like some people like certain killers are like. It, it, but but it's hard to know, right? Like it's hard to know. Like the thing about that too is it's hard to know how good or bad someone's gonna be before they play, right? Like we can't. Like how are we supposed to like? Like even if we wanted to have some kind of a skill cap or like a skill floor or like a like a certain level of skill you need to be for scrims, how do we know that? Because hours doesn't even mean it. Like doesn't doesn't necessarily mean anything. We've seen like killers with a thousand hours that are like fucking cracked out gods at blight, and then we've seen killers with like two three k hours that like don't really know what they're doing at all. You know. So, Re subby wubby uwu. We need the ham cam back. It's foo smile. Any pig, go for head and pops if you can. Whatever build you want though. Just want to see some picky. Okay. Sounds good to me. Actual one, 38 months. Welcome back, dude. -er. Thank you, man. Fuck it. No, I'm never bringing back ham cam. You guys insulted it and said it looked like poo, and I'm never bringing it back. Everyone was like, oh, what's that? Is that a ham cam or is that a pile of poo? Oh, it looks like a pile of poo. And it wasn't a pile of poo, it was ham. It was ham. Oh, that was the above comment. Oh, oh I must I must have missed it. Oh, it's not to be mean because I do love scrims. I'm a comp player, but it feels like the embarrass uh but it, but it feels like an embarrassment to what comp can be. Oh yeah, no, that that's actually kind of rude. I mean everyone starts somewhere, dude. I mean everyone has to start out at some level. Like if they want to give it a try and like see what it like what it's like, then they kind of can do so, right? I don't think it's an embarrassment to comp. It's not like it's not like we're hosting actual tournaments, right? If we were hosting like an actual tournament and then that's how the games were, I think that'd be one thing because that would be silly, right? Like I think if you had like a tournament with like money on the line and then like you had killers that just had no idea what they were doing. Like I know there's been things like that in the past. Like I remember people were like criticizing those like Japanese tournaments because apparently a lot of people in those tournaments just had like no idea what they were doing. Um, but yeah, this is like, I mean, it's just scrims. It's like basically like a base level uh, to like get started. I don't know. I think it's fine. Yo, Toodle Dope, thank you for the five subs, by the way. Appreciate you, dude. Thank you, buddy. Do you have people running the sheet? Because I'm dead. We don't, but also feel free to just not. If you're tired, don't worry about it. I can just ask people. But, like, I, I don't really need people to run the sheet. Like, I can just call upon people when they're up. Like, if, like, people running the sheet is nice every once in a while or whatever, just to, like, you know, make it a little bit easier for me. But I don't really need it. If you're, like, if you're tired, you can feel free to... Take, take a rest day, my friend. Take a rest. I'm I, I'm coming off a two day fucking rest day, so I'm I'm big chilling, dude. I'm big old chilling. Don't worry about me. Everything here is just fine. Fine, fine, just fine. Absolutely fine, just fine. Totally fine. Let's do uh. Let's do gift of pain. Gift of pain is underrated. I'm gonna say it. I'm gonna say it's underrated. Underrated perk. Just saying. Just saying, dude. What's ham cam? Um, yeah, everyone shot on the ham cam, but I loved it. Number two above rum cam, or sorry, above above rum ham, <laughs> ham cam above rum ham. Ham cam was basically, uh, how do I even describe? How do I even describe ham cam? Basically, I used to eat vegan ham. Like I used to eat a bunch of vegan ham. Yo, Pyro, GG's buddy. And hey, yo, yeah, it was 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 uh, was uh, very fun, dude. And yeah, you were trying to give me that flashlight and die. No, man. You gotta, you gotta get out with that flashlight, please. Anyway, ham cam was, uh... Also, Silence, I'm gonna miss your sub. Thank you for the 17. And yo, GG's, man. You're a fucking juicer, by the way. You're, you're a goddamn turbo juicer. I gotta, I gotta spend some blood points, because I'm almost at the cap. Ham cam was basically just... I, I basically had vegan ham that I used to eat, and I talked about eating it. And then people would ask me for ham cam. I mean, I don't know how else to describe it. It's literally that dumb. Like, it, it is that stupid. Like, it sounds stupid, but it literally was that stupid. People were just like, can we get a, a, a cam of the ham? Like, can you put the ham on cam? Like a ham cam. And I was like, why do you want a ham cam? Like, why do you want a cam of my ham? And then chat just, they just wanted it. They wanted ham cam. So, for a subathon, for like a subathon, I made a meme goal where I did ham cam. Like, if I got to a certain amount of subs, I would literally take a loaf of ham and put it on cam and have ham cam. And I did. I had a subathon. I think I think you can actually see ham cam and uh oh fuck, is it the Billy Guide? I think the Billy Guide has a clip of my stream with ham cam in it, I think. We could probably find it. Ah oh, shit, where was it? I think it was like in the advanced part, right? Oh, I can't remember. 
Um, and then people, but like people shit on it, dude. People came into the stream and they were like, what is on your screen? It looks like a turd. Like it looks like a turd on a plate. And I was like, turd on a plate? That's ham cam. That's my ham. And I, I, I literally was like, it was like 10 hours of people just insulting my ham. Yeah, here it is. Here it is. I found it here. This is literally ham cam. I already found it. I already fucking found it. Here's ham cam. Look, my ham. I had ham up here. I even carved it up. Okay, because part of the goal was... Okay, one goal was to put the ham on cam. And then the other goal was to eat the ham on cam. Have a ham cam mukbang. So I cut it up. I had it on camera and it sat there for like three hours. And then after three hours of it sitting there, I cut it up and I ate some. That's ham cam. That's ham cam. It was a vegan ham. So like, you know... What do you expect? You know? That's ham! That's fucking ham, brother. That's ham. That there's ham. It looks like clay? Dude, I miss Quixotic Green, by the way. That's, this was Quixotic Green. I miss that motherfucker. He was the original Curve Billy. Love that man. But yeah. See, you guys are still insulting my ham. Fuck you guys. I'm never bringing ham cam back. I'm never bringing it back, ever. People still don't appreciate my ham. Guys, I gotta play ads. You ham disrespecting motherfucks. How could you? How could you? Can we get a layer by layer nutty buddy cam? Um, no. No. I'm gonna go with no on this one. I'm gonna go with a big old no on this one. Introversal, thanks for the eight months. Welcome back, bud. Appreciate it, dude. Motherfucking her little fucklings. Exactly. You get it. You get it. We need a real ham cam. Yeah, but I don't want to go buy a real ham because I don't actually want to eat a real ham. So I'd be buying ham just to put it on cam, but not to actually eat the ham, just to have a ham cam. And that's kind of lame. That's a waste of ham. Did you do pottery with that ham after the stream? No, man. I threw it out because it was sitting for like 10 hours and it got kind of bad. Those hams were actually really good. Those vegan hams were... They, it was Tofurky brand, and it was really good. Okay? It was good ham. It was good vegan ham. I did not like ham. Well, I don't, like, hate ham. I just don't, like, actively want to eat ham very often. Like, ham's okay. What about can cam? Just eat cold baked beans out of a can. For five hours. Can cam. You know what? Sure. Tofurky has bomb lunch meat. Dude, it does. Tofurky makes good shit. You know what I miss? I think I, I think my favorite vegan thing that I miss, Tofurky used to make these like hot pocket things. Like, they were these little like frozen like hot pocket things. And, it, and, and they'd make like turkey and cheese and shit. And they were so good. And then they randomly just stopped making them like three or four years ago. I don't know why. Fucking dicks. God, I was so mad. Fucking Tofurky. Hi, Casey. What up? Food is kitty. Food is Thanks to the four months. Welcome back, buddy. Appreciate it, man. Do you remember a dryer ham or a wet ham? <laughs> it feels wrong to say. Like, it feels wrong. Does, is it wrong to say that I want to, that I like a wet ham? Because, like, that feels wrong to say. But, like, it's the answer. But it just feels wrong to say, yes, I like a wet ham. Wait, my flashlight. I almost, I almost missed it. That was close. Do you like wet meat or dry meat better? That's not... You're not... That's not worded much better. Like, that's still worded quite poorly, I gotta say. Let's go play pink. Okay, so... We gotta try to get head pops. I fucking this is our him. build. I'm I not gonna necessarily go to this map though. Man, do it again, dude. I'd fucking do it Dark again. Dark passenger, thank you for the five subs. Thank you, buddy. Appreciate you, buddy. Guys, is it worth to buy this game? Yes. Yes, it is. If anybody tries to tell you that it's not worth it to buy this game, ask them how many hours they have in this game. And I bet you that they're going to, that, 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 that they'll probably have like over a thousand. And then they'll, so like if people that have over a thousand hours are bitchy and whining and complaining, that means that they've played this game for a thousand fucking hours, which is definitely worth the money that you spend on it. This game is definitely worth it. All the people that bitch and cry about this game are people that have been playing it for way too long and they're burnt out and being babies. This game is definitely worth. 
Do you like your meat to be sopping? Wait, did you did you try to say sobbing? Sopping? Guys, I'm not gonna answer about how how I like my 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 meat or my ham, okay? Please. Please! Stop it. SKN, what up? Like sopping wet. I don't know if I've ever heard the term sopping before. Am I dumb? I don't know if I've ever heard that. But is it worth to get into now as a new player getting into a huge community? Uh, I would say yes, but you do have to understand that it, it has like a steep learning curve. Like you, like it, it takes, a, it's kind of like getting into like League of Legends, right? If you like try to learn like League of Legends in current year, like there's obviously a lot to learn because you have to learn like what every character does and everything. But I mean, it's obviously less bad than League because League is like 100 plus characters. This game just has like 30 killers or something. Like you kind of just have to, like you have to learn what the killers do. But no, I, I still think it's absolutely worth it. Yeah. It's not like that hard of a game to do. It just takes time to learn. And I think that's what makes it fun, right? You have like a good grind of like learning. Like you have a good, consistent, steady like learning curve when it comes to the game. So yeah. Okay, I like a juicy ham, but like if I pull it out of the oven and it's like drenched in sweat, something is wrong with my oven. <laughs> what? What? Uh, uh. Man, I don't know if I want to talk about ham anymore, guys. I don't know if I want to oh, keep talking about ham. Time. Hi, Roxy. What up? Holy beef. Thank you for the prime sub. Appreciate it, dude. Welcome in, buddy. If I missed any subs, I'm sorry. Hazel, thank you for the sub. Uh, 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 Aramel, I think I got you. Kitties, I got you. Yeah, I think I got everybody. Vortex, thank you. Yeah, yeah. Vortex is the one that gave me the pop quiz. Ray passed or resubbed. I, I think I got everybody. If I missed anybody, feel free to yell at me. Neko Cat, I might have missed you. Man, uh, yo, uh, fucking Neko Cat hit me with a primer earlier. And Chrissy Goon, I might have missed you too. Thank you guys. I'm sorry. If I missed any subs, feel free to yell at me. Any tips in Chase versus a Trickster? I've been struggling against him recently. I can't figure out why. Um, Trickster's tough because if you're at like a low wall loop, you're basically dead. Like you basically need to find a high wall where that he can't throw over and go there. Like if you're not at a high wall loop, Love your goal your should be get to Thanks a high wall loop. Being your whole like you should never like so stay at like a low wall loop and try to like just use it. You should just take like the dagger stuff. hits and use those dagger hits plus a speed boost to try to get to a high wall loop. Basically, you're, you're not saving against a trickster unless you're at a loop that's like a high enough wall that he can't throw over it. This is actually... I was actually thinking about burning this map. So I think this is actually a good thing. In terms of like, I think this is probably a good map in terms of getting hat kills, right? I know it, I know old RPD used to be. I'm assuming new RPD probably still is. My first night in stream chat was asking for pics of your microwave. Oh, my first night in stream chat was asking for pics of your microwave. I never found out why, but to this day I still want microwave pics. Yeah, I never I didn't I didn't know why either. I think that was like some meme from like another channel or something. But I don't know. I think they booned in here if I had to guess. I was right. Yeah, I still don't really know what that was. That was definitely really weird. You're not wrong. Like, why was that a thing? Why do people want pics of my microwave? Founder. What the fuck? What the fuck be going on, meow? What the fuck? She just ran all up into me, meow. What is happening, meow? I've gotten multiple answers of Wraith for the best killer to learn looping with, but only one or two is going into detail. Why do you personally think Wraith is a good learning killer? <gasps> for looping and chasing? Oh, sorry, I'm trying to not burp, but like it's like slowly coming out of me anyway. I think I just need to get I, see, I think I need to get a big burp out of the way. But I'm gonna hold it. I'm gonna hold it. Oh, but it needs to come out. Okay, Wraith is a good looping killer, and the reason why people Fuck, I was gonna cancel it, but I accidentally filled it up too much. God damn it. The reason why people are saying that Wraith is a good looping killer is because, um, or a good killer to learn looping is because Wraith doesn't have, first off, like he has no extra power in chase, if that makes sense. Like he has nothing in his kit that makes his chase stronger than it would be normally, right? So like, for instance, if we're talking about like pig even, right? Like that, like what I just did right here with the dash is something that makes pigs chase stronger in a way than than a killer that can't do that dash right even just having that dash um or really like anything like that right like huntress throwing hatchets or nurse blinking or whatever like those are the obvious ones but anything in like a kit that makes them like stronger in chase 
is kind of bad if you're learning because you want to learn in like the most like simple way and like you know just like pure just straight chase wraith has like a pure straight chase so that's good on top of that wraith is also a really he's a really mobile killer as well as as well as a stealth killer so he's really good at finding survivors he's really good at um like getting around the map quickly and then he also has like a pretty standard chase so it's basically just like everything that you would want right it's like everything you want you're you're fast and you can get around the map quickly you can find people pretty pretty easily because you're stealthy oh goodbye sax you can find people pretty easily because you're stealthy um and then also your chase is standard and on top of that he's a free killer like, like you don't have to buy him so it's just pretty much like the golden standard when it comes to all that right I would I would argue that like if you're brand new and you're trying to learn like if you're brand spanking new and you're trying to learn chases while also just like wanting a killer to, to buy I would argue Onryo is also a really good choice because Onryo is very similar to Wraith in like a lot of ways um but also uh has better perks like the perks you get I think she was in that snowman to be honest with you wait I thought they booed did they not have a boon wait wait, wait where was their boon Wait, what? Did they not? Did he not run in here and then get no crash marks? I'm so confused. I'm actually so confused. I was too busy like thinking about the thing that I was saying, and then I, I completely lost track of what was happening in game. Fucking hell, dude! I'm telling you, I think I'm getting too old, chat. I'm getting too old to stream. I can't multitask anymore. I can't like have a thought process and then pay attention to the game at the same time. I'm like falling apart. I literally just don't even know what happened in the past like minute of gameplay. Like, it, it was all a blur. I just autopiloted the whole thing. Shit. We're fucked. Wow, really? I thought he would expect the moon dash, so I tried to double moon dash. But he said no. And he just threw the pallet, which is interesting. Okay. Who do you think is better out of the box, though? Rosadico or Wraith? What, like a better killer or better for learning? Cause I don't know. I think I think both answers are pretty much like they're so close that I don't think it matters. Like if one's a five, the other is like a five point one. You know, I don't know. It, it it don't really matter. Oh, that's why. Cause the boon is here. Oh, it all makes sense now. The boon was there. It all makes sense now. Now I get it. Now I understand. I hear the Leon upstairs. Jane! What up? What up, Jane? What up? No, I just wanted to chase him off. Oh, she was body blocking for him. That was actually a really good play. Oh, she is live. She is fast and I am slow. Now I have suffered. Shit, wait, they stayed. Oh, this kitty. What? Hi, the Jane stayed here too? Hi, kitty. Meow, 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 meow. Happy holidays, brother. What the funk and waggles is going on here, man? What are they doing, bruv? What the fuck are they doing, bruv? What are they not going to the middle of the map, bruv? They're fucking insane, bruv. Oh, you done got caught off guard, bruv. Oh, you got me caught off guard, though, bruv. You gonna dead hurt me, bruv? Hey we have, like, no stacks of fucking stabiffle. Life sucks. You know Fosny? Fosny, these nuts in your mouth. <laughs> you can't get me, buddy. You can't get me. What would you say are the four most underrated killer perks? I think Gift of Pain is really underrated. I don't know. It's, it's really hard. Like, that's a... That's, like... I feel like questions like that are so fucking hard to answer on the fly. Like, if I didn't already think about it, like previously a lot like thinking of every single perk in the game then thinking of which ones are like underrated is kind of a lot to ask like i can't 
I don't know. I'd have to sit. I'd have to literally sit there and go through every perk. I can't really answer that on the fly. There's so many perks in this game that there's really no way for me to answer that in like a quick way. <gasps> no, he just syringed. No, 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 no. No, he has a god palette over there. Okay, I got, I got to drop this chase. He has a god palette over there too. There's no point. Yeah, I, I, I don't catch him because he has a fucking. There's like another god palette right in that hallway that you can throw as well. So I'm just fucked there. God damn it. You feel sloppy with Drew's underrated. Uh, it's also, okay. I think another thing that makes that question hard to answer is that like, underrated by who? You know what I mean? Cause like, sloppy is probably underrated by some people, but not everybody, right? Some people probably know that sloppy's good. But yeah, I mean, some people probably aren't gonna know how good it is. I guess it just depends on like who you're talking about, right? So I don't know, it's a very tough question to answer. Like, I don't know. Territorial Imperative is underrated. You should run it, true. Territorial OP. OP, OP. What? Why? Uh, is she just going to trade? But why? Do you just want to die? Wait. Huh? Why would she do this? I mean, I don't want to chase her. She has a bear trap one and she's on death hook. Look up to this Jill. Weird. Maybe she just like thought I was going to go the other way, I guess. I don't know. That was weird. I don't want to chase her. I don't want to chase her. I just, I thought she was going to hook trade. So I was like, well, if she's going to hook trade, I guess I'll just do it with her. But like, no, did I? I thought she would dead hard do it. Interesting. Interesting. How would you feel if killers can see Boon auras? Uh, that would be dumb. That'd make Boon, uh, I think that would make Boon like, like way too weak. Not a fan. Like you can already hear it. Like you, like you, like you already have this loud ass noise. I think that's plenty. I don't think you need uh, to see the actual auras of it too. Realistically, if I wanted to like actually try hard this, I would probably just let this entire side of the map alone and just worry about those three gens over there. I just I don't know if I can. Did he, I wonder if he booned on the stairs. Is that energy and blast mine is the best meme in the game so far? Do you blast mine the gen and then pop the gen after they get stunned? Is that is that the meme? Because I think I've heard of people trying to do that. Like basically get them to get stunned by it and then immediately afterwards like pop it essentially in their face but also they're blind yeah that's fucking that's toxic that's hella rude but like also it sounds hilarious that guy went struggle why do you go struggle where's your team bruv what what, what does Austin this guy have does he have his Austin? i don't know maybe he's death hook so he's he's done though we, we're not getting any head pops i'm sorry i know you wanted head pops but they're not they're like not getting gens done to activate the traps. I think the Leon had an activated trap at one point and then that's it. This guy's just not getting unhooked at all. I don't know what's going on here, but this guy has just been sitting on hook this whole time. So between them not unhooking and also not doing gens, I don't know, bruv. I think both these guys were just taking off their bear traps and not actually doing anything <laughs> productive at all. I mean I guess that's productive, but you know what I mean. Oh, she's got live. No. Okay, they're right. You're into a wall. Thank God. I kill. We did it. 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 Another fucking boon, man. I didn't even snuff the last boon, bruv. How many motherfucking boons do you got, man? Jesus, bruv. Hello, gamer. She just tried to run out right in front of me? That's not what I expected. I was like, surely she'll take the window, right? Nah, she just tried to run right out. Interesting. Bold move there. Uh, Jill. I still don't know where the other boot is. Maybe across the map. Mm -mm -mm -mm. 
Well, Jane's all that's left. <laughs> Make boons one and done like hexes. Eh. Boons are weird because, like, I still think in, like, a... Okay, here's my thing. I just think Circle of Healing needs to be changed. In, like, the way that I mentioned, like, months ago. And I think if that was the case, then I think boons are totally fine. I don't think they... I don't think any boon is really problematic other than Circle of Healing. And I think they can make Circle of Healing pretty... Like, I think they can stop Circle of Healing from being problematic pretty easily if they wanted to. And then I think it's fine. I think making boons one and done is a really stupid idea because no one would ever run them if they were one and done. Like, it, like they would be the worst perk to run ever. I think if they were one and done, you'd have to also make it so that the survivors could boon in like three seconds as opposed to, to as, as opposed to it taking like 12. Like there's no way. Like there's no way anyone would ever run a boon taking like 12, 14 seconds to place it and then having it just go away forever whenever they get snuffed. Like, I don't know. Being a terrible to run if we're, if we're, if we're not going to delete them. Oh, so you're just a boon hater no matter what. Okay, got you. Got you, got you, got you. Okay, she is up to date. I got a few tricks. Oh, please. I got a few tricks. I got a few tricks. Okay, let me, let me open it. I still need to make that stupid Katsune guide you a fucking thing. An alert. Uh, builds. Oh, look at you go. Oh, look at you go. Fucking poggers. Okay, hold on. I'm muting. I got a burp. Ah, oh, that was nasty. I had to get it out of me. Honestly, that might show up in the VOD channel. I don't know. What's your change to Circle of Healing? Uh, my idea to Circle of Healing is that... Okay, this is an idea that I'm stealing from somebody. Um, I saw this said somewhere. I can't remember where, but th this is an idea that I'm stealing from somebody. But the idea is basically... That, like, instead of Circle of Healing, make it basically take away the ability to self-care in Circle of Healing. Like, I think that's the problem with Circle of Healing is that one person can run into the boon and then just self-care without, like, the need of teammates, right? Giving every single person on the t on the team the, the ability to reset for free is insane. I think if instead if they buffed the healing up to, like, 100% and then maybe made it so that, like, when you're injured, if you're in the Circle of Healing radius, every other survivor on your team can see your aura. They can see the aura of your survivor. They can see that you're injured. That way, it's still like a good solo queue perk, right? Like, if you're injured, you can run into the boon, and it basically shows to your teammates, like, hey, I'm here, and I'm injured. Like, I need someone to come heal me. But, like, it won't... You can't, like, heal on your own. That way, it becomes, like, a teamwork perk where, like, you have a spot where you can heal, and you have a spot where, like, you can heal quickly or whatever. But it's not, like... Everyone gets to run there in self-care, you know? So when Sloppy does it, it's cool, but when I do it, it's fuck you, Borlord. <laughs> well, he didn't do the Katsune Gaidu thing. He did the he did the I've got a few tricks thing, so it's different. It's different. That sounds like it killed the perk. I mean that's fine by me. I think I think it would still be useful in niche scenarios. I think especially when combining with other with other boons. Like it would be a really it would still be a really good perk for like an anti three gen, which I think is fine. Like I think that's kind of where it belongs. Like I don't I don't think circle of healing should be like a, a perk that you can run for self-care. I don't think it I really don't think. I don't think it should be a self-care perk at all. And I think if that kills it, fine, good, then fucking die. I think it would still be useful in certain scenarios. It just wouldn't be like as OP as it is right now, which I think is totally cool. Randoms healing in solo queue? Yeah, man. I mean, look, if you get bad randoms in solo queue, I don't... Like, like here's the thing. Like, you guys can be like, oh, but randoms won't heal you in solo queue. But here's the thing. Like, if you, if you get randoms that aren't playing as a team, then you're going to fucking lose anyway. So, like, who cares? Like, literally, who cares? Like, I don't, I don't buy that excuse of, like, my teammates are bad, therefore this perk doesn't work. Like, no, you need to design perks around the fact that your teammates aren't going to be bad. Because if your teammates are going to be bad, then it doesn't it literally doesn't matter. Like, perks can be whatever the fuck you want them to be. If your teammates are bad, you're just going to lose. <laughs> like, no matter what. So, I don't... Like, I think that's a dumb argument towards, like, not making a perk a good design. As just being like, well, teammates suck, so no. Okay, this is the build you want. This, is, uh, this build is for Hux Deluxe. Hello, Toby. Watch all your YouTube videos. All the content you make. Hope, uh, hope you had a good day. Thanks, man. Appreciate it, buddy. I gotta play some ads. I'm gonna spend some blood points and play some ads, okay? And then I'll ready up in a minute. 
Yo, uh, gay lady, thank you. Appreciate it. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Tired plant, what up? I think it would work better if it was something like Inner Strength, where you had to cleanse the totem to activate it in the first place and give you less chances to place it, too. That's an interesting concept. I don't. I honestly don't hate that one either. But like, but like the problem with that apple bunnies is like, what would happen if you combine it with other boons, right? Like, could you place a boon, but they would just have every everything other than circle of healing? Like, say, like, say if you were running like a quad boon perk, and then you just booned a, and then you just booned a totem right off the bat. Like, would it have everything other than circle of healing? And then you'd have to like go cleanse a totem and then reboon in order to get circle of healing or something. Like, I don't know. Like, I feel like the way it would interact with other boons might be kind of weird. But I, I like balance wise, I think that's an interesting idea. If you want to bring a flashlight or an offering, that's cool. Okay, I'll probably bring a flashlight. But probably not an offering. Well, maybe a blood point offering. I think that sentiment comes from them releasing a lot of team perks that just end up not doing much most of the time. People want that consistency more than anything. Yeah, that's fair. I still think a big reason behind a lot of that is, again, just the fact that you can't see your teammates' perks. I still, I mean, I know I sound like a broken record. I know I've been saying this like almost every stream and I'm probably getting fucking annoying. But I still think that this game would be like a million times better if you can hit escape mid-match and see your teammates' fucking perks, man. It'd be so much better. Like, there's so many perks in this game that, like, are good if your teammates know you have them, right? Things like Reassurance that we're running right now. Or things like Kinship, you know? Things like that that are, like, so strong. Where, like, if your teammates know you have them, you can, like, use them to get value. But, for instance, like, Reassurance in solo queue is just dog shit, right? It's dog shit. Like, no one's gonna know that you have it or that you're doing it, you know? So, like, you're gonna go reassure somebody and then everyone's just gonna assume that the person is still dying at their regular rate, right? right? Like, nobody knows that it's happening. Cause no one knows what you have and even perks like adrenaline and stuff right like if you know that a teammate has adrenaline and they're on the ground and you're almost done with the gen you can just finish the gen and not have to worry about picking them up like stuff like that like there's so many little things where like being able to see your teammates perks would do so much i think it'd be fine if it was like that for all boons you couldn't place any without destroying a totem first that's interesting that's interesting because I feel like none of the other boons feel really problematic other than circular healing. So like it feels like it feels like that requirement for other boons just feels cruel <laughs> to me. Like it feels like, like it, I don't know. Again, it, all, it feels to me like everything that every balance discussion that's ever talked about with the boons always feels like it's directed at circular healing. And the other boons are just kind of like they just get caught in the crossfire and then kind of just get cucked, you know? Yo, Sage Reaver, what up? I just had a baby on December 12th. Oh shit, got stuck at the hospital for, for days. My little dude was hard to get out, man. It'll be a chill holiday. Dude, congrats, that's sick. God damn, I, I hope you're feeling okay. That's probably, I couldn't even imagine, dude. That's nuts. Hey, yo, hope it went well. Hope your little dude is uh, good and healthy and I hope you're good and healthy. And that's awesome, man. Hope you uh, hope you had a good holiday yourself. Good to see you. I'm glad, that, I'm glad that you're doing good and uh, like back to being able to hang out and watch. I had no idea that was even a thing. I was wondering why ads needed to give you my Bezos bucks again. Billy Bear Cave, thank you for the resub. Five months, welcome back, man. Appreciate it, dude. Hell yeah, dude. Thank you. The Bezo bucks, baby. Bezo bucks. Circle of Healing is the nurse of boons. Yeah, basically. Resubby yeah. wubby oo woo. It's full of. Ethereum, thank you for the 21 months, welcome back. Appreciate you. Oh, it's my first time. Ooh. And Tilchin Adam? Adam, thank you for the prime sub. Welcome in, man. Appreciate it, dude. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. I appreciate you, my guy. Hey, Tim, but is getting a vasectomy hurt? Uh, like a little, but not not too much. Slightly, though. Slightly. I mean, like they numb you, but even when they numb you, you still feel a little bit, you know. The kid was huge. Nine pounds, four four point four ounces. Jesus, dude. Was it not a C-section either? Like that, like that, you push that out? Because Jesus Christ. That's rough, man. My God. That's a big baby. Dude, I hope you're okay.
Yo, Curry Belly, thank you. Appreciate it. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. How come you needed the this week's shrine perks or whatever that's here? You needed? Did you mean did you mean, did you mean to say ended? I don't I stopped doing that series because I feel like a lot of the times I felt like I was forcing content because a lot of the perks weren't interesting enough to like actually make good content out of, I feel like. The issue with boon design is they're the the antithesis of totem design. Hexes were designed to be random, high risk, high reward perks. They give little or no control over with totem spawns. Boons ignore the entire design philosophy, making their power fluctuate wildly. Yeah, that's also a thing too, is I also feel like a big thing with boons is also just totem placement as well. Because I think that's a big thing as well. I think like certain maps have way stronger boons than others just because of totem placements. Like, for instance, Ironworks of Misery, like like boons on Ironworks of Misery are fucking ridiculous. Because you could just go up top and boon that up top area. And it's like, what the fuck? You know what I mean? Like the killer has to go way up there to fucking get rid of it it's it, oh god it's so rough it was a c-section he wasn't trying to be evicted okay got you that makes sense because yeah that's uh that's a big baby that's a big baby dude i hope you're uh i hope you're recovering okay then i've had a vasectomy too it's not the pain there's virtually none but it's the smell during the procedure it made me sweat through my scrub thing wait really i don't remember there being a smell that's interesting the smell during the procedure, huh? I don't think there was any smell for me. And seeing smoke coming from there? What? What the fuck? When did you guys get your vasectomy? Was this like 300 years ago? What, what, what are you guys talking about? Smoke? Smells? Twenty twenty. Oh, that's like when I got mine too. Yeah, I don't remember any of that. I just remember... Again, I remember the doctor, like, kind of trolling me a little bit. What do you... Okay, I guess you don't want to be healed. Fine. Whatever. I think I remember the doctor trolling me a little bit, because, again, I... Like, I, I specifically remember whenever I was, uh... Yeah, that guy doesn't want to be healed, Michaela. I don't know, dude. He wants to get to the pallet. Maybe he's a power struggle gamer. He must be a power struggle gamer. I'm just going to let him go. During the Joan of Arc era, yeah, right? But yeah. I remember during mine, I think the doctor might have trolled me. He just unbreakable. Oh no, he got picked up. Never mind. That's right, I don't have Bond. Because I remember, like, I was initially gonna try to watch. Like, I was gonna, like, look down and, like, watch what was happening. Nah, couldn't get there. I was gonna like look down and like watch the procedure. And he even asked me too. He was like, you're gonna watch? And I was like, yeah, dude, I wanna watch. I'm curious. Like, I'm curious to see what you're doing to my balls, you know? Like, I wanna watch. And then he was like, okay. And then maybe like a couple minutes into the procedure, that motherfucker busts out. Oh, did he carry him to the hook and then drop? Oh no, not like this. And then a couple minutes into the procedure, he busted out these like, these like comically large scissors. Like, they were literally like a cartoon, dude. He knows about me, huh? Like, they were comically huge. And I was like, what the fuck are these? Like, you're trolling me, right? He's gotta be out of Dadgers. He's not out of Dadgers. Oh, God. Oh, contraire. I gotta get the fuck out of here. Well, I'm Power Struggle Gamer. Why are you not going to the pallet? We're really super fucked. We're really, really fucked. Were they like clown scissors? I don't, dude, I don't know, but they were fucking massive. They were massive, dude. Like they were fucking huge. Smile. And I like looked down on them and I instantly was like, never mind, not watching. Never mind, not watching. It instantly took like, like all the bravery that I had instantly went away. I was like, yeah, Doc, I'll watch. I ain't afraid of nothing. I, I want to watch exactly what you're doing. They bust out those giant scissors, and I was like, never mind. Never mind. I'm just going to put my head down, look up, and just wait for it to be over. Nope, 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 never mind. I instantly, like, all the bravery just instantly went away. I was like, no, thank you. Three subby wubby. Ooh. Do I got to be the one to get this guy? Is that what's happening here? Oh, he's taking him down, too. Not like this. I can't reassure him through the floor, can I?
Well, this game's a fucking wash, dude. This game is a wash. Did he not even? Oh. Yeah, he's protecting basement too. Fuck it. Let's go one for one. Fuck it. Get out of here, Vittorio. Oh, what was that flashlight? It has a toolbox. You were supposed to get out of here. You didn't get out of here. It's okay, because you have power struggle, right? I firmly believe that Jill is a better bitch than Ada. Uh, no. Jill literally wouldn't even go alone in Resident Evil 1. She was like, but where's Barry? Barry has to come in and save me from the scary zombie. I'm Jill. And she took a gun. Like, Chris didn't even take a gun. Chris just took a knife. You know? Jill is not a bad bitch. I'm sorry. Ada's a bad bitch. Ada don't need no man. You know? You know? Ada's just out there doing her independent secret agent shit. She don't give a fuck. Thanks, kill. Oh, wait. Thanks, oh my, Monet. But we're kind of fucked, man. Don't worry, because I have live. I'm out of this bitch. Why? Why do I do this? What's the purpose? We're still fucked. But yet, here I am. Here I am, blinding. Here I am, blinding anyway. Oh, brother! Relax with that, man. Oh, I'm not saying pain! What about here? <laughs> pain. Pain, pain, pain. Resident Evil 2 and 4, Ada relied on Leon. She didn't rely on shit. She used him. Because he was an asset. A tool. Because Ada's a boss-ass bitch. She don't need no... She don't need no Leon. Please. Yeah, she saved him a bunch. Exactly. How do you, or how do you do to hit survivor who stay close to you when you dash a pallet with Wesker? Uh, I think it's supposed to just happen automatically. I don't know. You don't do anything. I think it's just supposed to happen. Well, this build didn't really work too well. I'm sorry. This tricks are kind of just shat on us. I feel like however the hell these guys played around hooks was definitely not great. Like whatever happened at that hook where he like, he like carried someone to the hook and I guess they were like trying to bait the unhook and he just dropped them beside the hook. That kind of like... I'm not gonna say that through the game, but I'm gonna think it very, very loudly. Like I'm going to out loud think it. Very, very out loud. But I won't say it. Just very loudly think it. Pencil poser, thank you for 20 months. Welcome back, man. Watching you is the only thing making my Amtrak ride bevel after a nice drama filled holiday. Seven holy Keep up the good vibes and gameplay. Yeah, thank you, dude. Appreciate the 20 months, man. Riding the Amtrak. After a nice drama-filled holiday. Hey, that's Christmas for you, right? That's fucking Christmas for you, buddy. Yo, thank you for the resub. Welcome back, dude. Appreciate it, man. Thank you, thank you, thank you. You had reassurance it was perfect for this game. Was it, though? I mean, was anybody going to be doing gens? Also, could I even get close to the hook to reassure it against the trickster? Not really. I don't think I don't think reassurance was perfect for this game at all. Like, I guess it was perfect for this game if I had a team that actually would have played around it. But, like, everyone was, like, dead half the time. So I couldn't even do it. It was pretty much hopeless. And they, and they were like hooked in basement too, you know? We were pretty fucked. Do you think some some killers are designed to be strong against grouped up survivors? Yes. If so, how do you feel about it? I don't know. I don't really care. I don't have a feeling. I don't know. I just, it's just a thing. All right. Legion with sketchbook. Is that mural sketch? What is sketchbook? Oh no, stolen sketchbook. And then whatever else I want. Drop, or from the second chain hit onward, survivors drop their item. Okay, this is for Frosty Freak. So you, so you want me to run Stolen Sketchbook and then just anything else? Just whatever. You just want Stolen Sketchbook. I actually really like Julie's mixtape to, to disrespect the hell out of pallets. Yeah, it's actually kind of interesting. But if you're on a streak, it's not really that worth it. Like, you kind of want to respect them anyway. But it depends. Trickster needs nurse? I don't know if I agree with that. Yeah, it's a bit buggy killer legacy. I don't know why. It like sometimes works and sometimes it doesn't. I don't know why. The neon blue Joey outfit if you have it. 
This one, yeah? I got you, man. I got you, man. I'm always down to play some Joey. Yo, yo, it's Joey. Yo, yo, try to call me Joey two times. Okay, let's do... So any perks, right? We'll do corrupt. We'll do... Okay, I think this is a killer where where, where uh, Gift of Pain is actually going to be really good. Right? No. Because they're, they're, they're probably probably going to not want to heal. Maybe? Maybe it'll be good? Gift of Pain... Gift of Pain plus Thanophobia, maybe? I don't know. I'm just going to do this. I think them being one shot will be fine. Looks good. Looks good. Looks good. Looks good. Let's just do this. Let's just do this. This is fine. It's fine. Happy Boxing Day, Tofu and Chat. Hope you all had a lovely Christmas. Yo, what's up, Casual Bambling? Yo, yeah, well, happy Boxing Day to you as well. Wait, I thought Boxing Day was after Thanksgiving. Or was there two Boxing Days? Uh, no, Nathan. I didn't get any gifts for Christmas. So, nope. No room for surprise. Dark Souls 2 Enjoyer. We gotta... Uh, this changes everything. We have to moor him. We have to moor him. He's a Dark Souls 2 Enjoyer. How, how can you like Dark Souls 2? How? It was the worst of the series. How? Boxing Day is day after Christmas in Canada? I thought it was day after Halloween. Or not, sorry, not Halloween. Thanksgiving. I don't know. Maybe you're right. Maybe you're right. Leave my up, man. You know, dude, is Fearmonger a good perk? Uh, I don't think it's a bad perk, but I don't think it's a good perk. Smack their asses, bro. No, I think I'm just gonna kill them instead. I don't think I'm gonna. No, I don't think I'm gonna do. I think I'm just gonna kill them. Did you not want gifts? Nah, I didn't want anything. I don't like getting gifts. Re subby. I don't like getting gifts because then I feel obligated to get a, to get whoever got me gifts gifts, and then I also suck at giving gifts, so I just I'd rather not. I'd rather just not do the gift thing at all. So no gifts was actually a great Christmas for me. Tyro, what up, dude? Motherfucking Tyro, with the five months. Welcome back, dude. How you doing, man? Good to see you, bud. Appreciate the support. Hey, they bring me party streamers too. That's pretty pog. That's pretty pog. Yeah, I wanted shoulder surgery. That's what I wanted. I wanted goddamn surgery on my goddamn shoulder is what I wanted. These motherfucks. Do you got all the skins in the game? Not all of them, but close. Uh, the devs give me free orc cells because I'm a fog whisper. Like they give me like a set amount every patch. So like I almost... I, you know, actually, if it, you know, if I used all my eerie shards and orc cells, I wonder if I could. I wonder if I could get every single of the game if I tried right now. I have like 200k eerie shards. I wonder if I could. That's actually an interesting thought. I might be able to. I don't know. Because I definitely have a lot of them. Like, I think I have, I think I have like, like well over half the skins in the game, I would say. But I don't have all of them. I mean, some of them I just don't like. Like, there's certain ones I didn't buy just because I didn't like them. But I get orc cells for free. Like I'm not even I'm not I've never even spent a dollar on this game. I get orc cells for real. I want to hurt him. I heard somebody. The devs give me orc cells for free because I'm a fog whisperer, so I basically just use those plus my shards that I get from playing to uh to buy like crazy. Gamer, are you booning? What's this? You having yourself a little boon sesh? Run away, run away from the pain. You has got a boon. What's up, eagerly? Oh, it snowed for the first time there. Nice. Yeah, it snowed like fucking crazy here, dude. It was coming down, brother. <laughs> Doi boy, me Bob. Yui boy, me Bob. I don't know where the Meg is. Oh, I could have went back for the Claudette because she mended. Oh, I done goof. I done goofer manned. What about killers that need to be bought with real money? Wait, what about them? I must have missed the rest of this conversation. I don't know what you're asking. 
Uh oh. Uh oh, you done you done step too close, brother. Do we got a scourge? No scourge! Anyone near? Not like this. Ow. Hey! You fuckers. Get the unhook, do it. Do it, get the unhook. She's a motherfucking. What if that first guy will mend? Do you think he'll mend? We got the Dwight here. He waited until I was out of it. He's a smart failure. He's a smart failure. You got dead hard? Oh, fuck. You're going to dead hard this, aren't you? You stupid cuck. I was going to wait a little bit longer. I guess I should have. But if he didn't have dead hard, he would have got the pallet. And I would have felt really stupid. God damn it. Life is pain. That was a little bold there, my guy. Oh, well, just kidding. I guess it was just bold enough. You said you have to spend a dime on the game. Does that mean the killers are licensed or given to you for free? Yeah. Well, okay. I did spend a dime on those before I was a Fog Whisperer. The Fog Whisperers also get the DLCs for free too. Yeah. Like they send me deals they like they send me a DLC code. Um as well as Oryx Cells for every every time there's a new chapter. So yeah, I mean, since being a Fog Whisperer, I haven't spent a dime on the game. Before I was a Fog Whisperer, I bought the DLCs. This Dwight is quite a good gamer. Dark Souls 2 Enjoyer is quite a good gamer. You have to abide by any rules as a Fog Whisper? Uh, kind of? Like, we have a Discord where things are said, and the things that are said in there are super secret, and we're not supposed to share them. They're really not that secret. Most of the time, it's just like, sometimes they'll tell us that like, they're, they're like a PTB is coming up later in the week, and they say not to talk about it or something. That's usually like all it is, but... Basically, there's like some stuff in the uh, Discord that we like that they tell us that we can't talk about. Um, I don't know. The rules are just don't be a fucking ass, basically. Like, don't be a douchebag, essentially, is the rules. Don't be a disrespectful piece of shit, and then you're basically good to go. There's not like any kind of strict rules, though, no? They don't really care too much as long as you're not being a douche. Huh. I don't think I actually get this. Mm -mm -mm -mm. <laughs> top secret DVD stuff? Again, it's not even that top secret. It's like the most simple, tame shit. Like, people think that, like, Foggersfers know, like, what the next killer's gonna be and shit. Like, no, we don't know anything like that. It's, uh, like, we literally just find out, like, sometimes we'll know, like, a little thing, like, a day or two in advance, and, like, that's it. Which, again, is still cool. Don't get me wrong. I'm not trying to knock that. Like, it's still cool. I still like that they do that, but... People like to pretend like it's a bigger deal than it is. Yes. Yes. Menders. Works for me, failure. Works for me. That's almost the next killer. Fuck, how'd you know? Son of a bitch. Oh, got you unequally. Yeah, if you were born and raised in Florida, then yeah, snow is probably like this like mythical fucking thing that you've like never experienced. That's interesting. How do you feel about it? Snow is cool, dude. I like it. A lot of people like hate snow and they're like, oh, it's horrible to drive in. Hot, kind of a hot take. I don't mind driving in the snow. I guess uh, sometimes I don't mind driving in the snow as long as you drive Not on like busy roads like not on roads where there's like a high speed limit if that makes sense Because I think the scariest thing about snowy roads is when you get like drivers that like are way too confident And they'll drive like stupid fast. I'm just gonna do it now. Damn, I was hoping he wouldn't react like when you get drivers that like are way too confident and they drive way too fast 
and it's like like they scare me like other people's driving scares me right but i feel like driving on snowy roads whenever it's uh like driving on snowy roads whenever it's um like a like a like like a low speed limit is actually like super chill like i kind of love it like you're like you're like you're kind of just putting along all slow like and like even even if you like lose control or if someone else loses control you're going like 30 miles per hour like who cares even if you get in an accident it's not even gonna be that bad of an accident you know you're like whoa i'm totally like spinning whoa and everything's like slow motion like like you're slow motion sliding and they're slow motion sliding and you're like oh what's happening whoa but you're both going like you know 10 20 miles an hour it's great i love it i love it i think it's amazing jesse taylor's what up I don't know. I like snow. I think it's cool. I even kind of like driving in snow as long as it's not a as long as it's not a busy road. What Jenny think they're on? They did unhook over there. Oh, Magoon. Here. Hey, close enough for Jolt. Pog. You can also have to scourge hooker. No, they have breakdown. Pain. Pain. What's her name? What's up, dude? You see them in the ditch up in the road later on? Yeah. People, like, that's honestly, I feel like when it comes to driving, that's always the thing that I hate. Other drivers are always the scariest thing about the road, dude. Like, other drivers scare the shit out of me. Oh, she has lied. No, I guess she doesn't. Other drivers are always, always the thing that scares the shit out of me, dude. I hate it. I hate other people. Like, I always am confident in my own driving abilities, but, like, you start bringing other people into the mix, and it's like, no, thank you. Ah. Car crashes are cool. Car crashes are cool when you're going, like, 10 miles per hour and nobody gets hurt. Even then, they're not cool, but they're funny, you know what I mean? Like, if you're both sliding and you're going, like, 10 miles an hour each and no one's actually going to get hurt, and it's just going to, like, slightly damage your cars. Like, yeah, don't get me wrong. It's still, it's still going to be annoying to deal with, like, the insurance and shit, but, like, it's still, like, the action... Like, it's not scary when... If you're like about to get into an accident, if you're both going like fucking 10, you know, it's just kind of funny looking. They booned again. It's like bumper cars. Yeah. Bumper cars, but with insurance claims, you know. But I, but like, then again, I, I, I haven't actually crashed into people. Like I've gotten close. Like I've had the situations where like I've, where like I've been like sliding and someone else is sliding and we're both going slow, but then we both like reeled in before we actually hit each other. But like even then, like I wasn't like afraid, you know. Like I was kind of laughing. I was like, "Whoa, we might collide! <laughs> Look out, man! We totally might collide, bro!" <laughs> like it wasn't really that scary. It was just kind of funny. Whoa! He started to mend and then he left. What? This guy just fucking giga brained me, dude. I was gonna come back and chase him, but then he like left after starting to mend. Yeah, that guy just accidentally giga brained me. Like not even on purpose. He he just literally accidentally did some fucking giga brain outplay maneuvers. I don't understand. Shit's crazy. I mean this Meg's in such a terrible spot, I have to kill her. I'm sorry, Meg, your positioning is awful. I must take advantage. You must die, Megan. Oh my god, just kidding. You have like literally 50 Z walls. What is this? Literally fucking 50 Z wall. Look at this, dude. She's got the Z walls, man. She bought enough time for the gen with the Z walls. What's it on cheesecake? It's amazing. Since my sub. Cheesecake is god tier. I love it. It's so good. God, Legion is so bad. This is my second Legion game today, right? No, I, I think it was Clown earlier. Just kidding. But still, Legion's so fucking bad, dude. God damn, this killer is like incapable of doing shit against survivors or even remotely decent at the video game. Gamer, please. Gamer, please. Hey. That's very, very rude. Hey! -ya! I got her. I fucked her up, man. This Dwight wants to save her. He does not want to give up. I kill! I literally kill! Have you noticed that all killers M1 in the right hand? 
Yeah, I have noticed that. Yeah. It would be amazing if you had Blood Warden. Oh, yeah, that'd be sick. Imagine. Well, I mean, we'd only get the Claudette, but still. Look at this kitty. Look at this kitty. Hi, kitty. Gare Bear, what up? Meow, meow, Eight meow, months. Meow, Thank meow. you, man. Welcome back in, Happy buddy. Holidays, Hope you had a good one. Thanks, dude. Same to you, man. Same to you. It's you. <laughs> it is. It is. Also, the S2 was the worst in the series. You're a god survivor, but your soul's takes are questionable. Sure. <laughs> All right, let's get out of here. Uh, yo, hipster, thank you for the uh, the uh, nine months. I said some time has passed since my sub. Yes, yes, you could say nine months has passed. Yes, certainly some time. Yes. Um, DS2 was plenty enjoyable. Yeah, DS2 was pretty enjoyable. You're not wrong. I just feel like. It's still definitely the worst in the series. You know what I mean? Like, compared to Dark Souls 1, Dark Souls 3. I mean, to be fair, I haven't even played Bloodborne. Everyone says that Bloodborne is the best, and I haven't even played it because I'm a fucking D-Gen. Um, but compared to every other one I've played, you know? Like, I'm sorry. It's a good game, but... Okay, you want Lifeguard Whistle, Devour, Undying. Uh, protect Devour with Lifeguard Whistle. Okay, this is going to be weird because I'm going to have to protect both. Since I have both. But I guess that's okay, right? I can just protect both totems, I suppose. Um, ideally, I think I would run it with this one, right? With Rotten Pumpkin. That way I could just teleport from anywhere and then the portal goes away. So I think that's what I'm gonna do. I think I'm gonna I think I'm gonna do Lifeguard Whistle, Rotten Pumpkin, Devour Undying. And then I mean we're fucking Demogorgon, so of course we're gonna run like Stabiffle because you know we're pieces of shit. And then uh, let's go do corrupt, but maybe we maybe we should do lethal instead. Cause I don't want them to like find my totems early. I think I'm actually gonna do lethal. No, I think I need to do corrupt. I need to. Like I need to set up portals. I need, I need, I need the early game. Macho, what up? You can do whatever you want, brother, as long as you use Devour Hope. I mean, this is fine. I'm down to try it with the, with a dying. I don't think I, I don't think I've, I've I've never tried it with a dying. That's the thing. I've only ever done this with just a, with, with just devour. Maybe it'll be better with a dying. I don't know. I don't know. I'll try it out. We'll see. We'll see. Johnny boy, thank you for the reason. Four months. Welcome back, buddy. Smiling face with hearts. You were playing Meg with October. I don't know if it was you though. I didn't think you played offline. Yeah, you know what's interesting? I played DVD off stream the other day. Um. And I actually had fun. I need to. I need to. I need to spend blood points. I need to spend blood points to play ads. Here for the vibes. And that weird chat. And that weird. I've always been very like opposed to playing DVD off stream. I've been like fuck that. But I decided to like play some games with friends the other day because we just had nothing else to play. I mean, realistically, like when it comes to playing games with friends these days, it's like half the time we're playing Overwatch. You know what I mean? And Overwatch sucks. I fucking hate that game. But it's just like all we have. And we got offered, uh, I got offered to play DVD and I was like, you know what? Like, it, like, am I going to say no, let's not play DVD and let's play Overwatch instead? Because that's a stupid, that's a stupid sentence. Overwatch sucks too. But I said, fuck it. And I, and I played D and I played DVD off stream. But you know what? It was actually kind of fun. I had a good time. I was the UE. We played together. I think y'all were three stack. Yay. Yeah. I can't remember which game exactly. Oh, no, Darkest Tale. Yeah, because you had TTV in your name, I think. I remember you. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, you kept, like, running up to the gen that I was working on and teabagging and shit. I remember. It was on ornament, I think. How many toes did Tobers have to break to get you to play DVD offline? I'm telling you, none. I just tried it, and it was fun. And actually, yeah, because I think they're, they're, they're talking about last night, not not that last game. If you were the Ewing that last game, though, GG's, man. Johnny boy, what up? So, so thank you for the subs. Appreciate you guys. I need to fuck. I need to play ads. I keep forgetting. There's ads. I need. I need to play these while I spend points. All 
The latest, kill, the, the latest killer is right, right? The, the latest killer is the knight, right? Wow, that was hard to say. Yes. The latest killer is the knight, right? Yes. The knight, right? The knight, right? It is the knight, right? Everyone was Yui. I'm Yui. He's Yui. Are there any other Squidwards that I should know about? Meow. Oh yeah, crazy back same. It's weird. Play, playing DVD off uh, off stream is actually interesting because like I feel like I can just like sit silently on gens and not have to worry about it being like bad content. You know, like sometimes like I feel like sometimes when I play Survivor on stream, I feel bad when I'm just sitting on a gen for like two minutes at a time because I'm like, wow, this is not very exciting. But like if I'm if I'm playing off stream, I'm like, well, whatever. If I'm sitting on a gen for two, for two minutes, who fucking cares? Like it don't even matter. I'm just chilling out and doing gens and hanging out with friends and talking about dumb shit, you know? It's great. All right, that's enough for now. Let's go. Let's go play demo. Yeah, of course, Arctic Tail. Of course, man. I think I think we done good that game too, if I remember correctly. So yeah, yeah. Like King Arthur and Camelot. Wait, what? Wait, what are you talking about? Wait, what's that? What are you even referencing with that? I don't know. Rebel with a taco. I like it. Okay, you don't remember. Wait, no, I don't even know. I don't know what you're referencing right now. I don't, I'm not sure what you mean. The weird stuff you talk about on gens? Oh, wait, your terrible joke? Oh, yeah, dude. Oh, I forgot. Oh, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. See, I read it as Camelot. Oh, God, yeah. Jesus, dude. Fucking sloppy. My God. Yeah, I don't even want to. I don't even want to explain. Just forget it. Just forget it. Look at this kitty. Look at the kitty. King Spectre, what up? 43 months, dude. Yeah, Welcome yeah, back, yeah, man. Yeah, Appreciate yeah. the support, buddy. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Hope we're doing well, dude. Thank you, man. Appreciate it, my guy. And yeah, Merry Christmas to you too, dude. Thank you for your primer, man. Them Bezo Bucks. Hope you had a good Christmas, dude. I oh, thank you, thank you, thank you. About to play Blair Witch for the first time. I heard that game sucked. As a survivor, man, I love being brain dead, holding a mode on a gen. Makes me feel accomplished anytime one gets done. I mean, to be honest with you, that's like the best thing to do a lot of times as a survivor. Like, sadly, like being a good teammate on Survivor, a lot of the time is literally just sitting there and holding M1 on gens. So, like, if you don't do that, a lot of the times that's you being a bad teammate, you know? Have you tried plot, uh, 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 Project Playtime? No, I don't know what Project Playtime is. Have your stream up while I use all 2.4 million blood points that I have. Yeah, you're going to be there for like a solid like fucking 20 minutes, dude. Have fun with that. Have fun with that, my guy. I, I heard something about Blair Witch with uh, something about like animals and like not good things. I think about a dog or something. I don't know. I don't know. I heard bad things, but I don't know. Okay, here's the thing. I need to set a portal here. And then I need to port to this portal from anywhere. Like right here is fine. Then I need to do the same thing over with that totem. I'm kind of worried because that totem is far away, so they might break it right away. But we'll see. That way that's active. I need to make sure that's active. And do the same thing over here. Oh, they were on it. Are you having fun against Demogorgon with his gigantic fucking hitbox? Are you having fun against the fucking massive hitbox Demogorgon? Are you having a good time? Hey, man. These motherfuckers trying to break my shit, bruv. Why they gotta break my shit, man? 
They're after it, brother. Uh oh. Wait, which one was that? Was that was that that one? Wait, that was that one, right? Uh oh. Wait a minute. Wait, let me. I can't. Oh wait, it's on cooldown. Go, go, go! Hurry, 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 hurry! They're not actually here. They just they just ran through. I think. Wait, but they're here now. Dude, finding time to hook is gonna be hard. Like when when's your boy have time to get a hook, you know? Hmm. Look, I don't mind spoiling. If the spoiling is about fucking some kind of animal harm shit, okay? Cause like that's a that's not even a spoiler, that's a warning, you know what I mean? Like, I would want to know that shit going into it. Okay, now we have time for a hook. Now we have time for a hook. Okay, I don't know if they even know about this totem yet. I know they know about that one. I'm hoping, like, my hope going into this is that they would only know about one, so I don't have to defend one at a time. That I could worry about the other one, like, way later. Damn, I flew way too far right there. Like, way further than I initially wanted to. Yo, don't get close to the hook. Stop it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Stay far away. No, you're getting too close. You're getting too close to the hook. I can't commit over there. I'm going to lose my stack if I do. Not like this. I need my stack, man. I'm scared to get too close. I can't play this loop. I can't play this loop because she's too close to it. I have to just leave. Like literally half that loop is like making devour turn off. So I just can't, I can't even do it. Like she's literally just out playing me by playing the loop that's close to the hook without even realizing it. Honey, I'm home. It's the Michaela. <laughs> Well, you know, yeah, I just hate to see it. Yeah, I just hate to see it, failure. She might DC. Because I'm being a dirty, tunneling killer. I see somebody back there. It's Young Jin. Young Jin. We got to get away from the hook, man. We got to get out of here. We gotta get out of here, man. We got to go, brother. Away from the hook. Let's go, Vamanos. Come on, get out of range. 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 Come on, come on, come on. Yes. We in there, baby. We in there like literal swimwear, baby. So when this guy gets unhooked, it should be our third stack. And then we should have Devour Undying with them both trapped, which is actually kind of insane. We got Devour Speed Boost, too. We fast and shit. And, this, and then this should be our fourth stack, too, as well, which will be hidden. Like, they won't even know about it because it, it's just we just now got three. So they don't even know about our third stack yet. This is actually a really good spot to be in. Stonks go up. Yes, stonks. Twisted Metal come back. Wait, that's a thing. Hey, gamer, I got a surprise for you. I got a surprise for you, gamer. Well, or do I? I just hit you normally. Because either I hit you normally or I don't hit you at all there. Or sorry. Yeah. Okay. I think that still reveals it though, right? Perhaps. Oh, see, I hate doing this loop. This is why I didn't chase the other guy earlier. It turns off Devour for like a solid second. They know about Devour now, right? I think. Perhaps. Yeah, I can't chase this guy. Oh, okay. Never mind. Turns out I can chase him. I lied. Twisted Metal was so fun. Dude, I loved that game when I was a kid. I played the shit out of Twisted Metal when I was a kid. 
Oh, are they giving up? Oh, no, don't give up. Come on, play, dude. This is, dude, this is the fucking, this is the Devour Hope curse. If you ever get to three stacks of Devour Hope, I swear, people just give up. They just quit playing. They're just like, yeah, I quit. Yeah, you win, I quit. Like, it happens every time. It's so fucking sad. No one wants to, like, actually play against Devour Hope. Like, I feel like, the, I feel like this perk is literally just you win once you get to a certain amount of sacks. Like, you just auto win. Like, look, this guy's not unhooking anybody. He's literally just chilling down there. He's not saving anybody, man. I mean, to be fair, I guess it worked, right? We didn't get to we didn't get to get the five like we didn't we didn't actually get the five stacks, but I mean we got to enough stacks that they felt like they couldn't win anymore. So I feel still feel like it's kind of a winning build, you know? I think it's fine. We got put on flood watch, pain. That sucks, man. Hope you hope they end up being okay. I've heard they're doing a twisted metal TV show. Really? What the fuck? GG's, we did it. They said, great job trolling, Yunjin. Yeah, tell her. Yeah, tell her. Yeah, wait, did he just say, f wait, did that guy just say sick face camping? Wait, what did that guy say as I was leaving? Did that guy say face camping? I thought I saw the words face camping. If so, that would be funny. They compared it to Zombieland, apparently. Oh, like a horror comedy or something? Huh. Weird. Alright, Tweedledope. You might want to yell at them. They haven't been around when I've been asking for their build. Tweedledope, what do you want for your build, man? Tweedledope, my friend. What would you like, my friend? What is your build, friend? Tweedledope, if you don't give me a build, we'll have to move on to Dark Passenger. We did everyone else, right? Fossey Freak was the Legion, I think. Yeah, Huxlux was Survivor. Hey, we're good. We didn't miss anybody. Sweet Tooth is the best from Twisted Metal. While I agree with you, we need your build. Yes. What was your favorite car from Twisted Metal? I don't even really remember that many. I remember Twisted... I, I, I remember Sweet Tooth. I remember Calypso. He was like the big, like, semi-truck, right? I can't really remember any of the other cars from Twisted Metal. I'm trying to think. Spectre? What was Spectre again? I feel like I gotta look him up. I feel like I played, like, Twisted Metal 3 or something, right? What was Twisted Metal 3? Was that from, what, was that on PC? Oh, yeah, PlayStation. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Twisted Metal 3 characters. Who can you play as? Mr. Grimm, Axel. Oh yeah, Axel was the guy that just stood in like a wheel or something, right? Did he just stand like almost like T-pose in like a wheel or some shit? I remember that guy. Outlaw was like a cop. Roadkill. I fucking scammed him. I fucking scammed them, and I'd do it again too. I'd fucking do it again too. I don't even remember half of these. Like, I don't know. Looking at them, I don't even remember half of them. Huh? Warthog was like a was like a tank thing. Yeah, it was. It's been so long that I barely remember. Honestly, Hammerhead was like the. Uh, was like the uh the, like the like the monster truck devious hacks thanks for the five subs appreciate it buddy thank you thank you thank you thank you give me your favorite slinger build but use the new crimis gun okay dark passenger i'll even set up your build for afterwards but i'm not doing your build yet your build's up after his but i'll set it up now just for later You pick other two perks. I'll, so I'll, I'll put them. I'll put them into nothing for now. Eerie lab photo. You pick other add-on. Ebony Mori. Okay, I'll leave everything blank that you're telling me to pick, and I'll come back to this. Poodle Dip just said. I mean, I, like usually I just run this build for Slinger. This is kind of my go-to. Use the new Crimis gun. Oh, I am using the new Crimis gun. I'm already like ten steps ahead of you, Failer. I'm way ahead of you, Failer. Do you like Bluey? Bluey these nuts. <laughs> uh, 
<laughs> Off work. Hey, happy to have you part of my dating schedule. Thanks for thanks for the vibes, dude. Hey, thank you, man. Thank you, man. Thanks for being a part of the dude. If I'm a part of your daily schedule, then thank you, man. That's that's fucking awesome. Twinker Tot is this guy's name. Twinker Tot. I kind of love that. Twinker Tot. Twinker Tot. Bluey is a kids show. Really? Never heard of it. Is it like Blues Clues, but like some sketch version of it? Is it like scuffed Blues Clues? Is Bluey like a fucking rundown like drug addict dog that lives in the back alley? Bluey, I'm Bluey. Yeah, it's a Blues Clues, I'm Bluey. It's cute. They're like Australian dogs. Oh. Oh, that makes sense. Because Australians end everything in Ys. Like, don't Australians call their truck drivers truckies? Australians are adorable. They call everything weird stuff. Like, they call McDonald's Maccas, and they call their truck drivers truckies. It's kind of cute. So it doesn't really... It kind of makes sense that you would also name your Blue's Clues show Bluey, you know? Yeah, that makes sense. My daughter's watching. It has some good humor, even for adults. Oh, so is it like a SpongeBob type thing? Oh, 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 oh. Hi, Trans. I did. Thank you. Hope you did as well. This Metal 3 soundtrack was fucking sick, bro. It's mostly Rob Zombie. Yeah, still, though. Those Rob's... I feel like every time I hear a Rob Zombie song, I just think of Twisted Metal now. Shoeys? True. Shoeys? Can't forget about Shoeys. True. I'm fucking Aussies, man. Calling it Maccas is actually crazy. Well, I mean, Australians are pretty crazy. They're like down there living with all the kangaroos and the giant spiders and shit. It kind of makes sense that they'd be that they'd be crazy, you know? It'll really hit you in the feels, though. Gives you a sense of childhood wonder most adults haven't felt since they were kids. Jesus. What kind of a review is this? You're really hitting me deep with this. Do I, like, do I, do I, do I have to go watch this Bluey show now? My four-year-old brother's made me watch every episode of Bluey. He also insists we watch every uh, we watch stream every night. So I guess he has good taste. Oh, dude, true. That's some good taste for sure. I call McD the Golden Seagull. Golden Seagull this... Dick. What? What? Why? Golden sea, sea gall. This dick that I'm gonna put in your mouth is that is, what, what? What? Golden seagull. What, what are you talking about? What are you saying? I don't do these nuts jokes. I don't trust you. I didn't. I. You know. I also didn't think that fucking Mariah did did these nuts jokes, and I also didn't think that fucking Fox Paws would good fan me. And I. Every time I fucking trust somebody, they fucking betray me. So like I don't want to fucking hear it. I don't care. I don't care if you don't do these nuts jokes. I don't. I can't trust anybody. If if you say something that makes no sense to the conversation that I'm having, or just makes no sense in general, I'm assuming it's a these nuts joke, no matter what. I don't care who you are. Even like Lemon. Lemon's like so anti these nuts jokes that he'll like ban people. Like he'll perma ban people, and I'll have to like get them during unban requests. Like like they'll be like 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 fucking six year subs that he'll just perma ban for one bad these nuts joke, and even him. When he says something that it makes no sense, I'm like, are you trying to do this not to me right now, Lemon? What is this? They booned up. Motherfucking booned up. Yeah, I'll just break it. You're dead. You're dead. You have dead art? You're dead. Oh, we popped that one too, poggers. Uh, Granny Bacon, what up? Oh, when we got a scourge. Yeah. It's Australian. It's fun and cute. Not SpongeBob humor. Adult humor, like things your kids do that are silly, but you can laugh and roll your eyes at. Huh. The M looks like the way a kid would draw a bird. Huh. I know M is yellow. Golden seagull. <laughs> I don't know if I follow, but like, like I can definitely pick up what you're selling, but like, I just don't know if I follow, you know? Like, I don't know if I agree. It's interesting. It's an interesting mindset towards McDonald's. I remember when my, dude, what, yeah, Mariah got me with the fucking Putin one, and that one was really good. Because we were literally talking, like, that one wasn't even like out of like, like, dude, okay, Mariah's good because she gets me even when it isn't like out of context. Like, we were talking about Canada. And then we were, I think I was talking about, like, I was talking about moving to Canada or something, and then she mentioned Putin because that was, like, a big thing about me moving to Canada. So it was, like, on topic, too, which made it even more hard to detect. You know? 
Like everyone else, I feel like they'll like hit me with shit that's like completely off subject, you know? Like we'll be randomly talking about, I don't know, like something that has nothing to do with anything. And then people will be like, hey, do you like Imagine Dragons? And I'm like, I know what you're doing, dude. Like I know what you're doing. We had someone give up, which kind of sucks. Fucking scammed him. NJ, I think we're continuing that sub, dude. Jack, do it again. Five too. subs, I man. Do it again too. Appreciate you, man. Thank you, man. Welcome in all the new subs, man. Appreciate you, man. Thank you, man. Welcome in, man. Like dirty humor. Dirty humor? Like sexual humor? What do you mean by dirty humor? I get this. Oh, not quite. And her dig after? I don't even know what her dig after was, but it was probably it was probably really clever. Yeah, she's a clever hoe. And she does that kind of shit. Deity, what's up, buddy? Man, it's good to see you, man. How you doing, Deity man? It's good to see you, man. Appreciate you, man. I have not hooked this knee at all, man. I've not even chased her, man. But she's healing right there, man. So I can see her, man. It's her time, man. It's time for her to go, man. I'm about to lose some stacks, but I think that's okay, man. I or she got a flashback, I think. Yo, Rolf! Thanks for the raid, dude. What up, man? How you doing, buddy? How are things? How's life, brother man? Yeah, 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 it works for me. Sure. Sure. It works for me. I yeah, appreciate you, dude. Hope you had a good stream. Thank you, man. Whoa, what's that new? Whoa, that's cool. Wubby, that looks wubby, wubby. different when you shot him out now. It shows a little like, it shows like his avatar and shit. What the fuck? That's new, right? I don't think I've seen that. Yeah, hope the stream went well, man. Thank you. Thank you for the uh, tier 251 months as well, man. Welcome back. Thank you, dude. Uh, wait, was this guy? No, that was, that was the guy that was on hook. You. You're the one I want. You get a juke left, right? Oh, wait. Juke right, I meant. I was trying to flick shot her. It didn't work. <laughs> the aiming is too weird. Eh? Wait, what? Did she stay? Am I dumb? Three subby wubby. Three nurse thanks for the two woo. months. Sorry, three months. Three Welcome back. Then. Appreciate it, buddy. Thank you, buddy. Mm -mm -mm. It was something like she can't hear you bitching because you're too busy gargling on these nuts. <laughs> yeah, I honestly, I, I vaguely remember it. Sounds familiar. I don't want to relive it, okay? I'm just going to pretend that I don't remember it because I don't want to relive it. Did I hook her on the scourge back here? Where did I hook her? Oh, yeah, I guess so. And talk about your holidays. Glad, uh, glad I caught it in the stream. Good, man. Good. I didn't really do much other than just hanging out with friends, but it was good. I mean, hanging out with friends is basically exactly what I wanted to do, so I would say good. I'm going to be honest. I didn't realize that was there either. We're both fools. You and me are both fools. We're both, we're both foolish, fool, foolish fools. Foolish fools. Also, yeah, Panic, you know me, dude. I'm always giving it the old college try, you know? Always. Always giving it the old college try. You got more old friends or new? Definitely more old friends. I have... I don't like making new friends. I actively try to avoid making new friends. Like, I actively distance myself from people. I don't like making new friends. So definitely, definitely more old friends. But what? Well, oh, flashbang, I see. No idea, Panic. You have to ask Soup's Always Steve that, my friend. I don't know. Ah, I don't know whether to look up or down. Jesus Christ. You suck. No, you suck, Fox Boss. You suck. Not adult humor equals dirty humor. Is adult humor equals jokes too advanced for kids? 
Okay. I see. I see, I see, I see. I avoid making new friends, but my friend group is shrinking, so it's no bueno. Uh-oh. That's pain. I I just don't, like... I don't know how to say this without it, without it coming off like I'm some kind of fucking... Like, I don't, I don't know. There's no way to say this without it coming off like I'm some kind of, like, like I'm trying to be some kind of weirdo or something. But I just don't, like, I'm not really close to people, like, at all. Like, I don't know. Like, I have, like, a friend group, but even the friends that I have, I'm, like... I'm just generally like I think I'm like too introverted to the point where I just don't even talk to people a lot of the time Like even the friends that I have I'll go like weeks without talking to them and like it's just fine I don't know like I have a like I have some people that I would consider a that, that I would consider close friends But even those people I'm not like super close to like I don't know I just don't really like need to have People all up in my life all the time I guess I don't know But I mean that's what's cool though like I'm glad that I have a group of friends that are that I know are good people and that I know like me and them both care about each other So like I mean, I think it's cool Like I found a fr I, th I think I found a bunch of friends that fit me well because we all have that same like we're all cool with having the same friendship dynamic You know like they're cool with me sometimes not talking to them for like weeks at a time And then sometimes us hanging out every day for a couple weeks straight, you know But also like we're both there for each other if we need them, right? Like they're all cool with that dynamic which makes it a good friendship. I think Damn, you like, they really patched up that back window. Holy shit. Can't shoot through that shit at all. Give me my fifth stack, bro. Yeah, this is pretty much ogre, huh? I think we'll just let Nia get hatched. But also, like... I think that's why I like my friends because they're very like low maintenance, you know, and I feel like I don't want any I don't want to make any new friends because I don't want any friends that require any maintenance whatsoever. You know, that's the last thing I want. I like I like chilling, dude. I like big chilling. I love me some low maintenance humans. Same. Samesies, dude. Get out of here, you rascal. Thanks for the flashbang, homie. Get out of here, you rascal. New friends always require maintenance because the honeymoon phase of this cool person. Yeah, the honeymoon, like, like, like you, like, you mean like the honeymoon phase of like friendships? Because, yeah, you, you're not wrong. You're not wrong. Can we go millennia without talking instead of weeks? Eras, perhaps? Yeah, sure. Entire eras. Yes, I. That's a. That's a great idea. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I like that. That's a. That's a fantastic idea. Because I mean, you and me are both immortal. Ever since we did that blood, that, that that blood pack that one time. I mean, we didn't sacrifice that goat for nothing. Like we're like we're immortal, you and I. So, yeah. I mean, we can just wait a couple eras before we talk again if you want. That's that's totally fine. I'm cool with it. Good friends are like cactus. Cactuses? Cacti? They don't need much water. Yeah, cacti. I believe the word you're looking for is cacti. Yes. We, we sacrificed the fuck out of that goat. You're right. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, we were wiping all that blood on us and shit. Like, that wasn't for nothing. At least that better not have been for nothing. I mean, we're definitely immortal now. I'm pretty sure. I'm pretty sure. Uh, all right. Next build is Dark Passenger, who wants this, but I get to fill the rest. The Distressing Kalro, Mori, Lab Photo, and I get to run whatever else I want. Skirms getting you killed with that flashbang was incredible. Fucking Skirm. Skirms didn't actually get me killed, FYI. I just, I just, I, I like to blame him. You know what I mean? It was more fun to blame him than to not blame him. So I did. Let's just run double ultra rare, dude. Fuck it. Let's get crazy. Fuck it, man. Okay, what else do you usually run with this? Like, we could run like unnerving or something, right? Maybe. Like, what do you usually run with like Terrorist builds? Like what other terrorist perks are there? Oh, wait, but if I'm running Kalro, I should probably run, like, Sloppy, right? Sloppy and Nurses, maybe? Keep everybody injured? Or maybe Thanat? 
or maybe or maybe gift of pain that way if they do manage to heal they they got they like they got to do shit mega slow wait but like wait but gift of pain will make no actually let's not run sloppy let's run let's 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 run gift of pain instead maybe we'll just do this this actually looks really good i think i think this is fine username what up Do, 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 do. Yeah, exactly, Shay. See, you get it. You get it. You get it. You get it. I gotta play ads. I got to play ads. So we're gonna we're we're gonna put some more points into 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 Ada. Septic touch. What's septic touch even do again? I'll take a look at it once I'm done playing ads. I forget what that perk even does. Something about it's like blindness and something else when they're healing. I can't remember. Like blindness and like fucking oblivious or some shit. Like two weird ass side effects. I can't remember what they were. I just remember them being really weird. Yes, yeah, Silcero, you'd be surprised. Quite a few people have. It's fearmonger for healing. Oh, so it's exhausted and blind? Huh. I, I remember I, I just remember every time every time I looked at septic I, I remember looking at septic touch multiple times and every time I looked at it I'd be like oh my god this perk is fucking terrible but I couldn't remember exactly like why I don't know I, I, I usually just forget like after I after I stop looking at it I usually just forget what it was that made me think it was terrible because you know short attention span and all that who tofu the fuck with the edge who tofu the fuck with the edge what the fuck with the ads? That's good blood weapon right there. Lot later, let me tell you what, not there's some good blood weapon. Let me tell you what. Well, son of a bitch, let me tell you what, that done there's some fantastic blood weapon. Every time I hear you pick a perk, you need it. You need its gift of pain. Are you okay? Gift of pain's a good perk, man. It's underrated, bro. It's a good perk. Especially these situations where like I don't want sloppy butcher because I'm gonna be not m one a lot of the time, you know? Would you say get the pain makes dying less horrible? Or sorry, dying light less horrible. I guess, because it kinda combos with it, but like I would say it's still pretty horrible. Like I would argue that dying light is still pretty bad even with Gift of Pain. Like dying light's just kind of a bad perk. Like it's it's just not, I think it's not ideal to have a slowdown perk that like needs to get going. Like you need slowdown early. You don't really need slowdown late, right? So like having like a late game slowdown perk is just weird. Like you want gen stalling as early and as consistently early as you can. So I don't know. I think nothing really makes, I think nothing really makes uh, Dying Light a good perk, but I guess it makes it slightly better. Yeah, I mean, at least a little bit. Let's at least get her to prestige 11 before we go back to kill her. Oh, there's a flashlight down there. Yeah, yeah, fuck daddy. <laughs> Merry Christmas to you. I always you forget that that's one. an alert. <laughs> hey, thank you for the 2,000 bits, Blue Bambers. Appreciate it, man. Yeah, hope you had a good Christmas as well, dude. It's good to see you, buddy. Thank you, man. Appreciate you, my guy. Oops. <laughs> Fucking switch. Peter Mitch Broadcast had you as well. Said, hey, Tofu. I played a Noni match in scrims in September against 6K comp squad, but I haven't got back in since. Is there any way I can get a shot at a lower hours team? Just want another shot. Can we play outside the hours? Um, Yeah. Well, didn't we Didn't we give you another game? Did we give you another game? I fucking scammed him. I can't remember I how that happened. I thought we gave you Man, another do game. It again, dude. I or is that you again, or am I thinking of somebody else? Sure. Maybe I'm thinking of somebody else. Cause I'm pretty sure we like had you do that, and then because we decided that it was like too uneven, we like gave you another match against. No, who who did we do that for then? We did that like just last week, I think. Huh. Well, if you uh, if you want, you can, uh, you should probably DM Lemon about it and let him know, and he'll probably like try to try he'll probably try to make sure you're scheduled then. Cause Lemon's the one that makes the schedules and stuff, so I think he can try to make sure you're scheduled if you just let him know. Jared, the second with the five subs, dude. Let me know. Uh, let me know what you want for a build, man. Thank you, buddy. Appreciate the subs, dude. -er. Mm -mm -mm 
Mm -mm -mm. I played one match in September, got stomped. Huh. Yeah, that was a while ago. I feel like I remember your Oni game. Yeah. Yeah, it's been a while. Yeah. How many hours do you have? You have like 2K or something, right? I feel like you should be very schedulable. Like you, like you should be very, very schedulable in terms of like teams. So yeah, I feel like we can probably get you in. I would probably message Lemon and let him know. Love story, Mimi. How's it going, buddy? Dude, fuck. Oh, this feels bad, dude. You're driving 15 hours home. Yeesh, that sucks, man. Already here. But I'm doing okay. It's been a while since Notorious came into my chat. It's been a while. Do you match the games by hours? Yeah, well, we match the games by hours unless we have prior knowledge. Re like if we have prior knowledge of a team's skill, then sometimes we'll I change it up. Merry Christmas. But for the Two most part, like we do hours, yeah. Like, for instance, like, Array has, like, 2,700 hours or something, but we're not going to match Array versus a 2,700-hour uh, team because that's just because that would be unfair, right? Like, we'll sometimes go off things other than hours if we, like, see that they, you know, are playing differently than their hours say. But, uh, yeah. It depends. But for the most part, we go off hours. Super Duffer, thank you for the reset. 51 months. Welcome back, man. Thank you, buddy. I got to shave my beard. I can like I can actively feel my mustache, and that's how I know my beard has gotten way too out of hand. Who tofu the fuck with the ads? Who tofu the fuck with the ads, man? Here. Who nia the fuck with the ads? Huh. I thought she would like maybe bait that a little bit first, but she didn't. She kind of just full sent that bitch. No, just let me fucking get the. I just want to get a dash hit. Fine, I'll get. I'll get. I'll get a regular end one. Whatever. <laughs> Fuck you, man. Whatever. Hmm. <laughs> the nightbot message. Wait, what was it? Oh, who told me to fuck with the ads? Yeah, someone said that. But they, apparently it was like a typo. They never like explained it. It apparently was a really bad typo. But I'm not sure like what they were trying to say. Like, I don't know. I didn't, like they never clarified what it was that they were trying to say. But they said, who told me to fuck with the ads? SMH. Oh, hey, Ace Boy, me Bob. Yeah, it's my favorite meme now, though. I, I do, I do got to admit, I do love the who tofu to fuck with the ads. Just starting. Just getting started. Mm, you can't stop me. I'm man dark. <laughs> Man dark, meow. <laughs> Is that all you have? The unnamed T Wall Tech. He did it to him. He did the unnamed T Wall Tech. Somebody stop this man. He's crazy, man. Oh, I only have one dash. I'm the one dash kid. Oh, look at you paying attention. Ah. Merely postponing the You're merely postponing my lab photo. You're merely postponing the wrath of Mandark. <laughs> Slap. Wait, did I not hit her? Wait, did she fucking syringe on me? What happened? How'd you get the full health? Are you a dirty syringer? No! <laughs> I'm boosted. I'm fucking trash. Hiya! Who has a syringe? Who asked for this build? Uh, Dark Passenger, I believe. Right? This is Dark Passenger's build, right? Hi, Rabbit Panda. What up? Hello, hello. Where are, they, where, where are these guys at? Oh, hey, there's a gamer. Interrupted that heal pretty good.
break. I would like to get him infected and down him, but that might be asking too much here. This is fine. I'll kill Brian Bob. That's fine with me. Brian boy, me Bob. Unless he dead hearts me. Nope. Too bad you won't make it much further. Wait, who? Oh, it's a Nia. Nia! Hmm. I see. Oh, yeah. Ah, uh, she's doing the smart side where I can't really use my power very well. He's a smart feller. I'm just going to disrespect. <laughs> Uh, 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 Nogi way, what up? Eh, she gonna juke out. She didn't juke out! What the fuck? Who the fuck the Nia with the jukes? Who the fuck? Why is she not juke? Into the field. Wait, will that do damage? Oh, I thought it might do damage on a little chest. That'd be sick. Imagine. That'd be so cool. Oh no, they're gen rushing me. Do you actually? Do you think you can defeat me? Mm, yes, man dark. <laughs> you think you can defeat the mighty man dark? Mm, yes. <laughs> Sorry, I'm freaking out. I don't know what that was. I that was like the easiest down ever, and I just went I just like I went full like fucking stroke. Like I literally just had a stroke. Yurt. Good dead art. That was very good. Touche. Touche, Brian Bob. You're doing great, Brian Bob. I'm proud of you. What am I doing? Just down him, Tofu. Well, they're all injured now. Maybe we should have Thanaphobia. I don't know. Do you know how to do Wesker flicks? Uh, I've done them on accident, but I don't think I've intentionally done them yet now. Like, I know that you can kind of, like, turn as you're grabbing people and then, like... You like take them to the side of where you're originally taking them. I've not like really attempted to do them yet. I've like done them on accident a few times. How much can you do them on purpose? Like how like how effective is it? Very much? Interesting. Just accept your fate. And it's not deep and it's not DPI based. Huh. I'm about to give it a go. Tofu, you are too popular. No, Mac, maybe you're too popular. You ever think of that, buckaroo, huh? Maybe you're too popular, bud. Huh? How about that one there, buckaroo? Ever think of that? <laughs> I kill. I, I should have dashed him, probably, but it's fine. Seven minutes is all I can spare. Seven minutes is all I can spare. It's all I can spare. Seven minutes for man dark. Oh, they're healing. Give to pain activated, baby. That means they're probably healing out here, right? You would think. Probably, possibly. I don't know. Oh. Oh. This guy's got a med kit. <laughs> hey gamer you vault here because that would be really silly that's really silly <laughs> brian bob what do you do? no your team is too good at doing generators they're a bunch of gen rushers not like this turns out chorophobia doesn't slow down gens so therefore we got we got we got jinja <laughs> jinja Gen rushed. Hey -ya! You disappoint me. And then with the ring a ding flim flam. I am. Oh, I have a Mori. These guys are all gonna get out though. I'm just gonna Mori this guy and that's it. Do you know what Riz means? Yeah, I've come to learn what Riz means, and I think it's the stupidest fucking thing ever. I'm such an old man. I think all the things that people say now are stupid. Which is such an old man thing, you know? Cause I say a bunch of dumb shit too. 
Like I like I call I say dude like every other word. Like I'm some kind of a fucking surfer from California or something. From Okay, like I'm a surfer from California from like the nineties, you know? That's like that's how I talk, yet I'm over here calling shit stupid. So like I I can acknowledge that I'm a grumpy old man, but I'm definitely a grumpy old man. I think Riz is the dumbest shit ever. I'm sorry. Riz Riz is so dumb. Whoa, gamer. <laughs> Uh-oh, gamer! Uh-oh, you need body blocks! Oh, your body blocks are there. Touche. Hey, man, I just wanted to, you know, I just wanted to see if I can get it. You don't gotta teabag me, bro. Not my feelings. How's it going? Tuning in after playing some some uh, Final Fantasy 13. Wanted to play the third game of Final Fantasy 13, but refused to do them all, or sorry, refused to do them out of, uh, do them out of order. Man, Final Fantasy 13, or not Final Fantasy 13. Final Fantasy 13 is hard to play for me. That one character is like way too cringe. It's hard to do it. It's hard to do it, dude. It's hard to play. I can't do it. Tofu, what if you what if I tell you you have Riz? Uh I don't desire to have Riz. I don't want to have Riz. I don't want anyone to be romantically interested in me in, in me ever. I want people to stay the fuck away from me. So I would be disappointed in myself if I had Riz. I would, I want no Riz. How do I get less Riz then? I put a short Wesker flick uh, explanation earlier. Uh, think of grabbing the survivor like a third dash. You can face a different, or you, uh, uh, you can face a different mid dash, Riz, different subby, direction wubby, mid dash. I'm guessing. Ulu. You would face the direction Nearly you want to go, flick would, the direction you want, and then Riz, when sheesh, you grab the, you do the dash in your flick direction. Interesting. I'll have to give that a try next time I play Wesker. I guess that's interesting. Huh. Yeah, I'm not. I've done it on accident a couple times, so I've not actually done it like on purpose yet. I'm not like, I'm not like tried to do it. Okay, next up is Divas Hex who wants Butcher Field Recorder and then Broken Doll. Is that, wait, Butcher Field Wreck? There's Field Recorder, but what's Butcher? Just like something else? Wait, what? Do you want Field Recorder? I'm confused. It says Butcher Field Wreck. Oh, wait, is that because of Sloppy Butcher? I think I think whoever wrote this must have like maybe took Sloppy Butcher and put it in a field recorder. I think Sloppy's had a long day is what it is. I thought there was an add-on called Butcher something. But yeah, it's just it's it's cool. Sloppy's had a long day and so have I because it took me a minute to realize too. So I'm also to blame here because I feel like that should have been obvious. It's fine. It's fine. We, 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 we both had a long day. Okay, it's been a long Christmas. I see what you want now. I understand. Okay, you want Colorblind, Knockout, NTH? What's that? Nowhere to hide? And then Sloppy. So basically, hit people with Sloppy, Slug them with, with Knockout. We can kick Gens with Colorblind, Nowhere to Hide. Nightfall lasts longer. Okay. It's a very, like, hit and run sluggy build. Okay, 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 okay. I see you, I see you, I see you. I gotta play more ads. Kedrick, Kedrick, Lamar. What are you saying? What are you saying, Fox Boss? Are you okay? Are you are you literally okay right now? I have a bottle cap on my nose. The sheer talent I possess. Okay, never mind. You're doing great. Keep up the good work. You're doing fine. Never mind. Who was I to ever? Who was I to ever assume that you weren't doing fine? You're doing great. Keep up the good work. Ah, I'm going to get more coffee after this game. Would you say Dredge is a good killer for new players? Uh, no, probably not. No, I would say no. I would say no, not at all, actually. Yeah. How did you not notice this has been a meme for five minutes since that guy made a typo? Wait, what? Oh my God. I, whatever. I didn't realize. Okay. You, you think I actually read chat? Please. Oh, it was you, competitive Chuck. You made a typo. Now they're all making fun of you. Got you. Got you, got you, got you. I shouldn't say making fun of you. They're just memeing you. That's not the same as making fun. Making fun sounds like they're bullying. I guess they are kind of friendly bullying. Yeah, maybe they're bullying. Maybe they're a bunch of bullies. Maybe I should ban them all. I got an ad in French for some reason. I do not speak French. That's not a very effective ad. They should probably uh, give you ads that you can listen to. Ban me. You won't. Why are you trying me like this, Fox Pods? You know I will. 
Like, you know, I definitely will ban you. Why do you, why do you want to be banned? Now, now I'm feeling sus because I know, I, I know that you have to know that I would ban you. You literally won't. Okay, suit yourself, I guess. I mean, <laughs> I mean, suit yourself. I don't, I don't know. I banned Raya the other day, dude. I'll ban fucking anyone. I don't give a fuck. I just, I was just trying to figure out what, what your end game was here. I, I don't know. I guess there it is, though. I don't know. Maybe if you're nice and sloppy, he'll unban you or something. I don't know. But bye, bestie. Bye, bestie. Bye. Am I the only one of the things that Dredge looks like? The elders from Halo. I don't know what the fuck that is because I never played Halo outside. Of, well, yeah, I never played like, the story of Halo, so I don't really know what you. Uh, I don't know what that means. Update on when you have the shoulder, uh, shoulder surgery. I have no idea, dude. I have no idea. I'm waiting to hear from the offices of the surgeon. Basically, when I went to go to the, like, basically, when I talked to the surgeon after the uh, scuff surgery, I was like, so, what are we, uh, what are we doing this? And he was just like, my offices will be in touch. And I was like, that's it? You're not going to give me, like, a date or, like, a time frame or anything? And he was like, my offices will be in touch. So I said, okay. So basically, I'm just waiting to get a call, I guess. She wants me to tell you that she's crying and she has a bottle cap on her nose. Wow, that sounds like she's very talented. How can somebody so talented also be crying? That's crazy. How can you cry while also being such a talented human? Like, aren't you immune to being hurt when you're so talented? One bad dad. Thank you for the eight months. Welcome back, man. Appreciate the support, dude. Thank you, buddy. Thank you, thank you, thank you. RPD. This is, is this good or bad? Maybe this is good. I don't know. Boss boss is unbanned. Okay, she's she, she's already unbanned. It's fine. Don't worry about it. Hey gamer. Who is kitty? <laughs> kitty. Hi kitty. Meow 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 meow. Only one person here though. That's interesting. I was gonna say there's gotta be a lot of gamers somewhere else then. There's only one here. Huh, I thought this guy would come back to this gen, but he didn't. That's interesting. These are not going where I thought they would. Is there, there's no lockers out front here too, huh? Like this whole front of the map out here is basically just like fine against stretch, I think. Really? Huh. Do you have the snowman cosmetic? Probably. Honestly, I'll take that. That's fine with me. <laughs> Inkers. I mean, we're not gonna get a knockout value, but that's okay. That is okay. Gamers. I should have kicked that gen. Fuck. That did not play out the way that I thought it would, but you know what? I'll take it. Like, should I leave her on the ground now because of knockout? I guess so. I hate knockout because I just feel bad, like, overly slugging. But, like, if I'm going to get value out of this, I got to do it, right? I also should interrupt this heal. Can't both vault it. Also, it's going to be nightfall, which is going to make this whole like slugging thing even worse. Actually, this is actually about to get really brutal. Huh? He's not heading towards any lockers at the moment. 
Is there lockers in the library or only on the other side? Only on the other side, right? Hmm. Interesting. Very interesting. What's not gonna do? It hides the auras of the people on the ground. Like this, like this Michaela can't see the auras of any of the down people right now. Well, unless, unless she gets close. She has to get like within a certain amount of meters. I fucking scammed him. I fucking scammed him. And I'd do it again too. I'd fucking do it again too. Huh. I was hoping to find her with Killer Instinct, but I couldn't do it. Tell Razor, thank you for the, uh, the five subs. Appreciate it. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Look at this kitty. Look at that kitty. Hi, kitty. Meow, 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 meow. Nexus system, thank you for 21 months. Welcome back, dude. I'm going to be real. I couldn't remember where I downed him either. Whoa, was that a person in the corner? I think I might have saw a person literally in the corner. Well, maybe not. I thought it was a person, but maybe it was a boosh. Perhaps it was a boosh. What's a killer you would recommend for a shit player that would absolutely carry them? Uh, I don't know if that exists right now. I don't know if there is a killer that like just hard carries you even if you're shit. I don't know. The old motherfucking deliverance? <laughs> I'm coming. Bubba Insidious? Yeah, actually, that's true, huh? Yeah, Bubba and then just face scan people with Insidious. That's a pretty good point. That's a pretty good carry if you're a shit player. Yeah, true. Just balanced, right? I'm assuming. Probably not the palette you want to play. Do do do. I'm bad and I do okay with Wesker. Yeah, Wesker's. Uh, that's true. Wesker could be one, maybe. Hard to say. I think I heard progress on this gen, right? I think my man might be done with it all, you know? I think he might be done with it. He might be over this shit. They all might be over it, to be honest with you. Just play nurse? Well, I mean, you gotta at least be good at nurse, though. Like, if you're a dog shit nurse, that's like the freest win ever for survivors. So I don't think nurse is a good answer. Like, I don't think it takes too much to be good at nurse. Like, I think it takes just a little bit of practice and then you're basically a god with her. But still, like, you still, you still definitely need, you, like, you definitely need to go through the phase of getting your ass kicked before you can start winning this nurse. Re subby wubby uwu. The lone medic likes to enjoy his nut buttons split in half instead of eating them whole. It's you right. Poor Lord Medic likes to No Yo you you out here exposing the boy Four Lord Medic what the fuck? He likes to split him in half? Okay, well I mean does he split him in half? Like long ways or like like is it hamburger or hot dog? Because like if you're breaking them in half like hamburger, that's fine. But if you're like splitting them, like if you're layering them, then that's that's a problem. That's a problem. Sideways? Like you mean like like long ways? That's a problem. That's a problem. That's gonna be a problem. I, I hate to tell you, that's gonna be a problem. That's psycho behavior. That's uh that's like uh, hot dog style. Yeah, that's psycho behavior. Yep. That that'll never do. Yep. That won't do. That uh, that's some psycho shit. I'm telling you, if you take your nutty buddies and you peel them layer by layer, 
you're not allowed to be anywhere near my loved ones without me being there because I don't trust you. I think you're a serial killer. That's some serial killer behavior, you know? I don't know what I don't know what you're up to in your free time. But I'm going to keep an eye on you at all times, you know? You should be under constant surveillance. You can't be trusted. I'm just saying. You literally just can't be trusted. Hey, but do you want to play a match with me? I'm actually famous celebrity Seth Rogen. Oh, I don't think you're very funny, bro. So I don't know. I'm going to pass. <laughs> Dumbo, how does Spearman Head do against comp tier players? Uh, pretty decent. Not like amazing, but not terrible either. Like he does a good job of zoning, but like it, he's very tough because if you just like have a couple bad, like his chases can be very fast or they can be sometimes a bit long if you're just like, if you get unlucky. He feels very luck based with his power is what I'll say. Like sometimes you can pop the fuck off and you feel unstoppable and sometimes you just like get a, like a slightly bad chase where a couple of your predictions are wrong and then the chase lasts way too long and then you lose. I do that with Kit Kats? What? Doing it with Kit Kats is way worse because Kit Kats are like solid. Like those things are like solidly glued together with chocolate. Like at least Nutty Buddies are like loosely glued together, right? Like I can kind of sit, like, it, like I still think it's psycho behavior from Nutty Buddies, but at least it makes sense because it feels like it's easy to do. Like doing it with a Kit Kat feels like it would be literally difficult. Like you'd have to like what, like chew off the sides and then like, like you gotta like do work to do it to a Kit Kat, right? God damn. Is Hit and Run still a good strategy? It's never been a good strategy. Hit and Run has literally never been a good strategy ever. Hit and Run is only a strategy that works against like basically solo queue teams and or surround with friends that are just very unorganized and bad. It's never been a good strategy against any group that knows what they're doing, basically. Don't come from my man, Seth Rogen. I, I actually don't know. Is Seth Rogen funny? I can't remember. I don't think Seth Rogen's very funny, but I can't remember. What's Seth Rogen do again? What's Seth Rogen's funniest thing? Someone, someone talked me into liking Seth Rogen. What's his funniest thing? Re subby wubby oo woo. Hey, how's your standing desk been for your posture and physical health? Been thinking about buying one since my gamer posture. Dude, it's nice. As of it's recent. nice. Like, like I feel like just sometimes standing in gaming feels really, really good. So I'm, I would say good. Like, I don't always use it. Like right now, I'm sitting. But sometimes it feels good to just stand and play. Honestly, I haven't done it in a while. I probably should do it soon. It just feels really good sometimes to be able to just stand and play. Like it just feels not. Like I feel like sitting down for like. 10 12 hours a day is not good for you so i don't know like being able to stand up while doing things is, is really really nice i would honestly recommend like if you could afford it i mean it's a tax write-off too right i would honestly recommend Vel. it's it's definitely worth think of the 15 months welcome back dude thank you man thank you thank you thank you thank you up next is billy who won or sorry up next is billy up next is, is jeg who wants billy with lightborn mad grit agi and awakened that's interesting is the point am i supposed to bait people into flashlight saving is that what the point of this is like should i pick up while staring right at people with flashlights since i have light <laughs> since i have light board but then also a bunch of carry perks so i just i like let them go for a flashlight save and then i just chase their ass down with fucking <laughs> mad grenadji and kill them it's an interesting idea and no one will expect it from a billy too right no wholesome billy player would run lightborn right especially not a legacy billy it's the ultimate disguise they'll they'll, they'll never know who would expect it? What's the last one? Awakened. Huh. And then any add-ons. I gotta look into how tax write-offs work with all this? Yeah, dude, you really do. Tax write-offs are the shit. That's how I justify buying anything. Like, if there's anything semi-expensive that I gotta buy, I'm like, bro, tax write-off, you know? Easy tax write-off. Pineapple Express, super bad. I feel like I'm not... Pineapple Express was just like one of those like... Re-subby wubby... Stoner -woo. movies or something, right? My husband is taking me to NYC to see Lion King on Broadway. Best Christmas present ever. Food Hey, fight, fuck food yeah. Fight, Dark love. Cloud, thank you for 39 months. Welcome back. Appreciate it. Thank you, thank you, thank you. And dude, hell yeah, that's awesome. Sounds like a keeper. Well, I mean, I guess if it's your hubby, it already is a keeper, right? So... It sounds like you made a good choice of, of your keeper. So hell yeah, dude. Hope, yo, I, uh, I hope you have a good time. Guys, I need to get coffee. Before I do this build, let me go grab some coffee, okay? Um, I'm like a good like three hours in the stream, and I'm only one cup of coffee in the stream. So let me let me let me go get some more, okay? Um And yeah, when I get back, we'll do this, we'll do this build, okay? Give me a second. Give me a second. BRB. One minute. Uno momento. Y'all yeah, play some ads while I'm gone too. BRB guys, one sec. BRB.
Oi. All right. I am back. I am back. Yo, honestly, Vel just reminded me, dude. I need to stand up. I haven't used my stand-up desk in a while, man. Oh, wh why am I not standing? Hey, why is it not? Why are you not working? Hey. Boy, it is working. I'm standing up. One second. Oh, but uh, but uh, we can do this thing. What's a good build for a console blade? I have no idea, dude. I can't give advice on anything console in this game. Because I don't play console, and I never have. So I don't know. I mean, I imagine a good build for a console blight would be the same build that's good for a not console blight, I guess. Like, what would you change about your build because you're on console? I don't know. Boy. It's crazy how many health, health issues are related to bad posture. I've been forcing proper posture for the past hour and I already feel way better than I have the past few days. Really? Dude, I have such bad posture all the time. I hate it. Like, I literally am like a human fucking question mark. I'm telling you. Like, I am literally a walking, breathing, living human question mark. It's such a problem. And I'm always told how bad it is, but I, it's so hard to fix because I feel like once you get used to bad posture, good posture feels bad. Like for me, like trying to have good, like if I sit there and I like try to have like good posture, it makes me feel like awkward. Like it, it doesn't feel right. Like I literally sit there and I'm like, this isn't how normal humans sit, right? Like normal humans don't sit like this. Like I look weird right now, right? But I'm like, no, I think that's actually, that's actually how you're supposed to sit. All right, Cornelix, have a good one, dude. Yeah, I, I have like a scuffed Herman Miller, but mine's not really that nice. A, a real Herman Miller would probably be better. Yes, Loop, I do. He played in scrims one of the nights at one point a while back. It's more comfortable for my body to be contorted in ways that other people would think is uncomfortable. Interesting. I don't know what HEDS is, but that's interesting. Please look into, into alternative ergonomic chairs or buy used. It isn't worth spending the Herman tax. Well, yeah, that's what I have. I have like a different one. It's like a off-brand Herman Miller, Re basically. Subby Wubby Uwu. Nice. Fat thanks for the 69 months, man. <laughs> nice. Oh, yeah, the green screen's a little fucked up, huh? Wait, maybe if I raise the monitor and then lower the camera. Well, I think my head's going to be cut off a little bit, but I think that's, just, I think that's how it's going to have to be. Either my head's gonna be cut off or the green tree's gonna be showing on the top. It's gonna be one or the other. Very glad to see longtime friend of the, of the stream, the ceiling, made his welcome return. Don't let them bully you into blocking it. You're right. You're right. I shouldn't let them bully, and bully me into blocking the longtime friend of the stream. Look, you can see the ceiling slightly. Look. Don't block the ceiling. It's fine. Mm -hmm. Okay, so this build is really stupid. Let's see if we can uh, make something really stupid happen with it. I like this. She's not going to stay, right? Yeah, I didn't think. Mm -hmm. Man, she's a whole W and E man, not like these, not like these. Oh, why did I think I can get that there? I don't know. I forgot that that poked out as much as it did. Ugh. Ah, uh, I don't even want to chase that guy. It's just gonna be a boring chase. I'm just gonna leave and go somewhere else. Oh. This guy's got a flashlight, though. I should probably not chase him, right? He's, he, I think he's the one that I'm going to want to catch off with it, I think. What is wrong with me, dude? Why am I not able to play Billy right now? What's What happened? Am I this rusty at Billy that I just, like, can't do basic curves? Like, that was, like, the easiest chainsaw ever. And I just, like, didn't curve it anywhere near enough. Huh. 
And she's probably just gonna throw this, right? Or is she gonna hold W? I mean, she'll juke out, right? Oh, she went this way. Hey, Suffo Pit, why? There's so many tiles, not like this. I don't know what I'm doing. Literally don't even know what I'm doing. Okay, she just held W into that one, that's fine. All right, I'm gonna look straight outwards. Just directly this way to see if anyone has a flashlight, but they don't. Okay, I'm just warming up. It's fine. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Sub is definitely slightly to blame, but also, like, that one chainsaw was so free. Like, one of those chainsaws was definitely, like, the one on that, on that filler tile, on that filler palette, was literally, like, the freest chainsaw to ever exist. And I just didn't, I just, I just fucking blew it. I just straight up blew it. I fucking blew it, bruv. Okay. This guy did not do. I'm just gonna look outwards and just pick up. You know, if anyone's got flashlights, come on in. Dude, no one's got flashlights. Oh, oh wait a minute. Oh, wait a minute. No. Yeah. Oh, got his ass. Good, 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 good. Got his ass. Do I even still make this hook? I feel like I might have gave up the hook for this. No, we're good. We still get it. We're still good. We're still good. That's what I call mad grit value, baby. B -b 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 mad great. Oh, yeah, she's gonna go over there. Well, filler palette? Yes. Oh. Imagine if I had low pro chains. She kind of looks like she was preparing for low pro chains. Why would she ever do that? That was like the most 10,000 IQ fucking mind game because why in the fuck would a human being ever act that way? You know? Like what in the in the fucking world would cause someone to do that? That is crazy. Holy shit. Honestly, I'm impressed. I that was a fantastic juke. I was not my brain was not ready for something so crazy. And I just literally ate shit and died when she did it. Okay. I mean I saw the I don't want to get the cake because she's the one with the flashlight. I want to get somebody else that she goes for the flashlight. But I might, I might not have much of a, hey, 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 I was gonna say, might have much of a choice, but I do have a choice. Hoggers. Okay, I'm just gonna face outwards and pick up right here. Go ahead. Kate, it's all yours. Yes, yes, come on, Kate. Get it. No, Kate, you failure. Kate, come on, man. Get the flashlight saved. What are you doing, brother? I always want to play in the scrims, but I fear as though I'm not skilled enough. Uh, I mean, we let, we let anybody play at any skill level, but I mean, if you don't feel like you're good enough, then maybe just practice a little more first. Because, yeah, I mean, I don't know. We do get some pretty good teams in there. Like, if you feel like, like, if, I mean, like, you can see the level of survivors that we have. If you feel like those survivors would shit on you, then, yeah, I mean, maybe it's not worth it. Because I feel like scrims are really only valuable if you're, like, at a level where you're at least, like, oh, I thought he would loop it. Where you're at least at a level where you're, like, putting up a good fight and, like, having a close game to the point where you're learning. If you're just getting, like, annihilated, it's probably not even a good learning experience. So, yeah, I would probably recommend, like, maybe just watching Scrim Night and then seeing how you feel about it. I should have faced outwards. Fuck. I think it's okay, though. Like, maybe just see how the survivors play and then, like, maybe, like, just judge yourself whether you think you are good. Enough. Like, like, realistically, like, I, I, like, like, there's a part of me that wants to be encouraging and be like, yeah, sign up no matter what. It doesn't matter how good or bad you are. But realistically, like, honestly, if you're, like... If you're really not that great of a killer and you're like still learning, it really honestly just might not be worth it to play scrims. Like you might still be better off just playing like public matches for a while just to get used to shit. I'm just gonna pick her up facing outwards. I don't know where Ah, oh, Kate's unhooking, never mind. Your green screen background's fucking up. Oh here, I'll fix it. Here, ready? That's better, right? That's a lot better, right? I think that's better. I fixed it. It's better now. Boil over. Horsey perk gaming. Ah. Boo. 
All right, everyone's death hook now. Did I not see the Rebecca come down here? Am I dumb? Did she go over here instead? What? Am I stupid? I'm a fucking stupid, bruv. Maybe. Fix it more? That better? You can see the fucking columns of my ceiling now. Hi. hi -ya! Is that better? Kate, where are you? Here's a flashlight save. <laughs> Psych, you can't flashlight save. Here I come, motherfucker. <laughs> the build didn't work. The build's a failure. The build was a failure. It's a failed build. I don't know what to tell you. It's a failed build. I tried. That's literally what we were designed to do, and it just didn't. It just didn't. It didn't work. Ooh, not a double vault there. She might have lied. Wow, our camera is really bad, isn't it? Let me. There you go. See, I don't know. Like, what's actually what's better? I feel like this is better because I'm. Just, I don't. I just don't want to hear about people telling me that my green screen's fucked up. So I'll just cut my head off a little bit. That's fine. Just a little bit. I'll like. I'll slightly Marie Antoinette myself. Just slightly. Just a wee little bit. Kate, are you here? You just you messed up the timing last time. You got me this time for real. Old basementer. Are you living in Silent Hill? No, I'm just in a basement. I'm just in a basement, is all. Doxed, I oh I didn't even see what you said. Something about Jimmy Doxed got your house, Jimmy idiot or something. Yeah, fuck you, Swish. Eat shit. Swish, did did Mariah tell you? I'm I'm assuming she told you about Christmas present plans and stuff. Did she tell you things? Oh, he's got live. He told me she got me something, but not what she got me. Oh, okay, never mind then. Ew. In that case, never mind then. I I said nothing. Ah. How's your Christmas? Uh, good man. It was good. It was pretty good. I did nothing, which is exactly how I like to spend Christmas. I like spending my Christmases doing literally nothing at all. Because I fucking hate Christmas. I just kind of hung out with friends and had a good time, which is exactly how I'd want to spend my Christmas. Mm, I thought I can get her pushed in that corner, but not quite. Pange. Yeah, I don't know about that strat, dude. I don't know about that one. I don't know about that one, man. I know what most people do on Christmas. I don't know, maybe, sure. But I didn't buy anybody anything or anything. I don't know. I did not exchange presents. Ah, who put this rock here? Hmm. Ah, oh, I see. Tricky. I know why I hate Christmas. Why my my ask why you don't? Why I don't hate Christmas or why I do? Because I do kind of hate Christmas. What kind of stuffs do you like to buy? Nothing. I don't really buy anything. I'm a pretty frugal person. I don't really buy things. I, I think the only, I think the, actually, okay. I'm not frugal when it comes to food. I will like, I will straight up order Uber Eats like every single day if, if, if I, if I can. Like it's a problem. I have to stop myself. I love like Uber Eats. Yeah, DoorDash. Like, or, like DoorDash and Uber Eating. I love that shit. I have to like stop myself from doing it too much. But outside of that, like, I don't know. Like beyond that, I don't know. It's whatever else. Like everything else I'm very frugal about. But I learned to cook as a, as a, as a lifesaver. See, like, I know how to cook. I just don't like doing it. I don't like taking the time to cook. 
Like I value my time a lot. And if like cooking takes like, like if, I, if I have to spend like a half an hour cooking food, that's like a half an hour that I can spend doing something else and just waiting for food to show up on my doorstep with Uber Eats, you know? Like, I don't know. I just, it, it like to me, it's not really like the work that goes into it. It's more the time that goes into it. I just hate taking the time to do it. Valid, but also money. True. I mean, that's the thing. Like, if I if I was struggling for cash, then I would probably cook every meal or whatever. But, like, I have a decent bit of money, and I don't spend it on anything. Like, I don't buy literally anything except for, like, Uber Eats. So, I feel like I kind of get away with it because of that, right? Because I'm so frugal everywhere else, I think it means that I can kind of get away with, you know, ordering food. Not every single day or anything, but, like, you know, at least a good bit here and there. Okay, next up is uh, Jinz's build, who wants Plague. The Dying Light, Thanatophobia, Pentimento, Plaything. The old Dying Light gamer, eh? The old Dying Light. Is, is, is that on page? Oh, God. It's on the last page. Interesting. The old Dying Light gamer. We're still trying to make this perk work, huh? Pentimento, Plaything. I mean, I guess to be fair, if we get a Pentimento totem, plus like full stacks of Thanat, plus a few stacks of Dying Light, that's like... That's like 60% fucking <laughs> gen regret. That's horrible. That's Look potentially at horrible. Look at the kitty. This Hi could kitty. potentially get horrible. Meow, 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 meow. I nine heck in months. Thanks for the great streams, as always. Hope the games are going well tonight. Food cute. Uh, plaything, 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 plaything. What the fuck am I looking for? That's third seal. Plaything. Okay, I should definitely do hematite seal, but I don't think I'm going to do prayer tablet. I think I'm just going to do hematite seal and then like maybe devotee's amulet. Because they're probably going to be wanting to cleanse to get rid of Thanatophobia. You should try to get a factor sponsor so I could use your code. What the hell is fact? Factor these. Factor these. Factor this dick. Factor these nuts. What's factor? Flimsy Tool, thank you for the resub. Nine months. Welcome back, man. Appreciate it, buddy. Oh, thank you, thank you, thank you. And yo, thank you. Games are going pretty well. Thank you. It's a service that sends you pre-made meals you heat up. Oh, so is it like HelloFresh, except instead of having to like cook them, they're just like pre-made? Have you tried meal replacement shakes like Soylent? I have not tried that, but honestly, I wonder how that would be. Might be up your alley if you're fine with just drinking a chocolate shake. I, I, I think what I'm worried about with stuff like that is like, I'm worried that I would drink it and then I wouldn't feel full. I think that's kind of what I'm worried about. Honestly, I should try it though. Have you tried it, Vel? I, like, like I, I do think that's my biggest worry about stuff like that. Those like meal replacement shake things is I'd be worried that I would like drink it or whatever. And then like after I was done, I would like still want to eat food at some point in the day, you know? I don't know. Factor this dick into your schedule. Got him. G -g -g got him. Politely asked him to fit it into the schedule. Got him. My main source of nutrition since mental health makes preparing food rough. Yeah, that's fair. Yeah, again, that's a big thing with me too. But it's like between mental health and also just not wanting to take the time to do it. Like preparing food is just, I don't know. It's such a fucking pain in the ass. I hate doing it. I literally just, I can't. Like I can't be, I can't be bothered to like take any large amount of time out of my day to make food. Like I just can't, I don't know. All right, I had to turn off my heater. Let get a little warm in here. Oak. Are they gonna sabo me? I'm a little worried. Jigsaw piece? Oh, fucking hell. Yeah, I'd be willing to try it. I don't know. If, if it is gross and chalky, like Swish is saying, then maybe I would just hate it. But, like, if I don't mind the taste of it, then, like, I don't know. This time Dark and Darker comes back, we should try it. Yeah, maybe. You use the jigsaw piece? What? Why? Wait, why did I have that on my build? Wait, really? Wait, why? Why did I do that? No, that doesn't make sense. Why would I do that? No, guys, you guys are lying. Why would I bring a jigsaw piece as the plague? That doesn't make any sense. No, 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 no. You guys are lying. No, 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 no. I didn't do that. No way. No chance. Uh-uh. Nope. 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 No. Just TM. TM. What's that mean? TM? I love that map offers are still in the game. Same. Oh, task manager. Oh, no. Fuck that. I'm not going to bitch out. Why did I bring this? 
Why? Whoa, their pings were really high. Oh, wait, no, they, okay, they've calmed now. Why would I bring this? Why is it a thing that I would do? The fuck? What's wrong with me? That's okay. We'll make it work. That's okay. Maybe that would be better because, like, the totems will be harder to find. I'm trying to find a way to justify it, you know? Like, plaything totems will be harder to find and stuff, you know? So it would be fine, right? Do, 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 Oh, I thought she was about to get injured and I could maybe get a hit, but I couldn't. She's going to be getting injured soon, I imagine. You can hold a three gen better? I mean, can you? I don't know. Maybe. A bunch of them got sick from doing a gen, but which one? This one? Seems like it. How are you not injured? There you go. Oh, uh, she has life and she has a god. She's going, she's going away from the god palette, though. That's weird. Why is she not going to the god palette? Why are you being weird? Why are you weird? You had a god palette literally right there. Why are you weird? Chasing that Zarina first is also is a bad idea because one, she seems like a juicer, and two, she's the obsession. So I don't get my dying light stacks. I don't get my stacks of dying light. This way, I get my dying light stacks too. Did she stay here? No, she must have left. Pain. I heard someone coughing. Somewhere. I really don't want this guy. No, what am I doing? I'm just literally hitting M1 for no reason. Jesus Christ. This guy does have a couple good pilots down here, though. I really wanted to get him injured before he made it to this god pilot. Well, this could be close. Nah, he still makes this. But he's still kind of zoned in here now, though. He might be able to use his left side to get to that pallet, though. That's probably the best amount of distance I'm going to get. Yeah, he makes it no matter what. We got maximum FNAF value, though. 20%, baby. 23% if you count that dying light stack. Look out, dude. Fanatophobia gaming out here. Someone's got to be a cleansy boy. Hi, Lion Gamer. Happy holidays, dude. God, why did I bring this fucking map offering? What is wrong with me, dude? Why did I do this to myself? Why did no one tell me that I had this offering on? I blame you, chat. This is all your fault. This is clearly not my fault. This is clearly your fault. For not stopping me. Why did you guys not save me from myself? Look at these fucking pallets, dude. Jesus Christ, man. And there's another god pallet here. And there's another god pallet behind this. And there's also a really strong pallet upstairs. Fucking Christ. Yeah, well, he fell for that with the overcommitment, so that's good. We can get our second shack of dying light. Hiya! With Eerie Seal, this isn't a big deal, though, but I don't have Eerie Seal. What do you mean? I ain't got no Eerie Seal, dog. I don't even know why I'm puking on this. It's already puked on. I need to get my. I need to get my pool was what I need to do. Well, maybe. It's down here, so it's actually... Uh... Pilot's actually one of the only pilots on this map that's not super safe. But she has another one right here, so it doesn't really matter. And there's just another one in the room in front of her, too. This is fucking pain. This is so much pain. This is so much pain. I am just filled with pain. Pain, 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 pain. I have found all the gamers. I mean, more dying light sacks. Fuck it. Are you at a east? Yes. Yeah, these gens should be taking forever, thanks to Thanat too, and also Dying Light. And we could also go Penamento that now.
Hey, gamer. Oh, God. Every fucking pal is just so strong. Like, there's just literally zero hope for any play around any of them. It's fucking pain, dude. Like, it's actually such pain. Okay, now they're doing gens, like, 59% slower. Everyone under the... Okay, the, the, the Zarina is doing them 50% slower, and everybody else is doing them 59% slower. Which is pretty fucking slow, you know? Re subby wubby uwu. Good evening, gamers. Tofu cigar. So many safe pallets, man. There's still God Room over here, too, that has like 30 million of them as well. Somebody cleansed finally. I'm literally just gonna go get my fucking thing. I don't even care. I break. I do the old falling style break. I gotta get some power. Like, I gotta do something. I can't just keep doing M1 killer against these guys. It's just, it's not working. Damn. Not enough. Look at Dead Hard. This guy is on Death Hook, right? Uh, okay, we'll just have one of them. Fine, we'll just have one of them. Never mind, take it back. We're actually gonna be M1. -er. Ne never mind, we're actually gonna be M1 gamers. This kind of cucks us out of getting th uh, full Fnat value, though. So I actually don't know how I feel about this. Like, me killing this guy is, like, not... I think this is also was his play thing that he was... T I think this actually might have been a misplay. I think I maybe should have left him alone. Because that kind of cucks me out of full Fnat, and then also it... Eliminates a potential play thing totem that I could have had. Yeah, I saw that one coming. What killers actually want this map? Wesker's actually pretty good on this map. I would say this is weirdly one of Knight's kind of better maps, somewhat. Like, it's not a great map for Knight, but it's not a terrible one either. Like, it's really hard. To, it can be sometimes hard to hold W against his guards in a way that, like, makes sense in this map because, it be, uh, because it's so, like, square. So, like, for instance, if you want to just get distance without them cutting you off, it's kind of hard because it's really easy to, like, take angles and cut people off. So, like, it's kind of weirdly a decent night map. Um, and, yeah, Wesker's pretty okay on it, too. I think maybe that's it. And, yeah, Nurse. And Nurse. I don't think Doctor's any good on this map at all. Like, Doctor can take advantage of his terror radius thing, but, like, the pallets are still insane. I don't think... Like, people like to say Doctor, but I think Doctor is... Doctor can be annoying on this map because of, like, the fact that he's, you're basically always in terror radius, but I wouldn't say he's good. He's just annoying. Um, I think Slinger is actually weirdly okay on this map, too. Like, a lot, like, most of the pallets on this map are not safe against Slinger. Like, Slinger does pretty well against most of them. So I would argue Slinger is also another one that I would say is pretty good. What? I literally got her and she even screamed. She went, ah, and then she just didn't make her sick. Dude, they were, he was trying to rush the triple dead hard. I saw that. He was trying to hurry up and do three spins in dead hard. He was like, how fast can I triple spin dead hard? Can I just really, 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 really quickly do all three spins in dead hard? I don't know. Maybe. Dredge? Maybe. Yeah. I can see Dredge being okay on this map. Even with Dredge, uh, well, I don't know, actually. Because, yeah, his zoning might actually be really good. I don't know. I've not really played Dredge on this map, so I'm not sure. But, yeah, his zoning with his power might actually end up being insane on this map. I'm not sure. I've not tried it. But I can see it. I can see him either being good or bad on this map. I don't know. I'd have to play it to tell. Oh, no. The stone's still here, so that wasn't Steve's, I guess. Mm -mm -mm. That's Rita Skirms. You can tell him I'm sorry. You can tell him $25, okay? You can tell him $25 for doing gens at 50% speed. You know what I mean? The poor guy. The poor guy was doing gens at 50% speed. You can tell him $25, okay? That's how much his fun is worth to me. $25. His gameplay experience can be bought out for $25. That's the price. Hi, so, yo, what's up, Ghosty? How's it going, buddy? 
I just see this move? No. I thought I saw that move. Jump scare Myers is OP on this map if used right? I don't think so. That that one I can confidently say is wrong. I would say jump scare Myers is OP on this map if the survivors are bad is what I would say. Which is how which is how jump scare Myers is ever. Like jump scare Myers is only good ever if survivors are bad. If you ever get good survivors, it doesn't matter what map it is. Even on like Larry's. Jump scare Myers is not that good if survivors are good. Like if people play safe and they just like heal up in safe areas with their team and don't like wander around dangerous areas injured, it's pretty much never good. Oh. Mifi? Asapome? Mifi? Well, we did it, gamers. We won. We did it. We won. We won on the game. We did it. I don't know why we brought the game piece, but... What do you do when a survivor takes you to each and every pallet? What do you mean? On this map or on any map? I mean, if you're playing a map that isn't this one, it depends. It depends on what the pallet is. Some pallets are playable and some aren't. So you play the ones that are playable and you don't play the ones that aren't. And if they're in a strong enough area where you, where, 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 where you can tell that they're going to keep having safe pallets to use, then you drop chase and go somewhere else. It's probably the answer. Everything's OP against bad survivors. That's true. Yeah, that's true. But that's also, again, that's how like jump scare. That's how like low terror radius Myers is though, man. Like scratch mirror Myers or any kind of like low terror radius Myers is always like, like I it shits on people them. that are like newer I to the game. scabbed them and I do it again. Dude. But like anyone that again, isn't like newer, well, I shouldn't say anyone that isn't newer to the game. Anyone that like knows what they're doing. Like if you get like a team of people that know what they're doing and, under and understand the counterplay, it's not good. It's, it's quite bad. Hunk. Thank you for the raid, or the raid. Thank you for the subs. Appreciate it, man. You get a build. Let me know what you want, man. Thank you, buddy. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Weird question, but does Tofu's cam seem larger to anyone else tonight? Yeah, I, I, I pointed it downwards because I'm standing up. So I'm mean, pointing it up. You guys can see my roof. And I don't want you to see my roof. It's food jam it, food jam it. So I'm pointing it slightly downwards. Grim says GG. He was busy doing that. If you guys can tell him GG and that, and then I'm sorry for the build. And I got paid $25 for it. There oh, it's go. my first time. Ooh. Intervision, thanks for the primer. Welcome in, dude. Enjoy the emos and thank you, man. Appreciate it, buddy. That's a nice route, though. Thanks, man. Emperor Dave, thank you as well. Appreciate the uh, 11 months. Welcome back, man. Appreciate it, buddy. He said Venmo 1250. What? He doesn't get half just because he. Tell him, tell him if you would have survived, I'd have, I'd, have, I'd have gave him half. But I don't, I don't give half money to losers. Sorry. Sorry, I don't give, I don't give half to losers. Yo, Chell Razor, did you want to build? Chell Razor, you're technically up next, but I don't think we got a build from you. Do you want to see his point of view of that pallet break? You mean the one where I was falling as I broke it? Or which one? They <laughs> think up the game piece for later? True, I should do that. That's a good point. That's a good point. I should probably I should probably remember. Is anyone ever told you your vibe and voice is kind of like Shroud? You know, I actually have heard that, but I don't see it. I, I really don't see it at all. I wish I had the skills of Shroud. That'd be fucking nice. She told me to pick. Oh. I said it was for Baker. Oh, okay. Well, then Baker, it's all you, dude. What you want? Wait, what's this? Is this... Was that... Was that near him that I did? Oh, no. This is my point of view of it. I think you posted the wrong one, Rabbit. Yo, Ray, what up, buddy? Yo, Merry Christmas to you too, dude. Hope you had a good holiday, man. I was going to say playing since we've been sick for the last six days. I, I'll do playing again if you want. So just uh, let me know the perks if you want. You guys have both been sick for six days? Oh, God, that sucks. You Wait, is it the Rona or do you got like just something else? It's already here, man. That sucks. She started it, not Rona. <laughs> I love we're gonna get that in there. She started it. It was her fault, okay? I'm innocent here. She started it. Medusa, what up? How you doing? I was in that game. I don't know what matchmaking is doing pairing me with you. What's, yo, what's, yo, uh, yo, yo, what's going on? Yo, what's going on, Cosmonaut? I couldn't fucking talk right there. Dude, maybe your MMR is just through the roof, dude. I don't know. Don't sound too bad to me. 
so do you want playing do you do you care about perks baker like what do you want do you do you mind like no plague since she hates it okay do you want any any particular build or does it not matter or does it not matter we could do the same build we just did and just do a twofer we can do the old twofer just go again with it and see how it works the second time Whatever perks take the game piece off though. Yeah, we'll, yeah, we'll just do the same build except we won't do the game piece this time. We'll just see how it works again. Fuck it. We'll make we'll make more people miserable. Fuck it. Fuck it, dude. We'll make even more people miserable. Is the nightmare a good slash strong killer? No, he's quite bad. He's actually quite terrible, I'd say. This is the right clip. Oh. Does Skirms know about that or was he surprised by it? I don't know. I'm not sure if he's I'm not sure if he's seen that before or not. I'm curious because if he hasn't seen it, I'm curious to hear his reaction to it. <laughs> what the fuck did I <laughs> What? I guess he didn't know about it, huh? I guess this is his first time seeing it. <laughs> <laughs> hold on. Oh, shit. Hold the hold the phone. <laughs> what was that? <laughs> That's so fucking good, dude. That's interesting. I thought I thought he would have known about that because I feel like that's something that we're seeing more and more lately. <laughs> yeah, I guess he's never seen it. That's funny. Thank God the laws of supply and demand don't count for builds. Plague, uh, plague would cost like 800 at this point. True, dude. Fucking true. Although we've been seeing it a lot less lately, so I don't know. Maybe maybe it wouldn't be that bad. You just spam space. Yeah, you just run at it while falling off and spamming space. That's it. Like you basically just like like you like you you fall into the hole while looking at it and spam space on the way down, and you'll just like kind of catch the uh, like you'll kind of just like catch the kick on the way down. You can also get window grabs the same way, but it's way harder. Yeah, you can do all kinds of stupid stuff like that. That's just one of the easiest ones to do because that pallet's always in a spot where you can do it. So yeah, I did take the game piece offering. Yeah. Dingle their bings, I will, dude. In in the name of Bing Dingler, I'll definitely make sure that I dingle some bings. Don't worry, I got you. I got you, man. What the fuck are you saying, cutleries? Are you okay, my friend? What makes a nightmare a bad killer? Just wondering. Um, he feels like I don't know, man. Maybe this is just me, but it feels like nightmare is kind of becoming obsolete to every other killer. Like it feels like they're kind of adding killers that do very similar things to him, but just better. Like his his mobility feels very similar to like Onryo as well as uh, Dredge, but theirs don't like go away like his does. Like his goes away when the gens get done, which I which I still think is stupid. I think Freddy should be able to teleport the gens that are that, that are completed. I don't know why that when a gen gets completed you just can't teleport to it anymore. It's kind of weird. But yeah, his like mobility basically like goes away if they get the gens done, which I think is a little weird. Um, I think his chase power is like. Very similar to like someone like Clown, but maybe like, I don't know. You can maybe say not as good, but I don't know. Like maybe it is as good. I don't know. Oh, oh I thought I thought I had it. I thought I had it in the corner, but I didn't. Either way, like he kind of just feels like his kit. His kit just kind of feels like very similar to other killers, but like just a bit weaker, I guess. I don't think all these boons are gonna help too much, guys. That's gonna. I'm just gonna be real. Oh fuck, I don't want her because she, cause she's obsession. Shit, I want someone else. I want someone else. Ah, what am I doing? I'm getting stuck on everything. Jesus. Oh, the injury. Are you going to dead hard? Probably. Yeah. I figured if I swing before she gets to the pallet, she might not use them in time, but there's really no way I don't get dead harder there, I think. Unless I time it perfectly under pallet, maybe, but I don't know. They cleanse like fucking immediately. That's interesting. Which killers are less fun than night? That's kind of a subjective question, man. I don't think anyone else can answer that for you. I think you just gotta answer that yourself. That's kind of like your opinion, man. Do 
trapper overnight in terms of what? Like how good of a killer they are or how fun they are or what? Like what? what's the context here for blank over blank? Damn, I don't think I got any of that on her shit. Both, really? You think he's better than Knight? I mean, I definitely hard disagree on the him being better than Knight. Like, maybe more fun. I can maybe see that one. But better? There's no fucking way, dude. Would Freddy be more viable if he called you a bitch when you stunned him? Yes. Definitely. That would instantly make him a better killer. Yes. Damn, her plaything just lit up right beside her. That's interesting. These guys seem like pretty good survivors, though. I mean, this, this pentameto is going to be really obvious where it is, but it's okay. They're still going to take the time to cleanse it, so it's fine. I don't think I get that puke. I don't think it travels fast enough. Shit. Do, 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 Damn, she goes fast. I thought she'd wait a little bit longer. I guess it's smart of her to go that fast, though. Mm -mm -mm -mm. What was the, the add-on combo where you basically get Spirit Fury? Um, it was double, double Carnifex. And then there's a common add-on that makes it so that, uh, your people do actions like 25% faster. I forget what it is. But there's a common add-on where, like, your guards do their actions 25% faster. So that plus double Carnifex. I don't even know, like, honestly, even if you didn't have the 25% faster, I think even baseline Carnifex just breaks shit really, really quickly, I think. So even that might be enough, honestly. Yeah, they got Penamento. Mm -mm -mm -mm. We're getting the dying light stacks up, baby. We're stacking them up. We're getting up to four now. 12%. I guess an extra 4% from that, too, right now. Dage. Dage. Fucking Dage. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This is Shellraiser's build. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So Hunk's up next. Hi, Tofu misses you. Hi, Brooklyn Renee. Wait, what do you mean Tofu misses me? But I'm Tofu. What do you mean? Uh-oh. Is your part of time going to run out? Aha, the dead hard. Your, your hate for Plague aside, where do you think she is on a tier list? Uh, I'll be like high B tier. Maybe low A tier. I'd say. I think even low A tier is a bit of a stretch, though, to be honest with you. Are you all oblivious, love? Are you all oblivious? I thought I heard someone doing that gem, but I guess I didn't. Oh, never lucky, dude. Never rubber ducky. He went for the old quick pilot through, but I went for the old quick swing, and then I got him, and he didn't get me, and then I got him. <laughs> Fuck this killer. No, just get her over the thing, man. I make it rain, I make it rain, I make it rain on them hoes. I make it rain, I make it rain, I make it rain on them hoes. Oh! Why is this killer so bad? Why is she so bad? Why? Why is she so bad? Hey, gamer. Definitive A tier. If you count add ons and her eerie seals, so survivors have no choice but to give you power no less than five times a game, six with the pool you start with. Yeah, true. And I guess if you run 
If you run Devoted's Amulet too, then your power's not even nerfed either. Like, Eerie Seal plus Devoted's Amulet is definitely a pretty strong combo. You're not wrong about that. Her dead heart's probably kitty. back up. Look at the kitty. Hi, kitty. Meow, 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 meow. Today, it appeared to share IC. So she's going to fake this window and try to dead hard, probably. Or maybe not. Maybe she's just going to dead hard in the open field. <laughs> and arrow blasting for the three months, buddy. Oh. Thank you, man. Welcome on back in, Valor. Appreciate you, Valor. I meant I missed you, silly. Just a misspell. And it's pronounced rain. Oh. Hey, you're right. Re subby right, wubby uwu. Oh, hi, Brooklyn. Good to see that you. That was Sir Tofu. Bungie, what up? 14 buns. Welcome back, man. Sir Tofu was not bad. None too shabby, man. Oh, Doing it's kind my of okay. First time, ooh, ooh. Hanging in there, you know? Living the dream, some could say. I don't know what to call you. Logics? I think your name is supposed to be Logics. Logics, I think. Thank you for the. Ah, uh... oh, there you are. Thank you for the sub, buddy. Appreciate it, man. Are you standing up because you have to run to poo? No. No. If I had to poo, I would just go poo. Why would standing up even help that? I don't think standing up would even help that, would it? Maybe? I don't know. Does standing up help when you have to poo? Maybe? Is that logic sound? Oh, no. I've been decisively struck if... Yes? Oh, well. Then no. No, I don't have to poo. Hey, Dove, what do you think the teaser image could be? Fatal frame hype? Wait, what's fatal frame? Uh, bro, I don't know. I got no idea, man. Maybe, uh... Wait, was it Evil Within guy really into pictures? What's his name? What's the guy from Evil Within? Wasn't he like a photographer or something? Fatal Frame is great. I don't know what Fatal Frame is. But maybe, sure. I don't know. I was just going with that down shirt to get viewers. Yeah, do I get, Yeah, do I, do I have enough cleavage? Do you think I gotta, think I gotta cut my shirt out a little bit more? Re subby wubby uwu. A month of subbing. Marlon Martian, thanks for the two months. Welcome back, man. Appreciate you, man. A thank you, man. A welcome back in, man. A good to have you, man. Drink some ow! I just hit my fucking arm on the desk and it hurt like hell. I gotta drink some water, man. I've not drank water in a while, man. I'm feeling kind of dehydrated, Three man. Subby wubby oo woo. A one wee zowie 30 months already. Middle frame is where you play a Japanese schoolgirl that defeats ghosts by taking pictures of the by taking pictures of them. Wow, no wonder I've never played it. That sounds fucking horrible. That sounds literally awful. I really hope they don't add that. GG's. Stefano, yeah, Stefano. Yeah, 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 yeah. Stefano was cool, dude. He was one of my favorite villains. Like those like little still frames of people dying and there was like blood like splashing or whatever. That was such a cool part of Evil Within 2. I fucking loved that shit. That shit was so cool. I gotta spend some blood points and play some ads, but then I'll do uh. But well, then I'll do Hunk's build afterwards. Hunk, did you give a build? Is it in the build thing? It is. Demo with any, any, Shadowborn, Bloodward, and Mad Grit action. Re subby wubby uwu. Thomas, tier two, $10, big dick sub. Welcome back in, dude. 32 months. Appreciate it, man. Thank you, buddy. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. I gotta play some ads, guys, okay? Who tofu to fuck with the ads? Who tofu to fuck with the ads? Who? Fatal Frame's amazing, one of the OG survival horror with... Did they make multiple games? Like, is there more than one Fatal Frame? Why the... I feel like it sounds vaguely familiar, but why do I not know anything about it? I'm, I'm watching season four finally, so I'm feeling Demogorgon-y. Yeah, that's fair. Demogorgon in season four kind of threw me off. I'm used to seeing him in DVD. So when I saw him in season four, I was like, oh yeah, that's what a Demogorgon does, huh? <laughs> oh yeah. Right. 
Obviously, you were too cool for it. I was probably too poor, realistically. Realistically, I probably would have played it if I had it. I mean, at the time, I wasn't really a weeb hater, you know? I didn't even know what a weeb was until, like, literally, like, I don't know, like, eight years ago or something. So I probably would have played it if I had the opportunity. But, uh, I don't know. Now that I'm an adult and I hate weebs and I also happen to never play it through pure chance, I'm going to make fun of it and say that anybody that played it's a fucking weeb. <laughs> fucking weebs. Fucking weebs in your fatal frame. <laughs> yeah. It's more of a cult classic that was more popular in Japan than in the US. Yeah, that makes sense. Because, I, I, again, I, I feel like comparing it to, like, Silent Hill and Resident Evil, like, I think it's hard, like... It's hard to not know those games. Like, I, I never even played a Silent Hill game growing up, but I still knew what Silent Hill was. You know what I mean? You play Final Fantasy X. Final Fantasy X is not weeb, though. What do you mean? Nothing about it is weeb. Yeah, Kamari's a cat boy. Yeah, Orin's a, a, a samurai. But it's not weeb shit. Fuck you. Yeah, I bet you're right, Calderies. You up for the cat? Thank you for the seven months. Welcome back, dude. Appreciate you, bud. Thank you, man. Guys, I gotta go back to sitting. I gotta go back to being a sit down game. I've had enough standing. Ghosty, you're in my seat. You share the seat, Ghosty? Ugh, can I sit down in front of you and you won't move? Maybe, kind of. Nope, nope, he's moving. Oh, maybe. No, he's just readjusted. Nope, he's moving. He's getting down. Fuck. Are you wearing a Zubat Lil t-shirt? Yes. I just got back. Is Tofu calling Fatal Frame weeb? Yes. I mean, the way it got described to me, it sounded very weeb. Yeah, Ghosty gave up the seat. Look, I was trying to share it with him. I gave him some room, but he didn't want to sit with me. I guess I'm too smelly or something. Mm -mm 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 -mm. Well, people said that you play as a Japanese schoolgirl, though. I think that's the part that got me feeling weeby, you know? It's not that the game is Japanese. They said you literally play as a Japanese schoolgirl. Like, that, that one's kind of hard to defend, right? Like, that's that sounds, that sounds peak weeb, right? I need to understand not everything Japanese is weeb. I know I play Final Fantasy X and I know that it's not weeby even though everyone else calls it weeby. You don't gotta tell me you're preaching to the choir here. Everyone's always telling me that I'm a weeb because I played Final Fantasy X even though it doesn't, even though Final Fantasy X is not weeby at all. I know the Japanese doesn't equal weeb, but I'm saying they're talking about playing as a Japanese schoolgirl, and I'm just saying that sounds weeby. It might not be, but it definitely sounds like it, you know? Sounds like it has high potential for weebness is all I'm, is all I'm getting at. You know? Let's do it. Shadowborn, Bloodwarden, Mad Grit, Agi. This is an interesting one. So female teens are weeby? Maybe. Probably. Playing a game is one that sounds weeby, yes. 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 My answer is yes. Final answer. Yes, final answer. What is female teens are weeb, Alex? Yes. Y'all ruined this for Topi with the description. I think you guys did. True. True. She just happens to be a Japanese teenager. The game is a hella big spookums. Oh. Let me Google it. Is Fatal Frame Weeb? I'm not getting any I'm not getting any answers here. Weeb Game News. Project Zero slash Fatal Frame 5. Oh, it's on something called Weeb Game News, though. Okay, let me just let me just Google Fatal Frame. Okay, yeah, that, that doesn't look terribly weeby. It definitely looks a little... I mean, yeah, no, it doesn't look weeby. It just looks Japanese. Wait. Why, why is she, like, not wearing anything in this one? Jesus Christ, put some fucking clothes on this girl. What the hell is this? Is she supposed to be, like, a teenager? Jesus Christ, man. Christ, brother. The fuck is this? I should not Google things. Holy hell. Have you asked Jeeves? I have not asked Jeeves anything in a long time. It's been a long time since I've asked Jeeves anything. Like, it's been a hot minute. 
I'm not talking to Jeeves in a while. Is Jeeves even still around? I, I kind of I kind of assumed Jeeves passed away or something. I like, it's been a minute. What up, Kloopies? How you doing, buddy? That's why meow me. Merry Christmas. Hope you had a good holiday. I'll share with your audience? No, I'm good. Nah, nah, I'll pass. Nah, I'm good. Nah, 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 I'm good. Thieve Deadly Shadows, and it wasn't even a horror game. I'm trying to think of what games freaked me out when I was a kid. I don't know if any of them did. Like, I remember watching my cousin play Resident Evil, like the original Resident Evil, when I was really young. And I just thought it was, like, super cool. Like, I thought it was neat. What or whom's is Jeeves? Jeeves was, uh... There was a website, kind of like... It was like a search engine. It was kind of like Google. But it was called Ask Jeeves. It was, like, way in, like, the early days of the internet, when, like, Google wasn't even that popular yet. It was like you would, you would use, like, Yahoo search. And, like, Bing. And then Ask Jeeves, you know? It was, like, one of the search engines. Holy fucking Rebecca's, dude. Jesus. Like 30 fucking Rebecca's here. Dude, there's so many Rebecca's. What is this? Old man search engine. Yeah, it was like a butler guy, too. Like, there'd be like a little picture of a butler guy, and he was Jeeves. And you'd ask him stuff. You'd be like, Jeeves, uh, what's the weather like today? And then he would tell you the weather, you know? You'd ask Jeeves things. This guy is in my brain, dude. He's too good. This man is too talented. Too bad I'm Demogorgon and my hitbox is gigantic. And you literally can't dodge it even if you tried because the hitbox is literally huge. This killer was really fun and fair. He's really good. Everyone loves him. He says he's the most fair killer in the game. Yes, he's so fun. Yes. Did you, did you, did you play Prey 2017? No, I don't know what that is. Did they boon? I think I might have heard booning, right? This so I should probably get rid of that. Uh, man, I'm gonna get drop down and get the unhook, I guess. Yes. Shit, which one's which though? I guess I'm just gonna get this one. This guy looks fast. I think he's got built-in bar time. I think I'm tunneling. I could be wrong, but I think I'm tunneling. Yeah, I'm tunneling. Pain. Hey man, not my fault. They're all playing Rebecca, you know. I'm Ryan Jelly. What up? It was Alexa before Alexa. Well, not really, because I don't think Jeeves talked to you. He was just a search engine. I don't think, right? I don't think you could actually, like, get a voice to be like, Hello, it's me, Jeeves. Like, I'm pretty sure it was just, like, a search engine. It was just, like, Google. It was like if Google had a name instead of it being Google. It's like if Google was instead called Frank. And you were like, Hey, Frank, what's up? Can you answer me some questions, Frank? And Frank was like, Sure, then gave you some answers. That's, like, what Jeeves was. You know? Yeah, yeah, you can phrase searches as questions. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Huh. Gen rushers. How could they? Well, there's two people here. I'll chase the full off guy. What are these weird noises the demo's making right now? Where are we going, man? Where the fuck are we going, bruv? He's got gas? Bro, I feel that demo. I feel that. Sometimes it'd be like that dog. This killer sucks. I hate that this killer exists. Why do people call this killer the most fun killer? This killer just does nothing but make me angry. Everything I see about this killer just fills me with rage. They, they boomed up somewhere though. I should probably find that. I didn't even go that far. It feels bad. Or didn't they boon over here somewhere? I don't know. I love playing against them. You're insane. You're literally insane. Why? He's like the most miserable killer to go against. He's awful. His hitbox is gigantic. He just zones you out of everything. Dead already. This guy's pretty good. I think this Rebecca in particular is like actually a kind of a juicer. I think she also was the one that played that pallet really good last time, right? I think. 
Oh, this is kind of risky. Does she make this? Dude, this killer is just so fucking stupid, though. He's just so stupid. Like, it's so dumb, man. Like, it's dumb. Why is he so dumb? Why do people like him when he's clearly so dumb? You know? God! Oh, which one was that? Oh, that was the outside one. There are much, much more miserable killers than Demo. I disagree. I disagree. I think there's like two. Maybe two more miserable killers. Oh, that snowman was a person. I wonder what their boon is. I say they're probably gonna come in the front door. I'd like to find their boon, but I just don't know where to look for it. Hey, gamer. It's over here somewhere, like on this side. I just don't know where. Maybe in this office? No. Demo lunge is the fastest in the game, yeah. We had people look it up the other day. Apparently, demo lunge is the fastest in the game. It's even faster than uh, Wesker's lunge, yeah. Like, it's really fucking fast. Oh, she's dead. Interesting. Is it like this corner, maybe? Aha! Nurse and Blighter were a C? I can maybe see that argument. But again, like... If, if you're just going to argue that, like, the most crazy OP killers are the only ones that are worse, then, like, that's not really making a very good case for the boy demo, you know what I mean? Like, that still sounds pretty miserable. Like, oh, at least he's not Blader Nurse. Like, that's not really saying much, you know? Like, I would argue maybe Pyramid Head is worse, too. I kind of hate Pyramid Head. Like, Pyramid Heads feel like it's literally just pure luck a lot of the time. Like, they'll literally just, like... Like, they'll put their sword in the ground, and then you're just like, well, hope I guess right, you know? Like, there's really no, like, I don't know. Like, there, there is some skill involved, I guess, and some, like, prediction or whatever, but a lot of times you can just die just from, um, just from being unlucky, you know? Like, through walls, no matter what. Like, there's really no, like, safe spot for you to go to. Like, sometimes you just fucking die. Playing knight properly? Yeah, maybe. I can see that, too. Maybe. Oh, gamers. This guy still has this pallet, right? He's, he didn't throw this before. Not throwing it again, huh? I think he's too far this time, though. Actually, I think I could have got that. Hmm. Well, never rubber decky. Never rubber dicky. First, first demo's unfair, now PP head? Yeah, kinda. I would say like in chase, in like a 1v1 chase scenario. In terms of like being like a balanced like chase for both sides where both sides have like equal chances at outplaying each other. I would say both demo and PP head are both very like not fair to the survivor. But also like again, if we're talking like 4v1, I think they're fine. Because in like a 4v1 scenario, like even killers that get guaranteed kills can still be balanced in the 4v1, right? Like, I think it's... Like, I'm not saying they're, like, overpowered. I'm just saying, like, in, like, a 1v1 scenario, if you're just, like, isolating the 1v1 and talking about, like, how fair each side is in terms of outplaying each other and chase or whatever, yeah, both those killers are fucking miserable, I would say. Can Hunters do what Demo does? Not really. Her her, her cooldowns and her, her, and her stuff is... Ooh, that was a good play. Her cooldowns and shit are way higher. Like, for instance, I can, like, start to do this and, like, go and start to do this and, like, go. Like, I can, I can literally come in and out of this with, like, no real significant slowdown to my speed. And I can cancel it and swing immediately afterwards. Like, like, like the way the demo can go in and out of his power with basically no, like, downside is insane. On top of, like, how fast the charge is to get, like, like that right there was insane. Like, how fast I charged that to get that hit. Like, you see how I can just, like, I can do that to zone and then just let go of it? Like, everything that I just did right there is stuff that hunters can't do. Like, you can just walk around going in and out of your power. You can, you can, like, you can let go of it and do it again. Like, you can literally just, like, do it as you please and it barely even, it, like, barely slows you down. And at any point, you can just dash forward with this, like, gigantic refrigerator-sized hitbox. It's just insane. Like, it's fucking wild, man. Double vault? Double vault? 
compare demo to Wesker. Yeah, Wesker has better cooldowns. Like Wesker, like when he goes into his tentacle, it takes like an entire second for him to go into his tentacle before he can use it, right? Like he can't like he can't like hold M2 for like a second and then instantly tentacle. And he also can't cancel it and instantly swing either, right? Like that's I think that's the biggest thing about demo. It's the fact that you can go in and out of this with like no penalty. Like there's no speed penalty, there's no like cooldown or anything. Like he can go in and out as he pleases with like barely any any penalty. I think that's the biggest issue with him, to be honest with you. Oh, oh, this is Megan. She had adrenaline. And I'm kind of tunneling. Oops. Whereas, like, with Wesker, for instance, like, he, like, has to, like, fill up the bar for, like, a whole second before he can dash. And then also, if he cancels it, he has, like, a, like, at least a little bit of a cooldown where he, like, can't move. I think he also moves slower while charging it, I think. Um, like, so many things are different about Wesker. What's a fair killer in your opinion? Um, I'd say Billy is very fair. Billy feels like a very fair killer. I mean, I'd say most, like any M1 killer is like, like they're fair, but like, I feel like they're fair in a way where like, they're fair assuming the maps are balanced. Like, I feel like on a balanced map, they're fair. It just like their main issue is that most maps in this game aren't balanced. So like they end up feeling very survivor sided in terms of like who can win chases or whatever. The hill tech, you fucked it up. You fucked up the hill tech gamer, you fucked it up. Now Meg dies. She dies and that's all your fault. We couldn't get Blood Warden, feels bad. If we could have been a little bit faster, we could have got Blood Warden. Like I think, okay, I'll say, I think Oni is fair. I think Oni is a good, a good example of a killer that's oppressive, but also fair. Cause like Oni, like in order for Oni to get his power, he has to get a hit while he's at a disadvantage. And then once he gets his hit and, and, and collects his orb, then he gets a massive advantage for like a limited amount of time. I think Oni is a really good example of a killer that's like really powerful and oppressive, but also fair. Like I love Oni. Like Oni is really, really good uh, in terms of killer design, in my opinion. Oops, I turned my camera off on accident, sorry. Leave Demo alone. You already got the biggest nerf of being removed from the game. Look, man, it's fine. I'll stop hating on him. I just... Look, man, it's been years of people calling Demo, like, the most fun killer. And I just, like... I, I just hate it. It drives me nuts, man. So I'm sorry. I'm sorry for just trashing on him the whole time. I just, you know? He's a little... He's a little bastard. He's just a little bastard, you know? I can't help it. I can't help it. He's just a little bastard. What are skeletons? What up? Um... That was the last build, I think. I think we're done on build request, right? Oni would definitely be fun to watch, but how many more builds? We we don't have any more. We're doing whatever now. Do you think they should revert the, uh, revert the nerfs to race out of cloak lunge? No, 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 no. I think that was stupid. I think race out of cloak lunge before it was stupid. We have 100% uh, bonus on survivor, so I'm just gonna play a game of survivor. Apparently I gotta take a hit while on a snowman, apparently. Let's go collect more flashlights. We got, dude, we got 53 of them bitches. Holy fuck. I was playing this game off stream the other day. I think I told you guys. I was playing this game off stream and I actually had some fun. And I, dude, I collected so many fucking flashlights, man. This shit was crazy. Playing in a four man was wild. I was like, I was escaping so much. So much more than solo queue. <laughs> I kind of forgot what it's like to play with a group as opposed to solo queue. Considering a high level, if Anoni doesn't get like two downs uh, when, uh, when his power's up, he's kind of screwed with the gens. I don't know if that's necessarily true. It depends on how you're playing. If you're like, if you're playing macro as Oni, like if you're holding down gens, like if you're holding down a three gen, I disagree. Like for instance, as an Oni player, if you get a, if you get one down in your power really, really quickly, and you're also in a three gen, you can literally just pick them up right away and hook them since you already, since you'll still have like 60% of your power. And then you kind of have a hook in a three gen and then also 60% of your power, you know? So like, I don't necessarily agree with that, but I, I get what you mean. I mean, if you're not holding down, like if you're kind of just playing loose macro and just kind of like, you know, doing whatever, then yeah, kind of, yeah. Zon, it's not something you can recover from. It's terminal. Yeah, you don't, it's not something you recover from, which is why the whole thing is so tragic. Like if it, if it wasn't like that, it would be a lot less of a tragic thing, but yeah.
I got my first CZ. I don't know what I'm doing. Console for all my life. Welcome, dude. Welcome to your new world. Your new world where anything is possible. I'm so happy for you. Hey, it's Lizard Seagull. And butts. Good old butts. Oh, hello. Do you think Unbreakable should inflict deep wounds? Wait, do you think Unbreakable should inflict deep wounds? Should it become base kit? Oh, uh, no, I don't really think it's necessary. I don't think it's necessary. No way, you again. Yes, me again. Mm, 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 mm. That water ball is bigger than you are? It is, dude. It is. It's like bigger than my head by a lot. It's fucking huge. But it's a good way to get me to drink a lot of water, you know? I've seen you like three times now. Is your name always Butts? Do I, do I know this person under a different name? Because I feel like I would recognize someone that went by their name Butts, you know? Maybe. Go on, Pulpo. Have a good night. Thank you for chilling, buddy. How likely is it that we'll see base get unbreakable after all that negative feedback? I would say it's still pretty likely, honestly. If there's one thing that the devs of behavior do often, it's uh, they don't take back changes that they make, I think, is something that you see pretty often from behavior. Like, I feel like when behavior, like, puts a lot of time and effort towards like coding something and like working on something i feel like it usually ends up coming to life in some form usually although i think there was something wasn't there something like semi recently a while back that they reverted i can't remember what it was i think i remember them reverting something at some point a while back and i was like really proud of them for doing it but i can't remember what it was metal of man yeah metal of man i think is what it was yeah i was really happy about that the finisher Mori? Well, no, the finisher Mori is a part of the base kind of breakable. That's not reverted. That's just still coming in the future. Then they revert pallets. What do you mean by pallets? Yeah, I think it was Metal of Man. I think, I think, I think that's what you guys were talking about. Or I, I, I think, I think that's what I was talking about. But even that one, even that one's not like a big thing, right? Like that's like a minor, like that's just like a minor perk change. I feel like when it comes to like big base game changes, like again, this like base kind of unbreakable finisher Mori thing. Feels like a big project that they've been working on for a long time. I highly doubt they're gonna just revert it. Like I really don't. I, I, I hate to be the bearer of bad news, but I feel pretty confident that they're just gonna force that down our throats, no matter what. Like they're gonna just be like, yeah, we're gonna find a way to make this work, no matter what. I'm pretty confident that's how it's gonna go. I could be wrong, but yeah. I mean, I don't know, Tin Can. They literally had like the whole like, with with the whole finisher Mori thing too. Like that was all tied together in one system, right? Like finisher Mori plus base gun unbreakable. Like all that was like in the same system. So I feel like I don't know if I agree with that. That toolbox is for you if you want it, dog. It's all you, homie. I want the flashlight. They kind of reverted the spine chill, the spine chill, chill change. I mean, not even that. They didn't really revert that. They just continued to change it more. Like they changed it, got some feedback, and then like changed it. They did like more changes on top of what they already did, basically. That wasn't like a revert. Again, I, I think the big thing is like again, it's I, I I like like to me, the the only thing that would convince me is if there was a time that they actually put like a lot of like time and manpower into like a big baseline like game change type thing. And then reverted it, which I just don't think has happened. I don't think I can get there to kick him. That's okay. I will hold on to him. I'll hold on to the little guy. Where's Charlotte? I'm kind of worried about where Charlotte is though. Okay, there she is. Hook of Vishant, what's up, dude? Hey, little guy. Hey, little guy, how you doing? Hey there, little guy. 
Hey, little guy. How's it going? Hey, gamer. I hate the behavior does that. What's the point in asking our feedback if you're going to do it anyway? Yeah, I mean, I, I agree. I don't like that either. I also agree. Yeah. I'm not a big fan of the fact that they basically... Like, it, it, it kind of feels like... Like, it feels like what behavior does is, like, they'll essentially decide... Like, they'll decide to do something, and then once they decide to do it, they'll basically, like, at that point, it's like they'll just take feedback on how to tweak it as opposed to, like, just getting rid of it. Like, I feel like the option of just getting rid of it and just not doing it feels like it's never on the table. It feels like it's more like, okay, well, they're gonna do it. So, like, how are you gonna, like, give them feedback to make it work? It's more like, help us make this work as opposed to, like, tell us not to do this. You know what I mean? If that makes sense? Which, yeah, I mean, I agree. I'm not a big fan of. Kick his ass, get him! Oh, I couldn't get him! Back to Charlotte, huh? The fact? That's weird. Are you sure you want to Charlotte? Well, hey there, gamer. Enduring? Is she an end fury Charlotte? You're not gonna go back to Victor? Fine by me, I guess. A little weird jam if you ask me, but hey, fine by me. I think I'll say thank you for the resub. 16 months, welcome back. Appreciate the support. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Hello, gamers. I need healed too. Hi, David. Perhaps heal me, friend. You still need to take a hit in the snowman? Yeah, but I'm not really in a big hurry for that. I can do that whenever. That's the last challenge I have out of literally every challenge in the whole thing, so. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Hey, bud. He's coming over here, I think. Sprinto burst. Oh, man. My fucking hands weren't on the keyboard for a second. That was close. I was, like, scratching my head. How you been, do how you been doing, Tofu? Pretty good, man. Pretty good. How about you? Things here are quite good, I'd say. Okay. I want to get that gen done at the hill because it's such like a central gen, you know? Kicked. She's going to come back right here, though. It's such like a central gen that like I would like to get it done. It's like so easy for her to like patrol and it's so easy for her to pressure. Hey, Gamer. I just ordered recovering from non-surgery. Pretty good, actually. Pretty good. I don't quite have, like, full movement yet, but I have, like, close to full movement. Oh, no. Butts is on death hook. We gotta protect Butts. Fine by me. I want to heal Butts. Butts, come here! Come here, Butts! We need to get you full health, Butts. You're on death hook. We can't have you running around injured like this. You coming over? No, I think we're good. Hi, Shelby. What up? You should be able to blind Charlotte and make a recall Victor. You can actually stun her to do it. Like, if I wanted to, I could have thrown that pallet and stunned her, and I think it kicks her out and, like, I think it kicks her out of Victor and, like, brings her back to Charlotte, I think. But I don't think you can do it with blinding. I think it's only stunning. Tobu, I've become a fort nutter. Dude, it's a fun game, isn't it? Fortnite's like, again, I didn't expect it to be fun. Like, when I heard about no build, I was like, that sounds stupid as shit. But honestly, it's like surprisingly enjoyable. Like, it's actually quite fun. It's weird, because I don't think it should be, but it is. Very odd. She's committing to that David? Seems like it. 
<laughs> Unlucky, dude. Unlucky. I was say she should she, she, she should still have bought her time, right? And she did. Damn, butts had a boon the whole time and hasn't been booning. No, if only it was a sniper rifle and it's not a sniper rifle. Fuck. Oh shit, that looks like agitation. That dare killer looks awfully agitated, if you ask me. David, I'm gonna need you to get the fuck out of here. Just kidding. Sick moonwalks, bro. Man's got the walks. He's got the walks on the moon, that guy. It does, but which of the five people in the world that still play twins goes victor mode under a pallet? Apparently this guy. Apparently this guy right here. Yeah, I don't know. Victor? Whiff! Come here, you little bastard! Oh, you're too fast. Too good, dude. Just too skilled. Far too talented at the video game for me. I got your kid! I got your kid! What are you gonna do about it, failure? I got your son. Hiya! I feel like she probably has Enfury, right? Like, I've seen Enduring, but I haven't seen the Fury. I've only seen the End and not the Fury. I guess she lost me. I'm out of here. I was hesitating because I haven't played it in years and so much has changed and my friends convinced me and it's so much fun. Yeah, it's, it's, it's kind of built to be super casual, you know? Like, I feel like what happened with Fortnite... Oh, wait, butts might need help. I feel like what happened with Fortnite is that, like, it stopped being casual because, like, people got really, really good at building. And, um... It made it, like... It made, like, the skill gap way too high. Uh-oh. Whereas I feel like no build is kind of built to be casual, so it's kind of nice. Like if you get if you get like a bunch of like sweaty god gamers, they don't really like shit on you quite as hard. No, I couldn't save butts. No, I just wanted to save butts, not like this. Pain. Man, how is butts always ending up in these spots where butts was dying? Man, fucking feels bad, dude. You hate to see it. That boon's gonna go away too. What's he going for? Back to the gen? Huh. Oh, there's a gen over here, too. That's interesting. If I do this one, though, there's one, two... Where's the third one? Down there, I think. This one feels like the not three gen one, and everyone else is the three gen one. Would, bins, would twins be too strong if Victor can down a survivor if they held him hostage for too long? Probably not. Where's Charlotte, though? I really want to get this hill gen done, dude. I really want to get it done. Looks like she's on David. I think he's going to run her this way, though, which kind of sucks. Kinda. Not really. I definitely have some time. She's probably going to come back now, though. All right, I got to borrow this loop. Hey, Tofu. It's me, but normally I'm my Twitch username, but I decided to be dumb today. XT hope you're doing well today. Ah, hello. Happy to see you in the match again. Hi, Butts. Thanks. Sorry we couldn't save you, Butts. What's she doing? Oh, she's waiting to Victor, I see. Thank you for 100 bits, man. Appreciate it, dude. Thank you, thank you, thank you. 
<laughs> later, bitch. L -l 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 later, bitch. I still, wanna, I still don't know if we're going to get that hill gen done, though. We're, we're kind of three gen, like somewhat. We have that one there. We have like one in that jungle gym that David was. And then we, where's the third one? I know, I know that there, there was the fourth one out there. I think the third one's like off to the side over there, right? Or is it way in the back? Is it that one way in the back? Or maybe that one way in the back, actually. Which might actually be okay. I think I can kick Victor while she's carrying. Eerie pendant. What the fuck? Is that my first time I kicked Victor all game? That's surprising that's my first time seeing it. Or do you only get it whenever you kick him while he's like idle? Maybe you don't get it when you kick him from like missing, I guess. Maybe I just didn't realize that. Victor's probably coming? Maybe not though. Yeah, I think we're fucked. Oh, wow. He's right there, actually. Interesting. Did she not realize that we were, like, right there? Oh, my Jesus fucking Christ. I think I'm dead. Do I make this? I might make this. Yeah, I make it. But then what else do we have? Is there still a pallet here? Maybe? She'll probably turn around, right? I gotta hold down my 3-gen. Hold on. My 3-gen's in danger. My 3-gen. Hold on. My 3-gen. Oh, yeah. We lose. Yeah. I think I think we I think we only win this through like super disciplined like we would need to we, like we would need butts to still be alive basically put a boon away from the three gen and then just like hold down the three gen all game forever essentially is the only way that we win this I'm gonna try to buy them some time just through being an obnoxious though what if Victor hindered you that's a horrible idea don't like it. Shit. Oh, this is really close. Okay, that breaks the three gen. But now we gotta get out of here and like not die though. Why she keep hooking on that hook in particular? It's very odd. Because now we have one there and one way back in the back. It's just a matter of like, can we not get fucking snowballed on since we're all injured and shit? There's also like nothing down here. Yeah, so I was gonna say, if she commits to me, I die. I gotta just go to the corner. I was gonna wait and see if I can wait for my exhaustion and then dead hard, but yeah, what are we gonna do? How many builds are in the queue? None. I'm currently doing a non-build because there's no builds in queue. So yeah, if you, if you get five subs right now, you can choose next build. We currently have none in queue. We are all caught up. I'm mostly surprised that Victor does it. Wesker Virus does. Yeah. I think Wesker Virus hindering you is a really bad design choice, though. Like, I think that is horrible design, in my opinion. We should maybe heal. Like, I think healing up and resetting is probably the play here. Why do you think it's horrible design? Because it encourages tunneling like super I fucking heavily. Scammed him. I fucking and it also just kind of puts a time limit on again, your chase. Dude. I'd fucking do it again. Like too. it's it's very unfun to have a killer where it feels like your chase is just on a time limit. Like that's why people didn't like old Legion, you know? Like like OG original release Legion was so hated because it felt like your chase was just on a timer. Like it felt like there was really no skill involved. It felt like it was like I mean, I guess with Wesker, at least there's a little more skill because you have to at least land one hit or whatever, but it just, it sucks to feel like no matter how good or bad you play, you're just like on a timer because once, you know, X thing kicks in, you basically just lose the chase, you know? Bloodlust, Bloodlust, Bloodlust does that anyway? No, it doesn't. Bloodlust, you can, like, there's Bloodlust safe pallets that exist. Like, Bloodlust only does that if you're in like a very certain, like in a very like niche situations, Bloodlust does that. Like if you're isolated at a tile with no other tiles to transition to, and then also the killer commits the Bloodlust, and then maybe. But that's like a very niche situation. That's not like every situation, you know?
He can literally catch up to you in a second with his dashes. Yeah, like he's a very like he's already a very strong chase killer. Like that, that's what's weird to me. Like his chase is already very powerful. So like it's weird to give him like even more power with like the like insane, you know, keep people hindered thing. And the hindered is also like huge. Like the number is really high. So it just it just feels like a lot for no reason. Want a killer that doesn't really need it. She cut through the middle? She went Victor? Apparently Victor's over here. That's interesting. Back to Victor? David, go do that gen. Go do that gen, David. I think he's holding a sprint burst, but trying to go. Where'd Victor go? Oh, I think he's on David. I'll pressure, like, I'll pressure this one if he pressures that far one. Like, we can totally beat this. Hey, on, what up, buddy? Uh, we'll see. I think that the new big ass gallon of a, or sorry. Do you like that new big ass gallon of a water bottle? Yes. <laughs> good, 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 good. Got his ass. Gave him the old spin a rooney, baby. Please don't enter and fury me. Okay, good play. That was well played. What do you think Wesker's virus should do? Um, I think it'd be fine as long as it just doesn't go up and chase. Like, I think it can go up much, much faster. But it only go up outside of Chase. I think that'd be fine. Boy Judas, thanks for the raid, dude. Appreciate it, man. Thank you, buddy. Hope you had a good stream, my guy. Thank you, thank you, thank you. This is such a death corner. There's nothing here. But I think I have to do this. Actually, she never broke this palace. I guess this palace is still here. I think I have to. Like, this is our only chance of winning. It's just me hard committing to this. So what do you do if a, if, if a Wesker if a Wesker moonwalks you just to give you the slightly slower speed and chase? That's worth it because it doesn't just straight up kill you. Like he's gonna be wasting so much time just to get a slowdown. That's dumb. Like the thing that makes Wesker insane is that he can even play chases normally with his powerful killer that's already powerful in chase. So it's already difficult to outplay him, right? And then even if you do outplay him, you then get hit with the slowdown on top of him already playing correctly, right? Like, if he had to, like, do dumb moonwalk bullshit just to fucking make you slow to down you, then that would make it very not worth, right? It would be really, really easy to just not throw any pallets, and then even while you're slow, you can probably use pallets and shit. Oh, unluck, brother, unluck. Unluck, brother, unluck. I gotta hope that if he... I gotta hope that if she comes to me right now, I can just take a hit and then run to the other gate and hope that David's doing it. Do I just get this? No, I don't get this. I gotta hope that David's gate's open. That's really the only thing I can do. He's not on it, is he? Oh, he is on it. Please? He took forever. Fuck. He didn't get hit either. She's going to be paranoid about me getting out that gate so I can get out this gate. I'm pretty sure she'll be too paranoid to come over here. Oh, let's go, dude. Easy peasy, baby. We out of this bitch. We out of this bitch. That was tough. God damn. God damn. Hey, I'm proud of that David for actually like coming through and like doing the gen as well as uh, getting that gate, though. That was sick. That was really, really good of him. Touche, man. Touche. Captain Deadeye, thank you for the subs, by the way. You get a build. You get next build. Let me know what you want, man.
I feel like you've become a, song, a stronger survivor since you've been playing so much more of it. Yeah, I've gotten a lot. I was like, I was really washed for a while there. I was like really, really, really washed for a while there. So I'm glad that like, since I started playing Survivor more, I I, I feel a lot less washed now. <laughs> like I, I I think I took like maybe like a year and a half where I didn't play Survivor like at all and basically played only killer. Like I would dabble in Survivor like once in a while, but I basically played only killer. And then I got back on Survivor and I was just, I was so boosted for a while there. Like I was like not doing well at all. But yeah, I've been playing Survivor a little bit more lately and I'm feeling like I'm already back to being kind of comfortable. Like I, I don't know. I feel like I'm able to use dead hard and I feel like I'm also like, I don't know. I'm not like, I still feel like I can get better. Like, I don't think I'm like the best I can be, but like, I'm at least not like, I at least don't feel like I'm a, like I'm a totally wash boosted idiot. Like I was for a while there. <laughs> at least, thank God. I want the Houdini build. I guess you know how it works. Bite the bullet, lucky break, distortion, overcome, purple med kit. Okay, I'm gonna play some ads, but then I'll set, but I'll set this up uh, towards the end. Bite the bullet, lucky break. Distortion overcome. Purple med kit, 16 charges. Any indoor map. Best is RPD. Get hit, get distance without scratch marks, blood. Break LOS and heal in the weirdest spots next to the killer who will not hear you healing. Yeah, like find like a dumb corner to heal in or something. What's a. Yeah, is, is RPD dark? I feel like ideally you want like a dark map, right? Like a dark indoor map. Which is definitely like. I think RPD is probably the best word for that. Like I don't think Larry's or the game is very dark. Maybe Midwitch. Midwitch definitely could work, but Midwitch also has a lot of like long straight hallways. So I feel like it's going to be harder to break line of sight. I think RPD is probably the one for this. I feel like RPD just has too many long straight hallways though. Like it feels like I'm definitely not guaranteed to break line of sight on Midwitch when I get hit. Also, it feels like even, even if I do, it feels like when you run into rooms, it feels like there's very obviously like a handful of rooms that you can go into. So it's probably going to be less hard to hide as well. I think RPD is just better in pretty much every way. When's the pick yourself update coming? Um, no idea. No idea. Couldn't tell you. I don't think anybody can tell you. Shit, it might be next PTV, dude. We don't know. Do we know what's in the next PTV? Have they have they like hinted at anything? Honestly, they can like like they could be testing it again next PTV. I have no idea. All right, let's do it on this build. So you want, you want lucky break, bite the bullet, over cam. What was the last one? Am I stupid? Distortion, 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 distortion. I guess that's just in case like nurse is calling. Distortion page three? It is. There's a lot of fucking A, B, C, D perks. Jesus Christ. And then a purple med kit. I'm guessing just like a bunch of heals, right? Just a purple med kit with like a bajillion charges. Plus 16 charges, any indoor map. I mean, that's plus 16. I guess we don't really need the plus eight. We could just do like extra speed, maybe. I feel like, I feel like I'm actually going to do the extra charges just in case I get caught out. Like if I happen to get caught out, like say if I use like four charges and then get caught healing and then they kill me, like if it doesn't work. Then I'm gonna want it. Like I, I think I'm gonna want a little bit back up. So I think I actually am gonna run. I think I'm gonna do the extra eight. I think that's fine. All right, this seems good. But then we'll do RPD. All right, we'll see if it works. We will see if it works. Spoiler: He gets plague. If I get plague, I'll do it again. I'll, I'll, if, if I happen to get plague, I'll give you a second chance. All right, Ghost. I didn't know you were down there, buddy. Sorry right, to pet my cat. I kind of like nudged him with my foot, and while he was sleeping. Sorry, right, bud. Didn't realize you were sleeping. Mid chat, there's an eight days. Uh, they said that they weren't gonna do it until next year. But actually, yeah, eight days is next year, so that's a good point. It could be, could be, could be in eight days. Toby, I have sinned. I started playing Genshin, and I kind of like it. You, what? You fucking weeb! How could you? How could you? That's okay. That's okay, man. Embrace your inner weeb. It's fine. Do what you gotta do. Hi, Ghoster. Hi. Oh. Hello, Ghosty. Hello, Ghoster. Did I wake you up? Were you taking a big old fat nap and I woke you up, huh? Is that what happened? 
poor little guy. He's a comfy kitty. Yeah, you're a comfy kitty, aren't you, bud? Aren't ya? So comfy boy. So floofy comfy boy. Someone dodged the lobby? What happened? Why is it taking so long? Hey. The mid chapter is like eight, nine weeks later. How? And then, uh, now instead of six weeks? Yeah, I think it's because of the Christmas break. I think it was a little bit later than it was like scheduled to be. Like rather than six weeks, I think it was like eight or something because of the holidays. Which is kind of interesting because I think that means after the mid chapter, we will probably get like... After the mid chapter, I think we'll probably get the new chapter like not too long after, right? I would imagine. Like we'll probably get the mid chapter then like four weeks later, I mean, shit, it might be like a, like, when the mid chapter actually hits live, it might be like a week, and then we get the PTB for next killer or something like it. I think, I think the timetable for the next thing might end up moving really fast, unless they push it all back. I don't know. Hard to say. I guess I don't know. Hi, Gazelle Lover. Good morning. Hello, hello. I became a weeb, and I liked it. Taste of that. Oh, wait, you're doing the... Came a weeb and I liked it. That gotcha magic. Yeah, that's right. Dude, fucking goddamn gotcha games, man. I've been thinking, I've been, again, I've been thinking about taking raid sponsors again, but I can't tell whether I like want to or not. Like, I can't tell whether I feel okay morally doing it. You know what I mean? Like, part of me just is like, fuck it, who cares? Get that bread. But like, it's the fact that they like. The, it's the fact that they like do like they model it around basically getting you to like get people to play, you know Like they like they, they basically they're like hey go get your community to smoke the crack And you're like, but I don't want to get them to smoke the crack and they're like no do it make them smoke the crack And you're like, but I don't want them to smoke crack and they're like too bad. They're getting they're, they're smoking the crack make them hit the crack pipe Oh shadow step, baby That's gonna help our case a little bit too. Did she fall down the hole? No, I don't know what happened. Mm -mm -mm. Hey, Cryptovention's gone. Thanks, man. Do it if you get to say whatever you want and not follow a script. Yeah, I don't have to follow a script, but like, I don't know if I would be allowed to say to not spend money on the game. I'm not sure if they would allow me. Like, that's a big thing. If I could hypothetically say don't spend money on the game. Also, did she have lethal? Why am I missing a stack? Was that lethal? I guess I missed it. Like, hypothetically, if I'm allowed to say, like, guys, I don't recommend spending money on this game. If I'm allowed to say that they're a sponsor, then I'd be down. But I feel like they probably wouldn't want me to say that, you know? That feels like something they probably would not allow in the sponsor. They need to make money. Exactly. Well, that's the whole point. I mean, and that's, and, and that's also, I think, why they pay well. Like, raid sponsors pay decently well. And I think that's why. It's because when people do get into the game and get, like, more addicted to it, if they're prone to like spending money on games, motherfuckers will spend way too much money on that game, you know? Like it's got very like, I don't know. I don't like using the word predatory, but maybe predatory is the only way to describe it. Like monetization, you know? It's very, uh... where does he think he's chasing? Where, where, didn't we have all three survivors behind us? Am I dumb? Is there Ben Rimmer out there? What's up, Luke? I'm shrouded in mystery. I think she's gonna commit to that guy. What's predatory about it? Um, basically they have like, like they have like all these like things that you could like, that you have to like grind in order to get strong or whatever, right? Like you gotta like beat these dungeons and stuff, but also like you gotta like unlock different characters to like do it. 
and different characters like there's like certain characters that do different things and you like need certain characters to get past certain levels if that makes sense like there's certain characters that are strong for each dungeon like there's like there might be a particular dungeon that's really important to grind for like gear but in order for you to grind that dungeon you need like at least one of like a, an assortment like it might not necessarily be one character but it might be like one out of like 10 or 20 that specialize in that dungeon but also getting those characters is rng right like you have to just like open shards which is like how you get characters right it's like a loot crate system almost um and to get shards you either have to like just grind your ass off through like daily rewards or pay money right it's like okay you can like play every day for the next like three weeks to get some shards and try your luck or you can pay a bunch of money and have way more chances you know so basically people that are impatient and would rather throw money at things rather than like grinding will just throw money at it and then if they don't get the character they want then they'll feel like they're already invested so they'll spend more and more money right it's one of those like sunk cost things where like if you start to pay money in it and then you like don't get the people that you need or if you're like hitting walls of progression you're like well fuck i already spent money i might as well spend more money right like it feels like once you break that wall of spending money you like want to keep spending money like you don't want to just like you don't want to just like hit a wall you're like oh, well, i already committed to spending money to not fucking you know hit walls i might as well just keep doing it at this point you know so yeah I don't know it it sucks too because like i actually think raid's a fun game like this is my potential hot take i actually like raid as a video game and i think it's really fun like i genuinely enjoy it like when i took the first sponsor i played it for a long time like i played it for like a year straight where's this huntress i'm scared oh she saw him like, I grinded the fuck out of it. And I really enjoyed it, too. Like, I actually liked it a lot. I thought it was a great game. But to me, I find it fun when you don't... Uh-oh. I don't think we're going to make this work, dude. We didn't really get much distance here. Yeah, we, we couldn't make it work. Huntress, Huntress makes that not really that doable, especially when you're in a bad spot like that. It feels bad. Of course, I that's the first place we get him. hit. I fucking scammed him. And I'd do it again, too. I'd Jump in, Ningo. Thank you for the five subs. Appreciate it, buddy. Thank you, man. Welcome in all the new subs. Good to have you guys in. Appreciate it, dude. Thank you, buddy. You get the next build. How the first one hit? It's just a Hunter's hitbox. Hunter's hitboxes are big. Like, hatchet hitboxes are big. I'm playing it now, but it takes about a year of daily playing to get anywhere. Yep, that's how it is. I mean, I will say that, like, it speeds up a lot once you get a good clan boss team. Like, if you, if you can start, like, hitting high levels of clan boss... The, like, progression speeds up rapidly. Like, you start to get shit really, really quickly. Like, I don't know. But still, regardless, it still is like that, right? Like, it still is a very, like... You get, like, you hit, like, blocks of progression, kind of. I need to get healed up so I can keep my, my lucky break. Glow aura on hit? I mean, I still have two stacks, so I don't know. I didn't, I didn't see... But, like, did I lose a bunch of stacks? I'm not sure. I wasn't paying that much attention. She might have a concoction. I'm not sure. Are you a candy corn enjoyer? No, I hate candy corn. I think that shit's nasty. I think candy corn's like the nastiest shit ever. Where is she? Just upstairs? I don't know. I'm just going to get you. Almost everyone's on death hook, man. Shit is getting scary, man. What's your favorite candy? Does, like, do chocolate bars count as candy? Reese's sticks. I literally have one right beside me. They're so good. Love Reese's sticks. But if you mean, like, candy candy, like, if you don't count, if you don't count chocolate bars, I don't think I like candy. Are you an indica or sativa guy, Tofu? I don't get high, so I don't know. Although, I kind of want to try getting high again. I've 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 kind of developed anxiety over the years, and I wonder if I wonder if getting high would help. Which kind of which what what strand helps with anxiety? I haven't gotten dude. I, I tried getting high one time in the past like twelve years. Like I used to be a stoner when I was like a teenager, and I tried getting high like one time like maybe like a year ago, and it was fucking miserable, dude. That shit just made me so like it made me feel so shitty. I was not about it. Indica's good. Indica's better. Okay. Good to know.
You love the chocolate peanut butter combo, don't you? Don't you, Mr. Krabs? Don't you, Squidward? You like Krabby Patties, don't you, Squidward? Yeah, no, I like I like chocolate peanut butter for sure. Anything chocolate peanut butter, and I'm fucking in there, dude. I'm in there every time, baby. Oh, that was kind of dirty. That was kind of a dirty hatchet, dude. Who is this guy? Who the fuck is this guy, man? Man's hitting hatchets, bruv. Do we still have a do we still have a Jennifer here? I don't know. I started again in very small amounts. Turns out Sativa was fucking my anxiety up when I thought it was the better option. Having a little indica and just being by myself made it made it okay. Yeah. Yeah, I don't know. I think I think my problem is that weed is just like really. I think weed is just really strong nowadays. Is that true? Is there anybody in here that's been smoking weed for like 15 years that can answer this? Is weed just way stronger now than it used to be? Like I like I remember the last time I got high, I like barely even smoked that much. Like, I think I maybe even just took, like, one hit and held it for a while. And I got, like, really high. And I was like, what the fuck? Like, I remember when I was young, it, like, one hit wouldn't do that much to you. You know what I mean? Like, I feel like shit is really strong now. Motherfuckers, like, turbo juice in their fucking plants and shit. I don't know. I don't know what the fuck's going on. Okay, see if we can do this. Shit, this is not really a good spot. Not a terrible spot, but she's gonna find. I can't sneak here. I could really find a corner. No pain, and she has resetting too. Oh, the head on. Shh, she'll never know. Shh, she'll never know. Okay, it's fine. She'll never know. That Jane is a fucking lifesaver, dude. Oh, she died too. Not like this. Silencio. He knows I'm nearby now, though. I think you just lost your tolerance. I mean, you could be right, but I feel like even again, even like when I got high for the very first time as like a teenager, when I weighed like half what I weigh now, I feel like I like one hit wouldn't have got me as high as I got. Like, I know that my tolerance is probably, like, horrible, but... Well, that's really unfortunate. You hate to see that. You absolutely just hate to see that, man. Body weight doesn't matter for weed? Wait, really? I figured it would. Kind of like alcohol? Does it not matter? That's interesting. Oh, she's hooking. <laughs> Got up to immediately fall back down like a Looney Tunes character. I know, I kind of feel bad. Did we just lose a stack? No. I wasn't sure if that was barbecue or not. I've heard a lot of people say it's gotten a lot stronger over the last few decades. Yeah. It seemed like it to me, but yeah, maybe I, I might just not know. I heard it. Do you accept? Do you accept my offering? She might. I don't know. I can't tell if she accepts or not. She kind of was just looking at me, you know? I think she accepts. I think. She did a little nod, did she? I didn't see the little nod. Poggers, let's go. Motherfucking poggers, let's go. She respects the med kit offering. You love to see it. You love to see it, man. But what can killers do with med kits? Nothing. It's the thought. It's the thought that counts. Okay. It's not there to be practical. It's just there to be a good, uh, a, a, a show of good gesture, you know? A good show of good gesture? What am I trying to say? It's, it's meant to just be a, you know, a, a good... Chat, help me out. What, what what the fuck is the word I'm trying to say? English isn't my first language, okay? Cut me some slack, all right? Please. Show of goodwill. Thank you. Show of goodwill. Thank you. Thank you. 
Good faith, sure. Goodwill, good faith, sure. Sure, this guy's name is Just Killin'. Just Killin'. Not sure if I knew him by anything else. Doesn't seem like it. Yeah, I played well, though. I just buy this game. Hope this game doesn't hard as I saw. Ah, you'll be fine. You'll be fine, dude. You'll be fine. Okay, what's the next build? Uh, 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 Gerald Mandingo. Gerald Mandingo, my dingo. Oh, dingo, my dingo. Let me know what you want, man. Stream Nicki Minaj. Does Nick, dude, dude, does Nicki Minaj still make music? I kind of miss Nicki Minaj. Like, not that I'm like a fan of her music. I just kind of like, I like her sass. And I feel like I haven't heard her sass in a while, you know? He did, it's up. Can you repost it? Dude, dude, Bing Dingler, that's right. Bing Dingler. Good old Bing Dingler. That's right. You still out there making tunes? I feel like I haven't heard anything in a while, you know? Like, I feel like I've not heard anything from her. Like, I feel like I'm hearing, like, all kinds of other shit, but nothing from her. I'm just gonna play ads and just spend some blood points while I'm waiting. But Joe Bendingo, whenever you're, uh, whenever you're ready, man, I need you build. I need you build, my friend. Hi, Trey Lord. I'm doing good. How you doing, dude? Let's play Doctor with Pain Residence. No way out. Okay, 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 okay. I see you. I see you. I see you. Hi, Lindy. What up? Doctor? We'll save, we'll, we'll save the scrap tape build. Actually, this is the loose boy build, though. Yeah, yeah, fuck it. Um, Pain Residence, No Way Out, No Edge, Sloppy Butcher. Sloppy, what am I missing? Pain res. Uh, purple discipline with the green shock range add-ons, prestige three full outfit, and an eerie mori. Okay, we're running some pretty good. Uh, we're running a pretty good build here, aren't we? Doing a pretty good one, aren't we? Bam, bam, bigly. We in there? Isn't Nikki married to a pedo? <sighs> fuck if I know. I don't. I don't. I don't really pay attention to what the fuck celebrities do with their personal lives. I got no idea. I got no idea, failure. Dude, dude, dude. Who the fuck adds tofu? No, no, no. It's who tofu to fuck with the ads. You know, close enough though. 16 out of 20 RPD escape. Is this guy going to be burning an RPD offering? Do I got to let this, like, do I got to, like, do I got to let this guy escape out of the gate on RPD if it, if it's convenient? She married her brother? What? Yeah, what? I don't, guys, I don't. To be, to be honest with you, I don't care. I don't care who Nicki Minaj married. I don't care. When it comes to like celebrities and artists, I don't give a single fuck about their personal life at all. Like I just don't care at all. It don't matter. They can marry whoever the fuck they want. I don't give a shit. I just think your music counts. I, I just think your music counts, sounds kind of sassy and I kind of just miss hearing it sometimes, you know? Like on the, on the occasion that I got to listen to shitty pop music, I just miss the occasional sassy Nicki Minaj, you know? Asmon, what's up, buddy? How's it going, dude? Hello, hello, hello. I really enjoyed the YouTube compilations lately. Thank you, man. I think Scoops Ahoy Steve has been fucking killing it. Oh, we lost the guy that had the RPD thing. Yeah, Scoops Ahoy Steve has been fucking killing it, dude. He's been doing so good. So, so good. Also, I'm going to be uploading more, by the way, guys. I have a randomizer kind of that, that, that's ready to go. And I also recorded another uh, Adept video. So I'm going to be uploading more videos myself again soon. I know it's been a while since I've actually uploaded like an actual video other than like compilations. But we're going to have uploads again very, very soon. I'm trying to get back into the swing of things. Like, I was kind of like, I kind of like took time off when I was like, um, like recovering and shit. But, uh, yeah, 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 yeah. We're going to make a one hour trapper guide. A 130 page trapper guide. How's the shoulder? Not bad, man. Pretty good. Pretty good. None too shabby at all. Yeah, fuck R. Kelly. 
Yeah, yeah, fuck R. Kelly. Like, okay, I don't care what people do in their personal lives unless they're like coming for minors. Then I kind of care, you know? You're not wrong about that. Fuck R. Kelly. R. Kelly can suck a dick. His music sucks anyway, though, to be fair, so fuck him. Do you know how to read it or is this a pre-recording? This is a pre-recording. I'm just really good at predicting what you guys are going to say. I did not have the second surgery. It's going to be a long time. Like they're like they're basically waiting for me to recover. It's going to be like months. I don't know. I'll probably have it in like March or some shit or April. I would assume. Like it's going to be a while. I'd assume. Except that time he was on Chappelle's show. Was he on Chappelle's show? I don't remember. It sounds familiar, but why? In what in what section? Oh, he likes. Did he sing with him? No, that was. I'm thinking of Wayne Brady. I keep thinking of Wayne Brady. Like, when was R. Kelly on? Oh, was it the piss, 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 drip, 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 pee on you? That one, the parody. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I want to pee on you. I remember now. Yeah, I remember. <laughs> hmm. I don't even want none of the above. I want to piss on you. Piss, piss, piss. Drip, drip, drip. Pee on you. They booned up somewhere. Maybe upstairs here. This map sucks, man. Ugh. This map is fucking ass. Brother, please. Please, brother, please. <laughs> Thanks, brother. Thanks for reading that hit for me, brother. Appreciate that there, failure. Uh, blah, 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 blah. They're jet rushers. Blah, 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 blah. They're jet rushing. Blah, 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 blah. Jet rushers. Blah, blah, blah. I think there was two people on that, Jen. So where are the rest? I don't know. Three subby wubby oo woo. Four motherfucking months. Four motherfucking months. This is not where you want to be against Doctor, dude. Like, this is certainly not where you want to be against Doctor. Henri, what up? Four months. Welcome back. Hi, Ghosty. Do you want out of the basement? Is that why you keep looking at me like that? I keep looking over and Ghosty's just like giving me this look. If they throw this palette on me, then honestly, so be it. Look at this kitty. Just the way it's supposed to be, right? Hi, kitty. <laughs> just kidding. We're good. Meow. Yeah, I'll let you out in a second, buddy. Let me finish this game, okay? Oh, shit. They're all up there. Fuck me. What makes you want to play Scary Murder Man? What are you saying to me? <laughs> hmm. Man, I'm a, I bet this Vittoria wishes this pallet was here. Too bad Yoichi was like, fuck that, man. <laughs> no vault for you! God, dude, fucking discipline is such a nuts Adam. Being able to get that instant shock is so nuts. I want to scourge. I want to scourge. Night, night test. Have a good night. Get some rest, homie. How does one counter doctor? Pre throw pallets. Pre throw pallets that are double sided and then hold W. Basically. Uh, sometimes you can't counter them though. Sometimes you just get hit. That's just how doctor is. But some pallets can be pre-thrown, and then you kind of hold W at them. It depends, though. It depends on the pallet. It depends on where you are. It depends on a lot of things. Don't get sick. Yeah, you, you eat an apple a day. You eat an apple every day, and then doctor can't get anywhere near you. Easy peasy. Oh. Okay. I want my four stacks and no way out, man. I'm trying to get my powerful endgame, man. Is there a pallet here? I don't know. There might be. I'm scared. There's not. There's no god pallet there anymore, right? They took that away. I don't think that exists anymore. Hey! I want to get him before we get dead hard. 
Mm -hmm. We'll go to the scourge that's upstairs. There's actually two of them upstairs. That's kind of poggers. That's awfully poggers. These guys seem to be like choosing one gen at a time and then just hard slamming them. I think they booted in the exact same spot. Yes. The answer is yes, they did. Re subby wubby uwu. Chris, thanks for the five month resub. Welcome back, dude. Appreciate it, man. Thank you, buddy. They have too many boons. Too many boons. Pointless. There's no fucking point in trying to outboon. Outdo their boons. I just gotta let them have it. Is Dr. Good or bad? He's definitely on the bad side. Again, I don't think like I don't I don't like calling any killer bad because I don't think any killer is incapable of killing. I think every killer in this game is strong enough to kill survivors. And they all have like their strengths that are like interesting. But killer or but doctor is definitely on the weaker side compared to other killers. Like if you compare him to like, you know, the actual strong killers, he's kind of meh. Even nurse no blink? No, but no, because that's just playing stupid. Like what? That's like saying doctor playing with your toes compared to like what? That's just just don't just blink. Just use your power. What? There's no point in making comparisons if you're playing a killer in like a stupid way. Hey, bud. Gonna stop him from vaulting the window. He has his pallet here, though. We'll stop that pallet as well. Where does he go now, though? Whoa! That man hit me with the motherfucking lag tech, dude. What's your ping, brother? Actually, fine. Your ping's really low. What the fuck? Ever get Kate for your last sack? Is Kate my last sack? I was actually wondering who my last sack was. I didn't know. I mean, if I can find her. I like Doctor because I never have trouble getting into chases. Yeah, I mean, he's really good for finding people. He's not a bad killer. I mean, he's really good at finding people. His ch like his chase is good in terms of like getting downs. Like you can almost guarantee getting a down against like any survivor. It just the problem is it just takes a while, right? Like if, if the survivor plays smart, your down will take a while. And that's kind of the issue, right? Like the issue is how long it all takes. Like, like nurse can get it down by just bl like blink, blink, hit, blink, blink, hit, right? With doctor, it's like you gotta follow them around, shock like multiple times at like every pallet. Like it just takes a long, like holding W is really powerful against him. It just takes a long time in order for him to get his stuff going, you know? Which is why it can be such a pain in the ass. Do 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 do. Let's just shock him up. I know, go see. Let me finish the match, buddy. All right, and then I'll let you out. Okay. Give me a second, homie. All right, I got you. Oh, I got a boom here. Interesting. That's good to know. I don't even know if I want to snuff it. Like, I don't think I can out boon, like out snuff their boons. That Kate's setting a boon, and so is somebody else. Like, if, if it's convenient to snuff it, I'll do it just so they have to reset it. But I don't think I'm going to, like, drop this chase to snuff it. I don't think that's worth it all. That may actually running running into walls and shit. You got dead already? Can't tell. I don't think. Mm -mm -mm -mm. We got so many scourge hooks. I think every single hook this game has been a scourge hook. That's a fucking feels good, man. See, there's another boon. I'm telling you. They're boon and madman. I think that, I think that was the K doing the upstairs one, probably. I know, ghosty. Give me a minute, buddy, okay? I know. He keeps meowing at me. I guess he's downstairs. I heard him, but I guess I heard him downstairs. He's so cute. I keep looking over at him, and he's just adorable. What's he doing? He's just looking up at me and meowing. My cat? He's just looking up at me and meowing. He, I think he wants out of the basement. He's probably hungry or something. Or maybe he has to go to the bathroom. But I just want to finish the match first. 
I guess we do have, we do have four stacks of no way out and no way. We could just do it and then let them get the gens done. You know? Oh, whoever had the boot here actually rebooted. That's interesting. You're dead, buddy. You're dead. Oh, we got a Mori. We can Mori this guy. <gasps> That's poggers. That's kind of poggers. Okay, I'm gonna let him out while I'm while while I'm Mori this guy. Ghosty, come here, buddy. Ghosters has been released. Did the ace come up? Wait, did the ace do something? Is he near? What happened? What happened? Man just casually flies by. Wait, did the ace did the ace give us a flyby? He jumped into frame raised the more he finished. Interesting. Why? Why would he do that? Oh my god, all the gens are over here. He said, oh, I see you're busy. I'll just go. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry. Did I interrupt something? Oh, I apologize. <laughs> my man's, dude. My man's all up in that snowman biz. I think this guy's more able to, right? Dead, dead, absolutely dead. Three subby wubby oo woo. So bad. Well, let's go. What up? Streams Forty-seven months. Welcome back. Appreciate you. Yeah, all good. All good. All good. All good. I appreciate you catching them when you can. I mean, I know that like I don't really stream at the best hour for a lot of people's schedules, so you know, I get that. I've I know I've said this before on stream. I'm still kind of considering. Um, pulling my schedule back a couple hours or maybe a few hours like I'm thinking about streaming earlier I don't know I think it might be better but I'm not sure like instead of being like 9 to 3 being more like 6 to noon or, or like 6 to midnight or something I don't know I'm not, I'm not exactly sure Damn, dude. Fucking grave robbing out here. Isn't that pal a good one to keep up his doctor? Which one? I don't know. I don't even know which one I broke. I mean, to be fair, no pallet is pretty much just as good as a, as a bad pallet, right? Because you still get the hit no matter what. Like, why? I would say it's never a bad thing to kick a pallet. I mean, I guess maybe you can bait people into going there or something, but I don't know. This guy's not on death hook, right? I'm pretty sure this guy's the one that's not on death hook. If he ends up being on death hook and I waste a Mori, then I guess I'm just a scammer. But I'm pretty sure this guy's only been hooked once. Yeah, yeah, yeah that's right. You can bait people in there? I guess. Yeah, I don't know. I mean, I feel like if that's the only place they have to run to, then they're just going to get hit if there's no pallet there. So I, I guess to me, I don't really care about it. Borlord, have a good night, buddy. Thank you for chilling, my hand. If you don't want to get slugged for the 4k, true, that could be it. True, 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 true. Hmm. I think this guy's in a locker somewhere, but where? But where? A ferret, thanks for the sub. Welcome in, dude. Appreciate it, buddy. Thank you, man. This is her boons. So that's gonna go away when she dies. I don't even have to kick it. Phase one hatch already? 
Wrong. Because I'm on hatch. I don't motherfucking think so. And I got the power of Noed, dude. We're good. Now we can just chill and wait for him to tap the gate. And then we can go murder him. Augers. How do you know if you shot a comp spirit gamer? The doctor will laugh and you'll still get the, the blood points as well. Does he have an item to give me? I don't think he does. Bison toes, what up? He's not even trying. He's just running. He's not even attempting to like appease me with his toolbox. Look at him. Look at him. He's not even attempting. What is this? Oh, you stayed on that side, huh? No, Ed, baby. Poggers. And Amori. Let's go. Poggers. Woo. Let's go. Woo. Common Spirit doesn't prevent the score event though. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You still get the points for shocking, and also the doctor will laugh. He'll he'll have a he'll have a chuckle. He'll have a good giggle whenever you shock a Common Spirit gamer. So yeah, 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 you still get all the tells. You still get all the tells that you would normally get. Okay, I'm gonna turn off builds for for, for for the rest of the night since I'm not gonna be live too much longer. And I'll probably just do like a survivor game or two. The end. Cause that was the last one we had. No one, no one, no one has a banned combo, Toby. Like, I can't believe you would do this. Hey, don't blame me, dude. Don't blame me. Blame German Dingo. Not my fault. I, not my fault, man. I was just following the rules that have been presented to me by the build, you know? Actually, we still have, we still have the bonus blood points on killer, so I guess we'll just do more killer. Let's play a game of Blight. We haven't played Blight all day. Do we have dailies for people? Oh, we have dailies for a lot of people. Nemi, Executioner, wins. We have a 45k for twins, but I just hate twins. I'm almost debating on rolling it. Because they're like bugged right now, too. I'm, I'm rolling it. I don't care. <laughs> well, that's what I get. I guess that's what I get, right? I suppose what did I... Like, like really, what was I expecting? You know? Fine. It's fine. Um, I don't know if I like this build. Free hag game? Fuck no. Hell no. I don't give a shit about that 60k blood points. Hail to the hail. I'm just gonna roll it tomorrow. Hail to the hail no. Um. Corrupt. Infectious. Do we want pain res? I mean, we're gonna. We're, I'm planning on caging a couple people, but I think pain res might still be worth it. I think I'll slow on deadlock. Or, or sorry, I, 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 I think I'll throw on deadlock, and then maybe like. Yeah, fuck it. That's fine. Or we could get weird. Actually, we could get weird and put on stabiffle. I kind of want to get weird. I don't know how viable stabiffle will be on him. Probably not very, but I'll try. Hey, no problem, Joe Beningo. I got you, buddy. I got you, man. Don't sweat it, my guy. Doesn't doesn't DVD Dailies know you lease a, you lease a hundred subs for that? I know, right? They're trying to get him to do it for free out here. Please, I don't fucking think so, man. I don't motherfucking think so. Can I get a small loan of nine hundred ninety-nine thousand nine hundred ninety-eight? Or sorry, 999,998,999 channel points. No. No, you can't. No, you cannot. Nobody can. Ah. My first game of the day, I played Twins and got the bug. Disgusting. Really? I played against the Twins earlier. They didn't feel like they got the bug. The, like, the bug is like switching back to... Charlotte and then having your camera stuck at the ground or something, right? Isn't that what it is? Because, yeah, we played against the Twins earlier. They didn't seem like they got it all game, so I don't know. Is the Biffle viable on Nemi or Wesker? I would say it's very good on Nemi. It's, like, close to demo level good on Nemi, I would say. Like, if not, like, just as good. Well, yeah. I'd say it's, like, similar to demo in terms of how good it is on Nemi. So definitely on Nemi. On Wesker, I would say it's viable on Wesker. But, like... I feel like on Wesker, you probably want to hit people with your power at least once every chase. So I feel like you get less stabiffle value because like, I feel like if you're opting to go for basic attacks over power attacks and you're missing out on like the slowdown of getting people infected, 
So I feel like it's almost like counterproductive to a, one of Wesker's strengths. So I don't think it's bad on Wesker, but I feel like it sort of conflicts with like part of what makes his kit powerful, you know? Because I do think that is a thing that makes Wesker really strong. Like, if you make sure that you dash attack every, uh, everyone that you hook at least once before you hook them, like, if you just make sure everyone's infected before they get hooked, that means it's like it's like an additional soda. It's almost like a, it's it's kind of like how Pig, like, you know, when you, when someone gets off hook, they got to deal with the bear trap. It's kind of like that, except obviously nowhere near as long as a bear trap, but it, it's a nice little slowdown. Like, it doesn't seem like much, but when you're doing it all game, you get to the point where, like, a lot of the boxes get used up and they got to, like, travel really far for boxes and shit. Like, it gets pretty good, actually. You get some pretty good slowdown out of it. That was a pretty lucky hit. I was not sure what he was doing. No way this hits, right? It's got to be too far. I don't have double range. I only have one range. I wonder if the other range would have made the difference there. Probably not. But maybe. Where the fuck did he go? Way down yonder. What? Did he keep going? I don't even know where he went. That's really crazy. Interesting. What if they snuck around to the back gen? They had to have, because like, what else? Are they? Either that or they're waiting out crubs. Well, it wasn't live. I mean, I saw a scratch. I mean, it might have been live, but I saw a scratch marks. They kind of just randomly disappeared after a certain amount of time, or after a certain amount of distance. Damn, with two of them there, I figured if we throw out a random shockwave, we'd probably have a good chance of hitting at least one of them, but... No, they both went this way. I was wrong. This guy's got... Well, I guess they used the Shadow Step Totem. No, that was the obsession. I just kind of hit him without seeing. Not like this. Damn. I don't know why. I thought he would just blindly go in. Fuck. Now I'm being kind of an idiot. It feels bad. Okay, well this is a bit this is a bit silly. This is a bit foolish. Oh, who's this? No. That Leon got up pretty quick. Maybe they got Boone Unbreakable too. I don't know. Whole lots of Boons, man. Lots of fucking Boons, bruv. I think he's got a normal one, one hit on him here. Yeah. I should probably break out this wall eventually. Looks like he probably does have live though, I think. Man, man's getting pretty fucking far when he vaults. Where is he? Dude, this man is a fucking outside of the map. Just hold W gamer. Jesus. What is this? Who plays like this, dude? Motherfucking psycho shit. And they booting for like a, a fucking 300th time? The fuck is going on, man? The fuck is this, bruv? Damn, it's not in range. Fuck, I thought it was, but it wasn't. Pain. Dude, I think taking off that yellow range. Like, I feel like these would be, like, max range. And I feel like I'm not hitting them. And I'm wondering if taking off that yellow range is, like, affecting me more than I thought. You stay. Oh, my God. Everyone's a fucking outside of the map gamer, dude. I'd never expect people to just be an outside of the map gamer. But all these guys are doing it. It's throwing me off by so much. I'm just going to basement this guy. It's so odd. Also, Mike, hope you had a good holiday, too, dude. Okay, where's their 50 boons? There's probably one on the tractor somewhere. Maybe. Step in my goop. Do it. Step in my goop. I need them to step in my goop to get my daily, but I don't know if they're going to step in the goop. They might not be goopers. They might be non-goopers. They might be goop haters. Okay. 
We're getting some stabiffle stacks though. That's okay. That's okay. I guess we'll go ditch the spoon. Who has a problem with my people? Apparently these survivors. These survivors, apparently. Oh, gen rushers. Cheryl's just like AFK on hook, but I'll let her go. Hmm. How does Leon play this? Not a free thrower. Not a vaulter. Not a thrower. Oh, he's the obsession. Fuck. I keep forgetting. Shit. I keep getting him confused with Vittorio because I'm stupid. Like, can I even do this? Is this is this is this reasonable? I don't think this is reasonable. This is why I don't like I don't know if Stabiffle is like actually good on this killer or not. I feel like it might not be. So I'm not sure how reasonable it is to like guarantee a shockwave hit. He dead hearted it too. Fucking hell. Yeah, I feel like Stabiffle in this killer is not the play. I wanted to try it just to be spunky. But I feel like it's too much spunk. Like it's a little too much spunk. This feels like I'm just throwing. Like it doesn't even feel like I'm being smart or cheeky. It feels like I'm just literally throwing. I mean, we got him, but I could have had him down like fucking 30 seconds sooner, man. Fuck, man. Irresponsible levels of spunk. I agree. I agree. Too much. Too much spunk. Spunk overload. An overdose of spunk. What gen are they doing? Bam? Are they doing man? No. Hornfield gen, maybe? Yes. I see. Bye. That man's gonna hold W on the outskirts of the map. Here he goes. Here he goes, man. Here co Oh, actually, he's going inside the map. That's crazy. Step in my goop, man. Dude, everyone's terrified of the goop, brother. They don't want the goop. I'm telling you, every survivor is like horrified of the goop, dude. They don't want it. It's impossible to get the fucking pyramid head daily because nobody wants to step in goop. Crazy. Boo. Mm. Interesting set of gens we have. We don't really have any regression, which is unfortunate. Leon's broken. How'd that happen? Do they have deliverance? Leon. Motherfucking Leon. You actually just vault that? You psycho. What are you doing? What are you doing, you psychopath? Please stop. Please stop. Leon! Help me, Leon! Leon! This gen has no progress. Actually, it has like a it has like a hair. It has a hair of progress. A singular hair of progress. Yeah, he must have delivered it. That's interesting. Look at the kitty. Hi, kitty. Brandon Watts, thanks for the 13 months. Welcome back. I should have just did Nemesis for the Nemesis up. daily. It's double as prime. I feel like this day, I feel like Pyramid Heads daily is like way too reliant on survivors. Like, you need the survivors to do the thing that you want them to do. And if they don't do the thing that you want them to do, you just don't get your daily. And it's really sad. Like, I hate relying on survivors that much for the daily. Like, I just want to be able to, like, do it, you know? You gonna vault that? Wow, these guys are just not they're not they're just not buying it. Like I'm trying to sell them that I'm zoning them, and they're just not buying what I'm selling them. Like they're just not interested. At all. Kanye's poop hole. Thank you for the four months. Welcome back, man. Appreciate it, dude. Wahoo. Wahoo. I thought Victoria would get this done while I was gone. I guess not. I guess he got the fuck out of Dodge, dude. That man's got the fuck out. I'm literally, I'm literally just going to set some trail here because I know they're going to come back. And I just want them to be gooped, man. I just want them to be gooped up. Why won't they get gooped up? I just want them to goop. But they refuse to goop. They just won't goop. They will not goop. Oh my god, this has a ton of progress now. Jesus Christ, Ecclesi. No, I have to M1 them, dude. Oh god, this is... 
It's the worst because I feel like everyone but the fucking obsession is like letting me shockwave them all day. And the obsession is the one that's like refusing to let me shockwave. It's like the opposite of what I wanted out of Stabiffle. Like every other survivor is like not letting me M1 them and they're just basically eating shockwaves and that's it. And then this guy is like, yeah, what if I just juked every shockwave and made you M1 or sorry, yeah, it made you M1 me. Fucker. Oh, unless he dead hards it. I guess that's fair too. Oh, they got that done. I guess deadlock's in play. I gotta say, I gotta go back to main, but it is deadlocked, so I guess there's that. They got this gen done too, that's interesting. Good fake. Yep, fuck it, dude. Ah, uh, yep. Yeah. Why does it do that? Why does it check the wrong locker? Well, he'll die, but I'm gonna lose all my stacks and I'm gonna be stackless and they're probably gonna get that gen done. And I got nobody caged. Not a single person has been caged all game because no one stepped in goop all game. Life sucks. Life is pain. Fuck this daily. This daily sucks ass. Needing survivors to step in goop is bullshit because they just don't do it. They just don't step in goop. Sometimes they're just not goop steppers and then what, you know? Then, and then you're just fucked. What the fuck am I looking at, dude? What am I looking at right now? What are you guys doing? What is this? Guys, I'm losing to these survivors. What the fuck is happening? To be honest, though, this is kind of like, this is kind of current DBD meta, to be fair. Like, I can't even say, like, I'm losing to these survivors. This is actually, like, this is good gameplay, dude. You know? This is what it's all about, baby. It ain't about looping anymore. It's about holding W to the corner and then letting your team slam gens, you know? That's what it's all about, baby. Hold W, baby, let's go. We in there. Hi, Zarina. I peek up. I peek up sword. Hey! -ya! They might have that other gate open. I think I should just probably get the Cheryl. Get that easy 60k daily you have then? <laughs> That's going to be a fat no from me, dog. Yeah, I'm pretty sure Victoria's at the other gate and they're probably going to both get out. Yeah, 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 yeah. Mm -mm 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 -mm. can you play Blight like a Ray? I mean, I can play Blight, but not like a Ray, no. A Ray is a much better Blight than I am. That man has a lot more time and hours and he is much, much more skilled at that killer than I am. That's for sure. I can attempt to play Blight like a Ray and then probably miss my rushes a lot of the times and have horrible bump logic. I don't know how, like, people like a Ray that are, like, super cracked at Blight and have a bunch of, like, 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 experience and time in them. Like, they'll, like, put together, like, perfect, like, there'll be tiles where I feel like it's so hard to play Blight for me. Like, I can't seem to figure out how to get good bump logic, but then I'll watch a Ray do it and he literally just does it, like, instantly. Like, no reactions. Like, bam, 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 hit. Like, it's like perfect, like literally perfect. It's crazy. Like, it's actually crazy. I don't know how the fuck he does it. What if body blocker Hagmori? I'm gonna do a, I'm gonna do a game of Nemi for my daily. I gotta play some ads though, before it starts. But I'm going to play a game of Nemi to get that daily because the Nemi daily, at least I got to actually force the Nemi daily. I can't force this daily because, again, I'm just cucked. Like, if they don't step in the goop, they don't step in the goop, right? Like, if they would choose, like, if like if the survivors just choose to die rather than step in the fucking trail, then I just lose. <laughs> like, I literally just lose. There's just no winning that. Like, there's no way to possibly get it. So, at least with Nemi's, I could just force it, you know? I should probably run. Maybe I should run like. Yeah, I should run like Marvin's Blood and maybe the one where I get more from zombies too. What's the one where I get more from zombies? I can't remember. Oh my lord, that's a lot of P100s. I probably should. I'm going to take off Overcharge and put on Stabiffle. Stabiffle is quite good on this killer. What's the one where you get more from. Oh yeah, this one. Increased mutation. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm destroying zombies with tentacle strike. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That way I can just farm zombies here and there too. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, wait, this one gives you 100. Wait, this one gives you 50, but it makes them spawn faster. This one just gives you 100. That's weird. They do like very similar things. I'll take the one that gives you 100. Fuck that. I don't give a shit about those zombies respawning. Fuck them. They're useless half the time anyway. Fuck them. 
Nemesis is so underrated. He actually a S tier killer. Uh, don't know if I agree with that one there. Don't know if I'm gonna go. Yeah, I don't know if I'm gonna say yeah on that one. I think I'm gonna say no on that one. Yeah, I don't know. I don't think I don't think Nemi's S tier. S for suck. Got him. <laughs> suck tier <to your> killer. <laughs> Got his ass. Yo, it's like for GG's day. We got that last game. Cause yo, GG's dude. GG's, you guys played well, man. Dusty Noose and Eye of Whatchamacallit. Wait, so you play other games? Not on stream, no. Off stream, I play some other games, but even then, barely. Like, I play like Overwatch off stream with friends sometimes, and I fucking hate it. Like, I hate Overwatch, but there's just nothing else to play. So we sometimes play it together. Me and we, as in me and my friends. Um. I also play Ultimate Chicken Horse with my friends sometimes because that's a fun game. Um, 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 we, we, we recently got into Pummel Party again because they updated it. I'm so sad that's the main game again. Dude, I want to get people to play Borrow Trauma, man. I want to get people on, on fucking Borrow Trauma. Colin's got Borrow Trauma and he hasn't played it. But like, I don't know. I feel like everyone just kind of gave up on that game. Like, I, I, I don't know. Maybe just no one likes it. I was liking it, but I don't know. Because, because dude, you could have up to like 16 players. So it's like perfect, you know? Yo, Puppers, thank you for the raid, man. Appreciate it. What up, what up, what up, what up? Hope the stream went well. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Welcome on over. Welcome on over, failures. And yo, Puppers, thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Hope the stream went well, man. Lemon's obsessed with Borrow Trauma and plays it constantly. Dude, when we were first playing it, I was kind of the same way. I was literally playing it solo. Like, I would boot up and play it solo to try to learn more about it so that when we played as a group, I would, like, understand the game a little bit better to help us out. But then there's nobody played it anymore. And I was like, all right, well, I guess fuck me. So, yeah, it was kind of pain. I, I want to stack. But, yeah, I don't know, man. I mean, I'm down to play it again, like... Because, again, I don't really want Overwatch to be our main game either, you know what I mean? Like, I gotta be honest, I kind of agree, you know? Overwatch being the main game is not really the play, I'd say. Where are you crawling to, buddy? Re subby wubby uwu. Merry Crimmies. Yo, Nina! Motherfucking Nina! 40 months. How you doing, Nina? Good to see you. Appreciate the 40 month resub. Hope we're doing well. It's good to see you, Nina. Nina, I'm going to be all up in your DMs hitting you up again soon, by the way. Because I have been a lazy piece of shit. I've not been making any YouTube videos. But I'm feeling like less of a lazy piece of shit the last, like, recently. And I'm going to be uploading again. And you are God here at Thumbnails. And I am hitting you up for sure. That is happening. Just letting you know right now. Give me some tags. But it's good to see you, Nina. Thank you for the 40 months. You play Apex Tofu. Nah. I'm kind of like... I'm kind of over BR games. Like, I was having fun with Fortnite No Build for a while. But I feel like I just got bored of it solely because it was a BR. Like, I just don't think I can do BRs anymore. Like, I think I'm just kind of over them. I'm in Finland seeing my fam after three years. Oh, really? You're back in Finland? Oh, that's fucking cool. What the hell? Now watch me whip. Now watch me slay slay. Oh, 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 oh. Oh, how did that not hit her? I feel like it was on her. What do you mean? I got robbed. I got robbed. Not like this. What am I doing? I'm being a... I'm being a pleb, Nemi. A plemmy. I don't know what you're talking about, Swish. Hide and seek BR? I don't know what you mean. Zombie, get her. Get her, zombie. Useless. Trash. You trash. You trash, zombie. You trash. What am I? Oh my god, I just kind of freaked out. I kind of just freaked out and hit a button. That was kind of awkward. Let's not talk about it. Well, oh man, triple eruption, dude. Oh, I feel bad. I'm that guy. Oh, I'm that guy. To be fair, I'm playing Nemesis. They should expect it, you know? Every Nemesis, like, plays like a scumbag, runs scumbag perks. Nemesis is like the new scumbag killer, you know? So I feel like I gave them ample warning through my killer choice. You know? I feel nothing. Mm -mm -mm -mm. 
Do you think Marvin's Blood base kit would make Nemesis too strong? Um, no. But like, I don't know if it would be healthy, but I don't think it would make him too strong, no. Oh, we tier three. Damn, dude, that T-Virus sample does a lot for killing zombies. The killing zombies gives you a fucking lot. I didn't realize. Um, I'd rather M1 or... I'll take what I can get. They never even tap that one. The zombie's kind of here. But I feel like he's like half paying attention. Nemi's a fun killer, isn't he? Nemi's a really fun killer, huh? I bet you had fun this chase. I bet you had a lot of fun this chase, didn't you? Nemi's super fun, huh? We gonna BRs if you played Naraka Blade Point. No. Um, I think I saw some like streams of that. Yeah, it was like a fighting game BR or something, right? Dude, we kind of have a disgusting gen setup down here if we wanted to just hold down this side. Especially with the perks that we have. If we wanted to be a fucking a macro gamer, I don't think I'm going to, but if we wanted to, we can be a total douchebag with this with these gens. I don't really care. I'm mostly in this for the daily though. I don't actually care to like mega try hard like that. I mean, I don't play Nemi much, but I feel like that was close enough to land. Was it not? I guess not. I mean, apparently I'm wrong. I guess I don't play Nemi enough to know. Is she in the locker? She's in the locker, right? She's gonna head on me. Which locker? Which one? Fuck! I wasn't sure which one. I knew she was in there. I just didn't know which one. I thought I could bait it. She was too smart. That's a wall, dog. Hide or die. Oh, yeah. No, I didn't give a fuck about that game. That was one of those, like, this game's gonna kill DVD games. And I was like, no, nah, I don't care. Like, I don't know. That was, like, one of those games that everyone was, like, hyping up about killing DVD. And then I, I, I think I, wa I, that was one of those games where like I watched like five minutes of gameplay and I was like, yeah, this ain't gonna be it. Like this is not gonna be it, Chieftain. And I just kind of ignored it altogether. That's a boon spawn on the side of the hill like that. That's interesting. I don't think I've seen that. A totem spawn on like the side of the hill. That's really odd. Yeah, Nemi's fun. Yeah, he's really fun. Yeah. Just like VHS, dude. Yeah, the VHS thing is such a fucking joke. I, I, dude, I, I said it too the whole time that people were fucking talking about VHS. Like, shit was so cringe because, like, anybody that had a brain knew that that shit was straight copium. Like, literally copium out of their fucking minds. I think they got these gens done really fast, right? I mean, I'm assuming at least one of them had a bunch of progress, I guess. But I feel like there was four gens down here that I thought all had like no progress. And they got them done really fucking quick. Out of the way, ho! But yeah, VHS was never gonna give DVD any competition. Like I remember like DVD would like announce like a fucking double blood point weekend and people would be like, oh my God, behavior's scared. They're scared of VHS. They're doing this because they're scared and shit. And it was just like, bro, like, come on, dude. Like motherfuckers were like so copium out of their fucking minds. to think that DVD even like cared at all about that shit. I thought she would do the old double back, but I guess not. I might have to whip her here though. Well, yeah. Someone posted a tweet about how they were the only streamer streaming it and people were legit saying, well, it's Christmas, so everyone is with their family. Like, bro, come on, get, get off the copium. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Like, I feel like at this point, like VHS enjoyers are more trying to just like argue that the game isn't completely dead. Like no one even has any like false hopes that it's gonna like give any kind of competition to DVD at all. At this point, I feel like the VHS coat people are like literally just trying to argue that the game isn't like completely dead. They're like, no man, it has like 30 concurrent players, man. Like you, if you sit in, if you sit in queue for an hour, you can find a match. I totally swear, bro. Like I promise you, you just, it, it's an hour wait time, but you can get the same four players in every match. I swear. And it's like, okay, man, we get it. <laughs> like we get it, dude. 
G game's fucking dead. We get it. Oh. Oh. Are you gonna dead hard this? Does Nemesis actually need to save the best for last? I mean, nobody needs anything. I think he uses it really well, though, if that's what you're asking. Nobody, like, no killer needs any perk, I don't think. Especially save the best for last. That's not a needed perk on anybody, but... I mean, I guess you could maybe say, like, Trapper, like, needs corrupt intervention, but I don't know. I don't think anybody needs save the best for last. Nemi just kind of uses it really well. V okay, to, to be fair to VHS, VHS actually did have a lot of good things about it. I don't think VHS was necessarily a bad game. And like, that's the thing, like, I don't want to shit on VHS, like, the game, or, like, the devs. Because I think they made a pretty, like, interesting, unique game. Like, I think it wasn't a good enough or finished enough game. Where'd the blood go? Oh, wait, right here. I'm fucking stupid. Um, I don't think it was, like, a finished enough game to, like, you know, be legitimate DVD competition. Like, I think it needed a lot more stuff before it had any chance of, like being competition to DVD, but it was an okay game, right? It was more like, but I just can't help but make fun of like the fucking burnt out DVD streamers that were like, just like talking so much shit about how it was like gonna kill DVD. And again, like calling out the DVD devs for being like scared, you know, about like, like they're doing double blood points cause they're scared of, D of v VHS's beta killing their game and shit. Like that kind of stuff just like, was so amusing and it just it it makes me want to shit on them you know like it like i don't want to shit on like vhs like the game and the and the developers but like the community and the way not even the whole community just like the vocal mind like 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 the vocal majority of the community that was being like annoying about vhs i just want to shit on them i just want to i want to point and laugh at them and make fun of them you know like i just can't help it they were they were just so stupid and obnoxious about their dumb opinion and i just want to make fun of them What's up, South Robin? Yeah, it probably won't be for too much longer, but I am right now, yeah. VHS was a cool concept, but it can't complete. It can't compete. It just needed a lot more. Like, it needed a lot, lot, lot more, I think. Um, I don't know. Like, I think it was a cool game. It was definitely interesting in its own way. I mean, I personally think that, like, the... Like, for me personally, I couldn't get into the... Uh, the actual actually the more i think about it the actual gameplay of vhs ended up being not very fun so maybe 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 i take it back it was an interesting game but i feel like just the actual gameplay loop was not really something i found enjoyable at all to be honest like i it felt like ambush gameplay on both sides like the more i'm thinking about it the more i'm like yeah i don't know if it needed more features or if it just needed to be a better game maybe it just needed to be a better game the more i'm thinking about it Like, I feel like the way combat worked in that game was basically just ambushing. Like, can I have your med kit? Oh, I didn't hit the tentacle. Like, as survivor, you just get weapons, then set up ambushes for the killer. And as killer, you just do the same thing. You just, like, set up an ambush, right? You, like, use your abilities to try to get it down. If you get, or, or, or sorry, to, to get a hit. If you get the hit, cool. Or if you don't get the hit, also cool. And then you wait for your cooldowns and rinse and repeat. And then basically, you just hold corners and then... I don't know, basically, like, you just hold the corner and then, like, make them not able to turn the corner without getting hit. And that's how, like, both sides played combat, and I just didn't really like it. Mm -mm -mm -mm. I feel like that loud attitude hurt VHS, too. It made a lot of the people decide they'd rather not play with them. Yeah, exactly. Like, again, like, look at me. Like, I'm, like, I'm, like, bitter about VHS for no reason. Like, again, like, the devs of VHS all seem like very nice people. And the game, again, like, from just, like, a outside, completely unbiased point of view, the game was interesting, right? Even though it wasn't my type of game. Like, it wasn't, like, my go-to game in terms of gameplay. It was interesting, though. Like, they made an interesting, cool game that was at least enjoyable. Like, to me, I enjoyed it for at least, like, three or four days before I kind of got sick of it and was like, yeah, this really isn't for me, you know? So, like, regardless, I still liked it. I thought it was a cool game. It wasn't something I would play for more than a week, but it was still interesting. But, like, I can't help but, like, shit on it because of those fucking people. Like, those people just, yeah. Like, I feel like had those people just been less obnoxious about the game i don't know man maybe attitudes would be a lot different towards it who knows or maybe it's just me i don't know yeah it wasn't you're, you're not wrong switch it wasn't the vhs it wasn't like the vhs community as a whole it was just select people 
it was like select people that were burnt out on DVD that were just like, I don't know, using VHS as like a way to try to shit on it, essentially. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Same shit with Home Sweet Home? Yeah, Home Sweet Home was a joke, though. That game had no chance of fucking being any form of competition. That game was a scuffed mess. Like, VHS at least was, like, again, like a somewhat solid game. Whereas, like, I feel like Home Sweet Home was, like, I don't, bro, I don't know. That game was a, that game was a motherfucking train wreck, IMO. I don't know. I don't know about that. Using VHS as a weapon, exactly. Exactly. And again, it makes me feel bad. Because again, I feel like I've been kind of rude towards VHS. Like, I feel bad for like... Like, like if any of the VHS devs have ever like been lurking in my stream or something, I would feel really bad. Because I feel like I've probably been like overly disrespectful to them. Because again, I have a lot of respect for game devs. And I hate when people are like mean to game devs. But I just like, I can't help but like take the opportunity to shit on VHS's failures just because of how annoying it was to hear all like the burnt out DVD streamers talk about how, like, I don't know, just hearing all the shit talk about DVD and using VHS as a weapon against it. I just can't help but like be petty back. Like, I, just, I don't know. I just can't help it. And it sucks because I feel like I'm being a dick, but like, I just can't help it. The entire popularity of your game relies on other people hating their main game. It's not good. Nobody ever saw the good in VHS. They only talked about how, how it's better than DVD. Yeah, true. True, true, true. Like even in like VHS's discord, half the time if you went in there, people would just be talking about DVD. They'd be like, oh yeah, this is so much better than DVD because of this, this, and that. And also, oh yeah, like this is better than DVD. It's similar to DVD because of this, this, and that. Like, it felt like it was like mostly DVD talk even in like the VHS Discord, which was interesting too. It's just a cool new game, yeah. Like, if, if I just try to look at it as just like what it like, it, like, if I look at it the same way I looked at Evil Dead, like, Evil Dead was just like a cool new game to play for a while, right? And then once you get bored of it, you just put it away and then stop paying attention to it, you know, and that's all it is. It's just something you watch for a little bit and then you and then you, you play it until you're done with it and then you just stop, you know? So if I could just look at VHS the same way, then I actually enjoy it, right? It's a good game, it was a good experience. Like, I liked it, I liked having it, but I don't know. Where's your Fog Whisper badge? There you go. Sorry, I forgot to put it up from the Scrim Knights. All right, guys, that was my last one. It's kind of late. It's like past 4 a.m. It is very, very, very late. I think I'm going to get the fuck on up out of me all. Re subby um, wubby uwu. 11 months she would. Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. I'm gonna get on up out of y'all. Yo, Fireside, thank you for 11 months. Welcome back, buddy. Appreciate it, man. Thank you, dude. Thank you for the support, my guy. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Um, I'm gonna raid Hul Sam. Uh, 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 she used to be Box Ghost. I haven't really, like, heard from her much in, like, a long time, but she's always been a pretty wholesome gamer. Um, she's a fellow Fog Whisperer, right? She's a Fog Whisperer. Yeah, she's a Fog Whisperer. She's definitely a Fog Whisperer. Uh, I've not really like talked to her much lately because I feel like we're on very opposite schedules and stuff and we've kind of just been like obviously like doing our own thing and stuff but she's always been a super wholesome a super wholesome person I, I can never think of a bad thing to ever say about Sam she's always just a good a good fella a good a good feller a good fellerette I don't, I, don't, I, don't, I don't know what the term is go hang out with her go hang out with her go hit her with a get rated nerd debated and chill with her uh she's playing survivor I'm sure you guys will have a good time um what killer you have the most add-on stashed probably Billy I leveled up Billy a bunch at one point, but I don't know. Even that isn't really a lot. I don't know. I, I I level up all my different killers, so I have no idea. Anyway, I'll be back tomorrow night with more games. Thank you guys for chilling and hanging out. Hope you guys had an awesome Christmas again. Thank you guys for chilling and vibing as always. I love you, nerds. Uh, 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 is there anything else to say? No. Uploads on YouTube will come back soon. I'm going to be uploading like normal content again to YouTube, like randomizers and, and adept videos and stuff. That's going to be coming back very soon, like within the next few days. So if you guys have been missing that stuff, just keep an eye on the YouTube. That stuff will be back up on there very, very soon. And uh, yeah, I'll, I'll catch you guys tomorrow night. I love you guys. Hope you guys have an awesome rest of your night. Sugar, it's good to see you on the way out. I hope you're doing well down under. 
Have a good night, guys. I'm out of here. See ya. Goodbye. Goodbye, friends. I love you all. Goodbye. 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 I'm leaving. Goodbye. I'm out of here. Goodbye. Goodbye.